Hello, everyone. Hi. How's everybody doing? Hey. Look, guys, we made it. I see Kim. I see Kimmy. I see, I see the Glimpy. Glimpy. I'm playing more Metal Gear Solid 2 since Liberty. <laughs> she said, eek, scary. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. It was very dramatic. Yes, I am sorry. Should we uh, wait a little bit for everyone? I don't know. Whoever <laughs> everyone might be. It's pretty much just Kim, gonna... where Tina at? You two were talking a second ago. Yeah. Give her a kick and tell her to get on over here. I'm cool with letting it ride one more time. Okay. Before everyone starts showing up. Well, that's fine with me. Yeah. The game was probably pretty loud. I want to do things on Restream, but it won't let me because you're not an affiliate yet. What do you What do you want to do? I want to just like do fun little things that we could do on a Loria stream. Like what? I don't know. Like, I, like she got all kinds of like fun emotes and stuff. Oh yeah, we need to make the emotes. Oh, that's it. I have an idea. Uh, what I want for the emotes. For our emotes. You should be able to if if you're still subscribed to Aloria. I don't know if you are. I don't know when's the last time you've been in there. Um, so I don't know. Oh, if I have, have to be there all the time? No, no. I, you just need a current subscription. I. Uh, when was the last time you gifted me one? I don't know. It's been a while. That's yeah. why I don't know. I don't yeah. know if you have a current one. And it came to a good choice from what we talked about earlier. What, uh, is that going to be a surprise? Or, do you guys, or what did you guys come up with? Declaration of Independence. The Declaration. I'm gonna steal the President's Declaration of Independence. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna I'm steal, gonna the, steal the Lincoln Memorial. The Lincoln Memorial. I kind of want to wait until Tina and or Louis show up so that you know we have some more people to talk to about. That's this. what. That's what I'm saying. Like I'm willing to wait a little bit. I don't know where everybody else is. What is everybody? I gave them a heads up. I don't know. Kim, can you hear us all right? Yes. Can you hear us okie dokie? Oh, Chrissy's here. Hey, Chrissy. Hi, Chrissy. Let's see. Okay, well, Tina and I came up with the choice that you would be Snake and Jingles Liquid. The reason the Snake is skilled soldier, you don't need the genes to be a good soldier. And Jingles is Liquid because he evil. <laughs> <laughs> and she says, yeah, I can. Good. We're probably going to get started soon, Chrissy. Um, we're kind of waiting for other people to show up. But yes. We'll probably get started here in a minute or so. Because at this, because remember we were all waiting for Tina last yeah. time. We were all like, you know, let's just go. She'll catch up. Which, by the way, she did. She told me she caught up. She told me she caught up also. Yeah, we will have. But to. I want to see her live reactions to oh, stop. I know, because we're trying to share this thing. There's with... Tina. Oh, there she is. Finally. Don't mind me. I was just bad mouthing you. <laughs> yes, she said sorry. I showed up a little late. That's okay. We're ready to get started then. All right. Cool. Are you letting this ride out? I'm sorry, I just... Da, 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 da. Mm -hmm. I, what did the kids say? Vibin'? Yeah, vibin'. <laughs> just vibin'. Kimmy says, I will try to not fall asleep this time. Ha ha. I was trying to think about what, we, what I want our channel points to be. Our channel points? Yeah. Explain that to me. Uh, people get earn points uh, to unlock specific things that you specify. Ooh, look, um, it's Snick. By being um, active in yeah. the, the streets. Okay, kind of like what... Oh, okay. Now, yeah, Aloria does that. She has beards. Gebs has <laughs> cookies. I, what, I'm what trying to figure have? out what we want. Yeah. Tina says, I got good sleep beforehand, so there's no way I'm falling asleep. Bap. <laughs> All right. Welcome back to the channels of Metal Gear Solid. Can you hear the game okay? You guys I think let it's, us I think know. I left it where it was before. If you leave oh no, it. the game is muted. What? That's why. We were the only ones enjoying that awesome theme song? Yep. Man. 
I made an oopsie. I sorry. No, I, I'm not berating you. I sorry. Well, I am giving you a hard time though. <laughs> it's not my fault. I'll also be taking notes. Awesome. So Tina, before we get started, I want to ask how much of do you remember? Yeah, because you caught up on Metal Gear Solid One. How much of Metal Gear Solid 2 did you catch up on? Because I didn't hear you say anything about Metal Gear Solid 2. And if you have caught up, I want to know... Um, Where you at? What, uh, what you remember. Kind of kind of a short version, if you can. I'm glad you like the thumbnail, Kim. Yes, I am very happy with the thumbnail, too. It will make more sense as in we time. Play. In time. Phew, 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 phew. Checking my dog tags. Basic actions. How many dog tags you got? I I <laughs> got a lot. Jingles looks really shooketh. What was that? Tina, uh, Kimmy said uh, Jingles looks really shooketh. <laughs> yeah. I, uh... Smiter's only beaten the game like a couple times. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Don't worry about these other save files. These save files right here. These ones are red. Which means I've beaten them. Okay. Uh, I think I got enough on this. Yeah, see, I haven't touched hard or extreme. I should, though. Uh, oh, God, I Luka, think I Luka. have Luka. enough in the tanker chapter to have unlocked uh, the Bandana Nene oh, and, uh, and uh, Stealth Camo. Mm -hmm. I think. Kim says, like a couple? Ha, he probably beat it like a bunch of times. Well, on the original PS2? Yes. Yes. If we if we were to hook up our, our PS2, there would be like on a whole number. A whole other yeah. stuff. Yeah. I like this to is play the, this. the HD remastered uh, version on the PS3. Yes. So. And the major difference is, is that just it looks cleaner and it runs smoother. Yes. That's it. It's just an overall performance overhaul. Otherwise, it's the exact same as subs a substance. Metal Gear Solid 2 substance. Subsistence. No, subsistence was MGS3. Hmm. Double check. I don't know. Yeah. Because, because it's all like, which version of Metal Gear are you playing? Like all the games you stream. You have substance. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it is substance, right? Yes. I suppose I'll just get started then. Tina disappeared. Uh-oh. What's Rip up? Tina. <laughs> Should I just get started? I don't know. Where did mm. she go? I don't know. Where did she go? I made a move, see. Metal Gear. There we go. Oh, you got it? I could have just hit cancel, I realize. Oh, she's typing. Hold on. Okay. Jeez, leave her alone. <laughs> Come on, bro. All right. In that case, I'll get started. I want to. I don't. Uh, I don't do want, want her to know? be distracted from <laughs> typing. That's that's it. I okay. want her to be right. to be right. able to pay full attention. I can wait. I can wait. Uh, what do you want to do in the meet? You want to do Poddex? You want you want to talk? You want to do a Would you rather from would the Poddex? Right? Yeah, while we wait. Okay. Would you rather? Would you rather? Okay. We just won't do the ones when we actually record on Sunday. Okay, yeah. As a game. Well, dude, there's a whole deck. I'm still doodling my Pokemon trainer. Interesting. Trying to be good at perspective. After all, I will murder you two silly dudes. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, what is this game? This game this is, is a really good question, Chrissy. This game is Metal Gear Solid 2 Sons of Liberty. Yeah. It, it came out in 2001, I believe. 2005, I believe. And I only know, I only guess, no, that's, uh, sorry, I'm thinking of Snake Eater. Yeah. Yeah, 2005 was like the yeah. end of, uh. It's because 2005 also saw DMC3. Yeah. That was the end of the PlayStation 2's life cycle. Yeah. Well, you definitely got Because right. the next year, 2006, yeah. is when... Yeah, I think you're right. 2001. Main series. Uh, 
Tina talked, so I'm gonna read that for you. Released. Tina says, I last remember us fighting a Russian girl on a ship, and we knocked her out pretty easily after traversing around the ship, getting dog tags, and bleaching our eyes from the <laughs> insides of the lockers. Uh, we got our first lethal weapon. I also remember uh, went on a stealth mission inside the insides of the ship, running across metal bridges and being chased by security guards. I think that's about it. And that's still a very brief sh uh, rundown. Okay, you remember that we we found the Metal, metal Gear, Gear, the Metal Gear that uh, the Marines were working on. Yeah, called Ray. And uh, Do you remember it, that? It's meant to be developed as a means of fighting other Metal Gear. Yeah. And then <clears throat> Ocelot showed up, had some trippy, trippy things happening with Ocelot. Um, he apparently had uh, grafted one of Liquid's arms onto himself where he had lost his other arm previously. Yeah, she's saying, yeah, I remember we found Metal Gear. And uh, it seems that Liquid might be taking control mm -hmm. via that arm. Yeah. Hey, Chrissy, if you have any questions as we're going along, ask Tina. Yeah, it's just uh, 2001, by the way. This game came out in 2000. So, let's see. The game came out in 2001. The game takes place between 2007 and 2009. Yes. Oh, by the way, these games take place in the near future. <laughs> well, as all it the, was. All of them do. Yeah. Uh, based on their release dates. Yeah. Because that sort of... Kojima always had that feeling that technology would advance incredibly quickly. Yes. Shall we? I think we're ready. All right. Yeah, the Metal Gear to end all Metal Gears. Yeah, you remember. So yeah, it was weird. Ocelot looked like he was getting taken over or something. And uh, then uh, the whole place blew up. And it kind of seems like Snake didn't get out of there. But we'll see what happens. Yep. Alright, I believe this is the file that we had when we last took on. Kim says she finished her polka doodle. Oh, nice. And Tina says, let's do this. Now pay very close attention. Now remember, snake fell into the ocean. Otacon collied for him. It's like, snake, what happened? Snake. Snake. My bestest friend. That's a cute doodly do. Okay. Oh, it's super fun, Chrissy. I, uh, it's one of my, well, Metal Gear Solid and Metal Gear is just my favorite series, mm -hmm. video game series overall. Snake, do you remember the sinking of that tanker two years ago? Of course. Terrorists blow a hole in an oil tanker full of crude barely 20 miles off the shore of Manhattan. Your classic nightmare. It didn't take long for the government to put an oil fence around the whole mess. And then that massive offshore cleanup facility went up inside. The big shell. I hear the cleanup isn't quite over yet. It takes time, but in the meantime, the shell's become a landmark, a symbol of environmental protection. It doesn't look bad. It looks cute. Approximately six hours ago, the big shell was seized by an armed group. Do we have an idea? Former members of the Navy SEAL Special Anti-Terrorist Training Squad dead cell. Russian private army members may also be involved. It's a highly trained group, and they have the big shell under complete control. What makes him think they can get that much? There was a government-sponsored tour going on at the Big Shell that day. Hostages, huh? A VIP from one of the major conservation groups, and one from our own government. The most important person in a sense. The most important person? James Johnson. 
The President, President James the Johnson. Johnson met, the terrorists intend to blow the big shell out of the water. And the crude will ignite, turning the Manhattan Harbor into an inferno. That's not the worst case scenario. If the chlorides being used to decontaminate the seawater go up with the oil, toxins containing catastrophic levels of dioxins will be released. In other words, the bay's ecosystem will be wiped out, and the sea will turn into a toxic soup for centuries, becoming the worst environmental disaster in history. You have two mission objectives. One, infiltrate the offshore decontamination facility Big Shell and safeguard the president and other hostages. And two, disarm the terrorists by any means necessary. You should know that SEAL Team 10 is also conducting a rescue operation. joint effort? No. Foxhound remains a covert body. Don't alert them to your presence. That is an order. This is Snake. I'm now inside strut A of shell one. How are things? We're in luck. Looks like there are no sentries posted here. What's the visibility? The lights on the plant struts are functioning. I won't have to use the IR goggles. Any problems? There was a brand new hole cut through the oil fence. There's someone else besides me that wanted to get in badly. That's not possible. What about SEAL Team 10? They landed on the roof of the big shell as planned. And by the way, Snake, we're changing your code name for all following communication. What's wrong with Snake? Just a precaution. You are now designated Wyden. All right, Ryden. You've already covered infiltration in VR training. I've completed 300 missions in VR. I feel like some kind of legendary mercenary. Okay, we'll skip that part. Make sure nobody sees you. If you need to, contact me by codec. The frequency is 140.85. When you want to use the codec, push the select button. When we need to reach you, contact you, the codec will beep. When you hear that noise, press the select button. The codec's receiver directly stimulates the small bones of your ear. No one but you will be able to hear it. All right. I'll contact you if anything changes. First, make your way to the upper section of the big shell. How do I get up to the next level? There's an elevator at the far end of that area. Use that. Sounds good. Your new sneaking suit uses electrofiber technology, a byproduct of fiber optics research. The texture isn't far removed from rubber, but the material protects against a wide range of toxic substances. The suit itself has a wide array of built-in sensors. It is referred to as smart skin in military R&D. Data about damage to different regions of the body, including blood loss, is exchanged between the suit and the intravenous nanomachines to create a feedback system. There's a lot of pressure on my torso. Relax. The suit applies varying pressure to major internal organs to maximize performance and safeguard their functions. They call this the skull suit in Foxhound. Skull suit seems appropriate somehow. The hatch with a circular handle will open into the elevator area. Locate the hatch first. Copy that. Moving on to main mission objectives. Okay. Look at this game. Look at this game. Look at this game. Look at this right here. So, so we are Snake. Now called no, Raiden. No, no. Snake no more. Yeah. Um, Snake. Snake. Now called Raiden. Um, and we're infiltrating the big shell. Which is an oil refine, well, an oil cleanup rig that is cleaning up the big oil mess from the tanker that exploded two years ago. And uh, they're terrorists that took over the big shell that have a whole bunch of hostages, uh, including an environmentalist and the U.S. president. Wah! 
And so we gotta go in and we gotta save the president. Takes off sunglasses. <laughs> I gotta save the president. Kim says, Snake sounds a lot lighter than in MGS1. Yeah. <laughs> I'm looking at that game. Why he walk like that? Also, his, uh, um, his, uh, sneaking rolling, suit. Yeah. Rolling is different. Oh, yeah. Check this out. <laughs> he does cartwheels <laughs> instead now. Even my three-hit combo is different. Check this out. <laughs> <laughs> Of course they pick the president. Every terrorist goes after the president. <laughs> or the president's daughter. Or the president's daughter. Let's not forget about those. I don't know how much you want to work out your grip level before we move on from I, this area. I, I would love to max it out. Let's go swimming! Yay! Yay! Unlike in MGS1, which makes you sink like a rock right away, yes. you can uh, swim in this one. Swim. <laughs> I don't like his walk, but he's got cool fighting These moves. are the basic <laughs> controls for swimming. When you're on the surface, you can swim in corresponding directions using the up, down, left, and right movement of the left stick. Push the punch button to dive down from the surface. Okay. As long as it has to do with the Stroke the water yes. and move forward by pushing the punch button. Because remember in, uh, to swim Resident Evil 4, Change we have to go save the president's the daughter. Step. That's right. Up will take you up, well, down yeah. takes you lower. Left and right to face those directions. You should beat that game for the channel. You the should beat that game for the channel. Appear mm. under your life mm. gauge while you're underwater. Well, we got to think about what we're going to do for Spooky Month. <gasps> That's right. We can't, we can't use all our spookies in one month. Are we going to Are we gonna have a stream every weekend on Spooky Month like we did last time? I think I'd like that. Did you guys like that last last year? I liked it. <laughs> Tita says, stop calling us, we're gonna lose oxygen! <laughs> Therm Yep, go and pick up the thermal goggles. Beep, 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 beep. Look different in this one. They do. We showed it off a little bit uh, in the last chapter. Yeah, you're right. It's too bright, it hurts. I'm just picking up some collectibles before we move on. Yep. I think okay. you got pretty much everything. Let's look at this. Metal Gear 2 Guns of Patriots. Huh. You know, I'm still trying to figure this Easter egg out. Yeah. I don't, don't know, know if it's... it was like a proto-title to the game or whatever. Maybe. You know, they were going to call this game 3. Because hmm, you know, Because, you know, uh, at the end of Metal Gear Solid 1, when mm -hmm. it's all like... The third one. Oh, the third one. Yeah. Interesting, yeah. Yeah, because they were going to do it to represent the three. Uh, Tina says, I love those streams. They were so much fun. Kim says, Jingles, you said y'all going to play RE7, Thunk. Are you? Mm -hmm. uh, Spider Might. Mm -hmm. Especially since we're going to be on uh, Twitch from now on. Oh, yeah. Something's up. That looked like he had a headache. Mm -hmm. hmm. Colonel, I've sighted an enemy sentry. AN-94 and a Makarov. Those grenades, all his equipment, is Russian-made. Must be a Golukovich man. A Russian private army that was in line to work with the Shadow Moses Takeover Group four years ago. What's their stake in this one? They must have made a deal, an arrangement with the terrorists. They become a band of mercenaries, an army without a country. A soldiers without borders. We'll get to that. What's a Russian gunship doing here? <laughs> Colonel, what's a Russian gunship doing here? <laughs> I have no idea, Raiden. Sneak, sneak. Sneaky, sneaky. Sneaky, uh, sneaky, lol, lol, Raiden. I, I am to snake. Lol, 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 lol. Lol, 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 lol. Hold on a sec. What the... 
That was weird. Who was that really cool guy? Who was that cool guy? Colonel, there's definitely another intruder in here besides me. That's not a possibility. Not a team. Looks like a solo job. One man. We may not know who he is, but he managed to take care of every sentry in the area. They're all out cold. Wow. Whatever he is, he's got some skills. We need to get an ID. But for now, you can take advantage of the okay, situation what's going on? and get to work. <laughs> There's a terminal in Was front that of the Ocelot elevator. Or Solidus? No. <gasps> Did you say nerd? Not nerd. <laughs> no. Did you say nerd? <laughs> Use the now you know I didn't say to nerd. The shells facilities network. <laughs> then what? Pull up the map of the structure. That'll let you activate the Soliton radar. The Soliton radar? True. That radar came in useful during VR training. A radar system uses biological magnetic fields as input. These estimated enemy positions are projected onto a map according to reference points collected via GPS signals and field personnel reports. We need to get to the map through the Big Shell's node to put this data processing to practical use. The node unit is about three feet high, should be colored blue. Each area has at least one. How do I gain access? Just push the action button in front of the node. The nano machines in your body will take care of the security clearance and allow you access to the node. Complete the procedure before those sentries gain consciousness. If they spot you, you won't be able to gain access for a while. Stay on guard. Got it. Got it. Okay. Time to rescue the president. No, no. I yet. I haven't seen that yet. No, they know that we're going to rescue the president. Right. All right, so what? I just I just tap the touch screen? Just tap it. <laughs> well, that doesn't look like fun at all. <laughs> <laughs> Although I do like the handprint that fades away there. I do I like that, too. Cool. Ah! <laughs> Chrissy says, no. <laughs> <laughs> Tina says, stealth time. That's right. Should I do Smiter or Smitles? You can do Smiter. Okay. It's not like I'm going to be playing her, 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 You played a little bit last time. I did. Let's see. It's fine. Okay. You're, you're the real sneaky snake anyway. That's right. Don't you forget it. I, 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 I wouldn't <laughs> dare. <laughs> Nationality? UK. UK. UAE. UAE. Uganda. Turns out we were in Uganda the whole time. Oh, it was Uganda. Yeah. I guess we knew the way the whole time. Shot. Uh, Tina says, is no one going to mention those unconscious bodies that were on the floor? Hey, don't worry about those don't guys. Don't worry about those. They're not hurting anyone. Didn't you see them get ragdolled in the cutscene? Yeah, that was pretty red. Yeah. So this game is different from Metal Gear Solid uh, 2, or 1. And that you have to go every area. You need to unlock the Soliton radar yep. by accessing the node. Yep. In every single area. I believe you'll find it's called the, the nerd. Exactly the same one. It no. maps the terrain as well as the position of enemy personnel. It's one of the things that I actually don't really like about this game very much. Yeah. But if you play on super easy mode, then the radar is automatically unlocked. Yeah. And the blue cone shape represents their field of vision. How did they get knocked the unconscious? Uh, whoever that guy was on the, on the elevator. On the elevator. He did it, probably. It gets jammed easily, I'm afraid. It's all made from currently existing technology. You won't be able to use it in an area with strong harmonic resonance, so be careful. The Big Shell's layout map should now be available after touching the Start button. How do I save the mission data? I've set aside proprietary frequency for saves. And an analyst to work on the data. Yeah, yeah, yeah. is it mailing? Jack, is everything all right? What are you doing here? Jack, can you hear me? Rose, you're not supposed to be involved. What's going on? Jack, I'm a part of this mission. Colonel, what the hell is going on? Brighton, meet the mission analyst. She'll be overseeing the data saving and support. Why her? The Foxhound analyst that was supposed to take part in this mission was in an accident. Rosemary was brought in as a replacement. An accident? 
And according to the files, Good she question, Tina. Than anybody else. We will find the answers may be in the soon. service, but an intelligence <clears throat> analyst is no field officer. Not to worry. She has our technical staff at her disposal. She's never been a part of a field mission. This is insane. I have my own reasons for selecting her for this mission, soldier. Colonel, I fail to see. I know your VR training performance in and out, but sometimes that's not enough. You're familiar with the Shadow Moses incident? You know I covered it in VR. If there's a crucial tactical detail that case taught us, it was the power of the operative's will to survive. I was trained to fight. My personal feelings have no place in a mission. Mm. We've learned that it doesn't work that way. And on the field, you need all the help you can get. Jack, you're stuck with me whether you like it or not. Rose. You need someone to watch your back. But I have conditions that need to be met, Colonel. What is it? I'll perform my duties and save that mission data. But I'm aware that technically I'm not part of the mission control team. After all, I'm just a normal girl who's worried about Jack. But that means, Colonel, that I am not required to follow your orders outside of my immediate duties. Jack is not simply a field personnel for me to track. His safety comes first to me, not the mission. And because of that, I will be monitoring and keeping a record of every communication you have with him, Colonel. Mm. Given the circumstances, you're free to do what you see fit. Hey, I prefer this to being kept in the dark waiting. I'd like to make a request, if I may. Of course. His handle is Raiden. For the duration of the mission, could you call him that? Yes, sir. All right, Raiden. Let me know when you're ready to turn in a save. The proprietary save frequency is 140.96. I just switched frequencies. Jack? What? <laughs> Immediately. <laughs> you just, do you remember what today is? Is there something oh, boy. about it? Isn't there? I can't remember. I'm sorry. Oh, well. I'll keep trying till I hear the answer. I'm gonna let you go now, Jack. Take Literally care. just said, don't call him Jack. <laughs> I just love it. Uh oh, I, uh -oh. Got, I gotta get hidden. I gotta get scarce. Right, the enemy sentry is regaining consciousness. Be careful, Jack. Find somewhere to hide until the elevator arrives. They sound like you a couple. Stay mm, out weird. Of sight. Yeah, weird that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm under enemy fire. Secure the perimeter. Ah oh boy. Dagnabbit, I messed up. I messed up. I messed up. Run at him. Get him. Who's that? <laughs> Run. I'm running, I'm running, I'm running, I'm running, I'm running. White bird, white bird, white bird! Oh, I'm the best! You better not be asleep. Wake up! <laughs> hmm. Bro, really? They are cute, though. Hmm. They are cute. <laughs> Alrighty. It's time. Let me take this off. Ladies and gentlemen. The terrorists call themselves Sons of Liberty. Sons of Liberty? The name of their leader is Solid Snake. The name what? of their leader is Solid Snake. The hero of Shadow Moses? So Boom. That's why he changed my code name. Right, but he can't be the Solid Snake. He died two years ago on that oh, okay. tanker hmm. after he blew it sky So it's just high. some guy that's using Snake's name. Yes. Could he have survived? Maybe. Maybe. Not they say chance. it's Solid Snake. Well, he's going around saying, I'm Solid Snake! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> did, they, did they say, show the name and the voice yep, actor? Yep, I'm, I'm Quentin the Flynn. Quentin Flynn. There yep. are no sentries, but it would only take one to spot me in this That's light. right. You never this is not Solid Snake. Training after all. This is Raiden. Stay extra Raiden. sharp until you can find a node to log in from. What about the commandos? SEAL Team 10 has landed on Strux B and See? C. Tina's, Tina's, yeah, Tina's, Tina's been paying attention. Yeah. Yeah. Tina's spider sense was tingling. <laughs> Strut B? Excuse me. Look at this beautiful boy. <laughs> the big shell is comprised of cells <laughs> one and two. Oh, another consists snake? Consists of a central hmm. core and six struts surrounding it. So the whole thing is shaped like two hexagons connected end on and end. And that's the big shell. Exactly. Yep. 
and you're on the oh, yeah, I can press R1 to zoom in. Well, you already showed them that. Yeah. Look, there's a little riding down there. Hi, Ryden. Hi, Ryden. First, for me to not know. notice. Hmm. Log into the network. That's true. Got it. Quentin Flynn does not sound like David Hayter. Beautiful, wonderful David Hayter. He got long hair. I like. Yeah, you do. <laughs> yeah, he's a skinny, pretty boy. You'd like him. I gotta get the M9 first. Kimmy's favorite. Skinny pretty boy. Be look careful of the bird poopy. Look at, look at all you this. can slip on the bird poopy. I was gonna show that. Look, bird poop. Look at this amazing graphics. Look, look at this look amazing at this. view. Look at how you can see the sun and the lens flare. Look at this poopy. Look at that poopy. <laughs> look at that. Poopy. Watch me walk on the poopy. <laughs> slip on the poopy. I'm just gonna lie here in defeat. Skinny boys with glasses and long hair. That's what I like. <laughs> we should put some glasses on Raiden then. You can do that. Yeah, new game plus. New game plus. Yep, new game plus Raiden. What's over here? Oh, oh man. I'm not ready for hey, bro, this mission. You should, you should just look right up directly up into the sky. Okay. What am I looking for? Uh, I feel like what was there? Like, ah! 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 This game sucks. No, this, game sucks. Ah. this game sucks. This game sucks. Kim says, "Spider, you so silly." Tina says she likes it like right. <laughs> Chrissy says, "Lol." Tina goes, "I'm so sorry. Really what? No <laughs> Why?" They don't know a thing about because this is next gen you know, technology, we, we have to show off what the player is. No we have to show off the poopy. Yeah, show off presence. that poopy tech. <laughs> I'm lucky. No I'm actually kind of happy Shalman's wasn't here for that. Is under <laughs> Pentagon's direct command. Which Kevin says, bro, that scared NSD me. Why you do that? <laughs> the Vice President and the Secretary of Defense. Your mission may be top secret, but it's gone through the usual channels. Moving on. You know you don't. <laughs> yes. 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 I'll go check on you. I'll leave the first floor to you. Okay. Understood. Okay. I love you. I love you too. <laughs> or good luck, Aiden. <laughs> just. It's a little quick. Would it's they a, would they quick, peck lips or would they just like on the cheek? <laughs> it, it's a it's a goodbye kiss. Yeah, yeah. It's just yeah, all it's like just a lip. Yeah. As, you, as you're leaving the house. Located the nose. It's under heavy surveillance. Give me Judas Smoother. Oh. The background. Distract them. Try making some noise to draw their attention away. How? Flatten yourself I'm gonna against go the wall. Save the president. The yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Kimmy. Thank you, Kimmy. Okay, I'm hidden. I'm gonna go look around. Okay! Okay, gonna use Jack the nerd. Into the nerd. <laughs> Jack in! Power up! Man, ain't nobody seen that Mega Man's. Nope. What was that, Anti Warrior? Um. Maybe. Mm. It was the anime. I can't. I think the anime actually went by a different name. Mm. So we're so actually supposed to take the left route. Yeah, we're supposed to go to the left. But we need something over here. We need uh, something over at uh, strut F. F. Yes. Yes. Oh gosh, I actually completely forgot to pick up a chaff grenade a minute ago. Let me go do That's that. That's okay, there's more down there. Yeah. A cipher. Right. Thank you for the Watch picture, Kimmy. It looks That's great. A cipher, a type of UAV. If it spots you, it will alert enemy personnel. Exercise extreme caution. But you can use VR right to set up an interference. <laughs> like green and invisible, but his hair is still on. Yeah. So you know. Yeah. How Try would you know otherwise? Exactly. Chaff. You can also destroy the engine or the camera. Some of the UAVs Kim may says be explosion on. go boom. Be careful. Copy that. Wait a second. I just intercepted new intelligence on the operation being executed by SEAL Team 10. Intercepted? 
As I said before, they need to be kept in the dark about our presence. So we just listen in. I'm patching it through. This is Alpha Zero. We have the president. Is he safe? He is safe. What about the package? Tell the guys upstairs that we've secured the package. Easy money. Good work. Your retrieval is on the way. Come on home. Roger that. Holy! Alpha Zero, report. Damn it, cover the president! Come in, Alpha Zero. This is Alpha Zero. We're under attack. This is crazy! Is that... Alpha Zero, respond. All Alpha, respond. Raiden, the president's life is in danger. Head to Strut B now. Yeah, well, we're gonna get right on that. I mean, we'll be there eventually. <laughs> hey, Luke. Smarter go burr. How you doing? Oh, hi, Luke. I'm Smarter Roscoe. I'm Jingles Roscoe. Where did Roscoe brought us? Can't even go brr, but Jingles can. <laughs> oh, I can go brr, brr, brr. I can roll. I can roll it once. You can do one roll. Give me some credit. Brr. I do real brr. Yeah, with the with the I do it with the lips, not the rat. Good, Kim says you should learn how to run. You would sound like me and Jingles, like a pigeon. Cool, 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 cool. Yes, hello, it's me. I'm a pigeon. It is I, pigeon. I gotta pick up these chafes, these chafe grenades. Yep. Scramble! Just like last time. Oh, yeah. My gut tells me it's either Solidus or La Ocelot slash Liquid. Hmm. The person, uh, you mean the leader? The leader. No, probably. It could be you. It could, it could be, be me. me. It could be any one of us in this chat right now. The guest. M9. Okay, so we got the M9, so now we can start knocking people out again. Ugh, I love it. Nothing here. Nothing to report. So that that was showing off a little mechanic that's new to this game. Um, there are some areas where some uh, guards need to check in with their superiors and. Uh, to when they need to do that like every so often so that their superiors know that uh that they're you know working um but if they fail to check in then the superiors will send guards to go see what's going on yeah so it's a whole new game yep no, see see that guy's checking in okay now i'm gonna sneak on over here nope I will take this chaff grenade though and be on my way because right. there are no other freebie doors here. Yes. <laughs> Chrissy goes brr. <laughs> Smiter go brr. Wow. Jingle go brr. <laughs> brr, brr. Let me just throw out this chaff grenade, make things easier for myself. You know, I was thinking about revisiting this game, mm -hmm. just so you know, all the games in general. Mm -hmm. And because uh, I mean, this first time we're just showing off the story and right. some of the fun mechanics you can do and stuff. That's the main. But thing. on subsequent playthroughs, I can highlight like the sheer details of this game. Yes. In all the other games. I would love to do that. Stick them up. Freeze. <gasps> You got some for me? <laughs> Go on. Do a dance. Do a dance. That's a dog tag. Donkey Shane. Christoph L. Landemand? Some, I don't know. I don't know. I'm gonna stuff him in a locker. Chrissy says, very, very sneaky. Ah, uh, yes. V sneak. Three snack. Snack. I'm gonna run upstairs right quick and grab those chaps before I keep moving. Okay. He's fine. We'll stick him in. It's just going to take a little nap. Tina says, give us the dog tag. Nothing to see here. <laughs> Nothing to report. <laughs> you good? He's taking a schnooze. You good in there, buddy? All right. 
imagine just walking around the office, minding your own business, and then waking up inside of a locker. Yeah, that'd be interesting. That'd be terrifying. And it, it would, like, happen so suddenly. Yeah. And then, you know, like, you're... I don't know if you would be groggy or if you would feel refreshed when you wake up. No, I think you would be, like, massively groggy. Yeah. And Tina says, he's just asleep. I didn't kill him. It's true. We didn't kill him. Ride and watch out. There are sentries posted on the connecting bridge. They will spot you if you continue on course. Any recommendations? Use the hanging mode. Hanging? Thanks. Hey, bro, can you double check how many times and push the action uh, I got to a clear pump the railing and hang in order the to side. increase my hang level? Once there, yeah. I can't you remember can if it's you gotta hold it enemy or if you gotta like. All right, it. I'm giving it a try. Don't forget the grip gauge. It will keep decreasing during a hanging maneuver, and once it runs out, you will fall. All right. 100 pull-ups. Gotcha. Yeah, is this the hanging mode? <laughs> if you press L2 and R2 at the same time, you can do a little pull-up. It's helpful for when you're in first-person mode and it lets you just sort of peek over the edge. Get a sneaky peek. But for now, this is just an easier way to do it. Yep. It says alternatively, you can drop down from a high rail to a lower rail. Oh. And catch yourself. That also counts? Yeah. I wonder if. And it, it actually, uh, you only need to do that 10 times. Oh, really? Neat. Yeah, if that'll expedite the process, then mm -hmm. I'm all about that. Let me show you a little bit of that first person thing I'm talking about. See, normally this is all you can see, but if you pump up a little bit, you can look over. Pump it up. Pump it, pump it. And I don't know up. where there's a good spot to uh, to do that though. Yeah. Oh, I know I know a great spot where uh, you can just drop over and over again. Mhm. Mm Well, if you know. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he is, Chrissy. <laughs> yeah, he's very pretty. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, so many gauges this time around. Where are we going to hide the bodies? Good question. They well, give you lockers, are, uh, oh, lockers are... Lockers oh. are a good one. Oh. oh, my. This feels familiar. I'm going to let you guys just enjoy this.
today. Or rather, six. Bam. Played by Phil Lamar. He was an awesome voice actor, and I love him. I want to have drinks with him. SEAL team member was able to get out. Sit there and let that guy die. Yeah, green. Are you all done cleaning up? Yes, but wait till I tell you what I found. Something interesting. I'll tell you in person. Where are you? In the central unit with the president. Be right there. Yas Queen. Hold on. I'm not an enemy. Calm down. It's a cute drawing, Kim. My name is. My name is Pliskin. Iroquois Pliskin. Lieutenant Junior Grade. Iroquois Pliskin. Are you a Navy SEAL? How did you get in? Fast rope descent from a Navy chopper. Have I seen you before? That suit. Are you Foxhound? That's right. Foxhound was disbanded. Huh? Where were you before Fox <laughs> out? Delta Force? That's funny, Chrissy. What are you talking about? That's Iroquois Fuskin. I was part of the Army's said. Force 21 trials. Force 21? That's about tactical IT deployment, right? Any field experience? No, not really. So this is your first. I've had extensive training, the kind that's indistinguishable from the real thing. Like what? Sneaking missions 60, weapons 80, Advanced VR, huh? But realistic in every way. A virtual grunt of the digital age, that's just great. That's I far more video than games. live exercises. You don't get injured in VR, do you? Every year a few soldiers die in field exercises. There's pain sensation in VR and even a sense of reality and urgency. The only difference is it isn't actually happening. That's the way they want you to think, to remove you from the fear that goes with battle situations. War is a video game. What better way to raise the ultimate soldier? Hey, remember? I remember. So you're saying that VR training is some kind of mind control? Right. What's going on? The Alpha team from Navy SEAL 10 is dead. No, a single survivor. The kid's wired with nanomachines. What about the president? Looks like they took him somewhere else. I see. You said there was a survivor from SEAL Team 10. Yeah. Lieutenant J.G. Pliskin. Has he seen your face? What? 
This is a top secret mission. No one can know that we're in. You have to take him out. It's a little too late for that. <laughs> take him out now, Raiden. Now. <laughs> What's up? Take a look. What the hell? A Navy captain. You all right? Give me a few minutes. Must have lost a few more pints than I thought. What was that man just now? That blood-sucking blood freak? That was Vamp. He's Romanian. A wizard with knives, as you saw. The way he moved didn't seem human. You won't see that in VR, I guarantee. What is he? One of the members of Dead Cell. Dead Cell? Him? A special forces unit created by ex-president George Sears. The name was originally intended to reflect its anti-terrorist functions. The unit would launch unannounced assaults on government complexes for the ultimate terrorism simulation. They were needed to show VR troopers like you how to deal with the real thing. But around the time their original leader died in prison, the unit began to unravel. They were always close to the edge, but they became more and more extreme, began to go after U.S. allies, even civilians. We estimate that no fewer than 100 people died as a result of accidents the dead cell arranged on their own. They were out of control, and it all came to a head six months ago. What happened? The unit was devastated. There are only three left now, and you just saw one of them. Why would they go after the big shell? How should I know? I told you they were on the lunatic fringe. What about their leader? He says he's Solid Snake. Snake died two years ago. Yeah, you see, Snake died two years ago. You mean the incident that made this big shell necessary in the first place? Right, and he was the one that sank that tanker. But he's a legend. Legends are usually bad news. There's not a lot of difference between heroes and madmen. You're saying Snake is still alive and pulled another one? No, he's not involved in this one. His body was positively ID'd two years ago. Snake is dead. And buried. They ID'd his body two years ago. What and about the other him. soldiers? I saw Russian equipment, too. Former Soviet military. They're probably mercenaries. The big shell is too much ground for just dead cell members to hold down. You weren't briefed on any of this? And you came in alone to boot? Why? What are you really doing here? Can't tell me, huh? Fine with me. Seems like the Colonel is uh, still not... Uh, I don't, I don't smoke. smoke. <laughs> Keep it anyway. They come in yeah, handy. they do come in handy. Um, seems like the Colonel is back to his not telling the whole truth ways. Take this too. Aw, oh, yeah. So calm. Come in, Alpha Zero. This is Bravo Zero. Currently at the bridge between struts B and C. The president is... Damn, I can't hit this thing. It's like some bad dream. Alpha, anyone, come in, all Alpha. This is Bravo Zero. Aren't you going to answer him? Connecting bridge. Decoy, 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 Can you decoy. handle it? I need a few more minutes. Remember my frequency. It's 141.80. 141.80. Got it. I've been briefed on this plant's layout. If you need information on the place or about Dead Cell, contact me. You're using nano communication, right? Yeah, but I can patch into your frequency. Nice to meet you, new Master Miller. <laughs> Hey, what's your name? Raiden. Raiden? Strange code name. Look at that butt. <laughs> Makes up for the boring one my parents gave me. Stop objectifying Raiden and looking I'll at his butt. Someday. But the game is putting the button right in front of my face. <laughs> the game is telling me to look at his butt. You remember like Meryl? It's yeah. important to look at butts, apparently. <laughs> <laughs> you need to remember! 
I'm for those of you that are wondering like why I'm not using the mic, uh it just feels more prudent to me to let you guys listen to the cutscene. I could just chat with you in the chat. The skin is just gonna take a little time. Nap. Nap. <laughs> lot of stuff oh, that's happened. Just, that's just blood loss, man. He just that, he's fine. Juice. He's so, fine. The, we now know the name of the terrorists. They're called Dead Cell, which was a group. Oh, we we knew about that before. An anti-terrorist group that was created by George Sears, former President George Sears. Wait, this now we is got, in 2009. Th we got James big, Johnson or whatever. In big, the, big. Sh uh, sorry. Tanker happened in 2007. Yes. Was that during George Sears' administration then? You said we got uh, a new I president, think, George Johnson? Uh, I think, Johnson? I think Johnson just got elected in 2008. Okay. So the tanker incident could have happened while George was still in office. Possibly. Yeah. I'd be willing to buy that. Jack, it's me. Everything oh, okay, okay Chrissy. Don't you need See you to later. See you later, for Chrissy. Thanks for oh, yeah. swinging on by. Thanks for the reminder. Tina, how many times have you been all like, it must have been this. That's who did it. And then you were wrong. <laughs> She's all like, oh. <laughs> I'm just curious. You're like, it has to be. It has to be. It all adds up. And then you were wrong. Jack, do you remember what day tomorrow is? That again. I'm sorry, but I still don't have a clue. That's okay. What is it, Rose? Talk to me. I'd rather you figure it out. It's important. How important? <laughs> important enough, and we'll talk about it tomorrow. Why not now? Tomorrow Don't seems you more mean no. appropriate. Explain it to me now. I need all the help I can get so that I won't chicken out anyway. Mm. Is that the reason you decided to be part of this mission? <sighs> okay, I'm gonna finish this thing by tomorrow, no matter what. That's right. Twenty-four you know hours. I'll do everything In and I out. Can to Quick help as heck. You. Rose, there's something I need you to do as an analyst. What is it? It has to do with Solid Snake. The leader of this takeover incident is claiming that he's Snake himself. The legendary mercenary? Hmm. I need as much data on him as possible. Everything they have on him after the Shadow Moses incident. He's dead now, isn't he? Yes. It should be a burial record somewhere, Super too. Super dead. We should be able to request top-level security clearance from the Colonel. That Bro, should get us into the most have classified to, uh, material. Uh, come I'm up with a new level for a, a new word for how dead that guy is what word would that be it would be it wouldn't be like well he's easily how, the deadest guy how, how dead is solid snake how dead is solid snake he's uh i was gonna say confirmed dead dead yeah. but that's not that's not enough the word I was looking for, younger brother, was in cadaverific. Cadaverific. <laughs> oh, why don't you, why don't you aim your shoot bangs at all? All well, my skin. shoot bangs. Yeah. <laughs> I don't trust the skin. <gasps> I wouldn't do that if I were you. He wasn't completely asleep. Who is this guy? Who is this police skin? We should better make sure that all he's right. actually asleep, though. My bad. I will be on my way. Or will I? <laughs> what are you trying to do, kid? Sleep. Sleep. <laughs> <laughs> hmm, these are all good questions, Tina. What could they be? Hmm. What could it mean? What does it mean? What does it mean? Crashing. So calm. It's a good gun. It's just very loud. Yes. I'll have to get the I suppressor need some more for it later. water, but uh, I'm trying to decide if I'm going to go get it during this cutscene. I just want them to enjoy the cutscene. Yeah, go ahead and uh, get water during the cutscene. All right. It seems there are a couple, so tonight ah. could be their anniversary. As soon as I get the cutscene going, literally as you as you did it. Here we go.
Come, put me out of my misery. This is impossible. Nothing will hit her. Is she the one they call Fortune? Hey, Crazy Bot, thanks for joining us. Queen. Don't let them take the president! Oh. Ready grenades! Crazy Bot, thank you for following. Hey, follow closely. Today is another bad day. I just love that line. Sorry. Is there anyone here that can give me happiness? Keep your legs straight when you hit the water. <laughs> oh, to the bird. I'm so sorry, my beauties. I'll see you again someday. Colonel, SEAL Team 10's Bravo team was wiped out. I see. What happened to the cargo choppers? Both of them are at the bottom of the harbor. Looks like your new hosts have a Harrier, too. A Harrier? What is this? <laughs> Calm down. It just means they anticipated the attack. What? Besides, since the SEALs drew their fire, your infiltration went off without a hitch. On top of that, we know their defensive capabilities. Are you saying this was all a feint? Right. Get a hold of yourself. The entire mission is in your hands now. Do you understand? But... There's no time for questions. They could decide to retaliate for that failed assault. You mean the hostages? They could be in danger, yes. But we need to consider the possibility that they'll blow the whole shell. If that toxic spell does take place, it'll devastate not only the harbor, but poison the coastline for generations. <sighs> Raiden, we've had to adjust the mission objectives. The priority is now on removing those C4s of the terrorists wired over the big shell. The president can wait, but this can't. Colonel, you know I'm no bomb disposal expert. That's not a problem. The Bravo team brought an explosives pro in with them. He was supposed to stand by on Strut C according to their mission plan. You should find him there. Is this according to simulation too? What are you talking about? Get to Strut C and find him. Understood. But I need to ask you something before I go. Make it quick. Who are they? Dead Cell, I mean. They couldn't hit her no matter how hard they tried. And that vampire, too. It's... it's like... It's like being in a nightmare you can't wake up from. Jack, snap out of it. And you, Rose. I can't believe you're on this mission. I keep thinking I'll wake up. Right. This is real. And that's why you won't wake up. But nothing seems real. I've made up my mind to stay with you. Whether this is real or a bad dream, I'll keep watching you till it's over. Thank you, Rose. And I won't let you be just a dream. Are you two done? <laughs> right. You're needed on Strut C. Oh, barf. <laughs> right, and are you done making out with your girlfriend? 
I keep forgetting where I put my controller. Here we are. Keep it nearby. Yeah. Cool stuff. Yeah, cool stuff. Fortune. Fortune. She cannot be touched. She refused. She tell the bullet no. Do you think May <laughs> Tina goes, love, bleh. <laughs> Tina, do you think maybe Fortune is just lucky? That's a... That, I mean, if that's so, that's an amazing coincidence on her name. Mm -hmm. Her code name. <laughs> We're gonna call you Lucky. Yes. Cause you lucky. Cause you're the lucky one. The lucky ones leave us. It's okay. I'm sure we'll find a way to defeat her. There has to be. There a has way. to be some sort of video gamey gimmick that allow me to she defeat. She says her. no. I don't think so. Hmm. Hello, Raiden. Hello, it's Raiden. me, Raiden. Punch. Punch, punch. Kick! <laughs> I'm hidden. Now I see you. Now I'm hidden. <laughs> now I see you. This is how you lean. That's what lean looks like. This is what lean looks like. Just slide. It's <laughs> <laughs> amazing. Now I'm in this mirror. Now I'm in this mirror. We've never been There are to two Raidens. <laughs> oh, hey. I wonder what it looks like when I lean if up. go up. Oh. oh. Okay, the body just stays there. What if I do this? Yeah. Yeah. The <laughs> body just stays there. That's weird. We were never meant to see the secrets. I wish I was here sooner so I'd know what's happening. Okay. Uh, we can fill you in a little bit. Is uh, it crazed? Yeah, crazed butt. Okay. We'll fill you in a little bit. I'm gonna just look around. Go so on. Uh, we're playing as Raiden. We're sneaking into this big shell, which is an uh, oil cleanup thing, because of a big tanker that exploded uh, two years ago. Um, there's a bunch of terrorists that took it over, and we're gotta go in and save the president. And the Cause... terrorist leader's name is... Solid, Solid Snake. Snake! And Solid Snake... They're saying that can't be possible because Solid Snake died two years ago. They even have a body. So... If we go back and look at that cutscene, the bullet's trajectory was curving around her. You can't do that without some sort of force strong enough to push it ever so slightly without stopping it fair point yeah but what would that force what be? If, what if the bullets just curved what if the bullets got close to her and they were like oh excuse me oh pardon me and they and they just moved out of the way i'd move out of the way for fortune i'd move out of the way for fortune and yes fortune is queen fortune is queen Bullets don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, sorry. I'm gonna let you guys watch the cutscene. Oh, that sounds like a lot. Freeze! Yes, yes. Don't shoot. You a cop? I'm not NYPD. I came in with the Bravo team. Who are you with? And what happened to SEAL Team Ten? They're all dead. All of them are dead. All of them. <sighs> That's bad. Did I tell you you could move? He's, all right. He's not one of the bad guys. Oh, hey, Pliskin. Don't go pointing that thing everywhere, kid. What's your name? My name is Peter. Peter Stillman. I'm lecturer at Navscolio at Indian Head. Also a consultant for the NYPD bomb squad. A poor old man who got dragged along for this picnic. I thought you'd retired. I did. Can't keep up with everybody, as you can see. A famous church got wiped off the map thanks to me. With too many lives inside. All I lost was this leg. So you're the bomb disposal guy. Hmm. Kid, this is the bomb disposal guy. Open any explosive disposal textbook and you'll see his name. <laughs> Just ancient history now. Why did they bring you out of retirement then? Because the terrorist group here includes one of my students, the Emperor of Explosives, Fat Batman. He built an atomic bomb when he was only 10. I created him in a sense. And that's why you're here. I'm pretty rusty. I was supposed to supervise the bomb disposal. 
Looks like it was taken care of before I had my turn. I wouldn't say that. There are at least two people here who can claim to be experts at bomb disposal. Are you two with SEAL Team 10? I didn't see you at the mission briefing. Oh, we're with another squad. My name is Pliskin, Lieutenant Junior Grade. Honored to meet you, sir. Mr. Pliskin, do you have any experience with explosives disposal? Don't worry about me. And he looks young, but he can do it. But we need more manpower. I'm, uh... What's your name? Raiden. That's an odd name. It's a dumb name. Any other survivors? There was also an engineer with me. An engineer? A skinny guy. He went in with us. Where is he? I haven't seen him since that skirmish. Was he killed? I don't think so. I didn't find his body. I see. They told me he was a security systems architect for the big shell. Why would they take a civilian along? Everything in this structure is computer controlled. He was supposed to get us past all the security Who's matters. that weird skinny guy? I never heard anything about that. He had official orders with he looks him. looks like a huge nerd. Hmm. We'll leave that for later. Right now, we need to figure out how to deal with all the bombs. But there's no one left from the SEAL's EOD squad. Yup, so we have to do it ourselves. But I've never defused a bomb before. Hold on a sec. Off to confer with the CO again. Glad to hear Stillman is safe. Assist him in any way possible to clear the C4 from the structure. Colonel, you know I've never been trained in bomb disposal. It's all right. The man you're working with is the best in the field. All you have to do is follow his directions. You will, of course, keep your identity and mission objectives to yourself. Is it true that an engineer came in with Stillman? I wasn't informed of that. It's probably something the SEALs decided on their own. Hmm. There are more important issues at hand, Raiden. The enemy may retaliate for the failed assault. Get those C4s neutralized now. Colonel, I'm not qualified for bomb disposal. Jack, it's me. Rose? You can Literally, do this. Literally, call Trust me Raiden. You haven't had bomb disposal training per se in VR, but you're more than capable of handling C4. This is a little different from using C4. You're up for this. You know that. How about it, kid? Are the results in yet? There's no need to think about this so much. You won't actually be dismantling the bomb. That's not. Hey there, Tyler. Answer. How's what it going? Hey, Tyler. It's a temporary freezing Here, look at this. Now we're gonna learn about bomb disposal. Yay! Yay, bombs! This is a C4 bomb. Hi, Pliskin. Peter is Fat Man's teacher. Yeah. It's live. You can see it pulsing. I, I spray this on the man. Here we go. Simple, huh? The spray freezes the detonator instantly. Hey! How long does the effect last? There's no way the thing can detonate in this condition. Even if you leave it alone, it'll stay out of commission for at least 24 hours. That's enough time. If we had the manpower, I'd recommend complete disposal. But this will have to do. The spray can be used from several yards away. Now check the floor, ceiling, walls, under a table, everywhere. Try to imagine the locations the bomber would choose. That won't be easy. We don't know a thing about Fat Man. Is there anything? Well, we know two things about bombs. Fat Man. Here, he's fat and a man. man. Well, I was gonna say he's fat and he makes bombs. Oh, okay. Okay. Well, I I, I think it's unfair of me to assume that he's fat, strictly based on his name. Strictly based on his name, that is Fat Kyle. <laughs> That's right. Or Fat Neil. I have established a link up with your radar network, so any synth detected will be represented visually. Have the sensor activated and keep your eye on the radar. What if he's using some other odorless substance? He likes to spray with his cologne. I know Fat Man well. I know how into his own aesthetics he is. Signature? Yes. On every bomb he builds, he always leaves a trace of the cologne he uses. Wow. <laughs> the sensor also picks up that particular scent spectrum. Is that something he learned from you? Are you ready no, to move out, Fat Man? Uh, oh, yes. I just need to spray this down a little bit. And he followed it like a religion. And common sense wasn't one of You want an even musk around the bond. I, I, everything <laughs> around I, the... I have no children of my own, and I thought I found a son in him. He had the right stuff, you know. There's something very unusual about an ability like that. 
Even at Indian Head, he got special treatment. I remember some people called him one of the fat cats. <laughs> Maybe that's what started all this. I didn't teach him the most important thing I had to tell him. There are some things you have to pass on. The trick is to know which one. Right. Right. All I taught him was skills. And now I have to stop him from using it to destroy us all. Destroy us all! Let's see how well that sensor works. All right. I'm activating. Watch. You see the green stuff on the radar? That's a visual representation of a C4 scent detected by the sensor. It's a pretty big area, isn't it? Don't complain. It's better than nothing. Just activate the sensors and search the area, okay? All right. Don't forget that you need the radar to use the system. Log into the node at every strut and turn the radar on. We have to keep out of the enemy's sight, too. Because the radar gets knocked offline when we're spotted? Exactly. Fat Man would have allotted some C4 here in Strut C as well. Here? Hi, Swirly. Hi, Swirly. Good to see you. I know the structure of this facility. And if he wants to take out the plant, where he... Confetti bombs would be kind of fun. You know mm -hmm. this for sure. But you have to be really careful that you don't put too much force on them or too much confetti. You can still get His some in somebody's eyes. On my theories. We don't Demolition like is a we kind of ideology. It makes no exceptions for time or place. Big Shell consists of two hexagons joined in on in, north to south. There should be packets of C4s on each of the vertices, or the struts in this case. You need at least that to take a building of disintegrity out. Six on shell one, another six on shell two. A total of 12 bombs at least. At least. Considering the shell's architecture and composition from an engineering standpoint, that's my conclusion. And it's exactly what he would have decided as well. Kid, this place is all yours. I'll take care of shell too. Take this. Yo. What's this? Security car issued to shell personnel. The big shell security layout includes varying levels of clearance. The clearance level is identified by the number printed on these doors. Wrighton, your card key can open doors for security clearance level one. Pliskin, your card can get you into level three areas. You needed to get next door to shell two. How did you get this? That engineer I told you about gave it to me. He was supposed to program a set of all access cards once we were on site. Unfortunately, this card won't get you into every area of this structure. We'll have to deal with the remaining security lockouts as they come up. Let's get going. You stay here. No, I'm going. The two of us can handle it, don't worry. But... You'll just slow us down with that leg of yours. There's a war going on here. Hey, game in. I don't have time to base hey, game in. anymore. Why don't you just let us handle the grunt work? You can tell us what to do over the radio, like in the original mission plan. All right. I'll give you instructions from here. I may also need to prepare a backup plan just in case. In case of what? Good luck oh, to I both. Was, of you. This is a dangerous one. Thinking about it. Who dares? Wins. Who dares wins? If anything comes up, let me know. My frequency is 140.25. Good luck, kid. I'll see you later. Semper Fi. <laughs> Semper Fi. That man's no seal. I don't even think he's a Navy man. What? Semper Fi. It's a marine thing. Marine Corps talk. <laughs> Normally, team leaders stay in the CP and give orders with those headphones. And as far as I know, SEALs keep their officers away from the field. And who dares wins is a model of the British Special Air Service. Is he one of the terrorists then? No, somehow I don't think so. If there's someone to suspect, I'd put my money on you. Heh. <laughs> I see. 
time. Just take care of those bombs for now. You guys what think that you? they could be back maybe Pliskin hasn't been completely honest with us? No, that can't be right. I'll hide out in this pantry for a while. If I lock the door, it should be all right. Plenty of food in here, too, so you don't need to worry about me. I'll give you instructions by codec from here. Good luck, kid. <laughs> Bomb disposal is a face-off with your own mortality. Don't let the fear get to you. When you give in to the fear, the darkness comes. Guys, I think... I think Pliskin might be trying to bamboozle us. I don't know, though. Uh, Tyler, that was a really good question. That's a super duper good question, and it's almost a little difficult to answer without spoil oops. Yeah. Uh, a, I know this is an old game, yes. uh, but we still got people in the chat that have never seen it before, and they're yes. watching this for the first time. Uh, let's see, from this game? From, yeah, I, I feel like we, we should just say we, we want to get through the game before we would want to answer that question oh, no, I'm, I'm trying to find a way to work it because well, I, mean, I would now say they, the second to now, last cause... one is my favorite Ooh, that's it that is a very good one i would almost say that the last one might be my favorite just because of how different it is from everything else yeah okay so i mean there, the there's orange. our answer the orange snack is in there but he dead so no snack is forever dead never to <laughs> come back kimmy says snack or Raiden, I don't like that name. <laughs> it's like not a kid. Why you got why he getting called kid? <laughs> Kitty says, Please kid has been trying to deceive us this whole time. It's obvious he's snake. And Tyler says, Fair enough. <laughs> yeah. Well I would uh, say if you what about, I, I figure you're familiar with the game. Yeah. Um you know I say second to last boss, Smider says last boss. Uh what about you, Tyler? While still trying to be cool and secret about yeah. it. Trying not to reveal Look, anything. it's a bomb! There's a bomb up there, guys. I freeze. I freeze. Freeze! Right in here. I took care of the C4 in Strut C. The ceiling of the women's bathroom was set to you blow. You went into the women's bathroom? That's not yeah. like him. Anything wrong? Maybe. Pliskin's reported other locations, too. And none of them are effective demolition points. What do you mean? It means that they wouldn't be the best places to choose if you wanted to destroy this place. Are you saying they don't plan on blowing the shell up? It to certainly get. seems that way. So far, we haven't seen anything but only oh gosh, every day. <laughs> Not every day. <laughs> every weekend, yeah. I couldn't have overlooked the fact you like that Chinese food as much as I like pizza. There's something going on. So now we have to fight. Okay, I'll fight you. Fight you. Should we? Should we throw in anniversary edition? Third strike, see, see, if that's <laughs> stop playing this game just so we can do Street Fighter. Yeah, <laughs> uh, let's see. Which yeah, Tyler says probably the guy on the roller skates. That's a good boss fight. Oh, cool. Yeah, so Fat Man. I'm okay. <laughs> well, I, they know Fat Man, they know that Fat Man's in the game, they didn't know that he was gonna be a boss. Yeah, all right. I think they could have pieced that together, especially Tina. Tina's already on her way to piecing everything together. Yes. Kim says, Smiter, I make the bombs cool. Puts on sunglasses to look cool and edgy. That'd be my signature for bombs. <laughs> <laughs> Put little sunglasses on each bomb. Yeah, exactly. So we have to find the fart gas. Yes. Find the green fart gas. And go to sleep. Oh, Did you already take care of the one in here? No. Huh. No, man, I didn't I'm have... I'm surprised it didn't show up on the... Oh, oh, it's because I got my rations equipped. I don't have the sensory oh, equipped. Oh, that, that makes sense. In the butt. Got him. Yeah, in the, in the took radio. out the radio. Yeah, you can shoot the radio so they can't call for backup. It's great. Yeah. Uh, doo -doo -doo. Tina says, my Spidey sense is hardcore going at it. Uh, Kim says, 
uh, no spider would just write the Dark Lord or the Edge Lord on it because he's so edgy. <laughs> and Tina says, all the pieces of the puzzle are at my feet and I'm just putting it together as fast as I can. You're like doing that. a good job. I, I like how enthusiastic you are about this because that's what I was hoping for. Yeah. And I think that's what's really important. Yeah. Um, that being said, uh, I'm going to need a picture of Charlie and the conspiracy wall <laughs> and just title it Tina putting the story together. Mm hmm. Oh, I just realized I can probably see about actually trying to get dog tags from these guys. Hmm. Like, I'd actually I have... forgot about the noisy floor. Oh, uh, I know. Gotta go hanging mode. Yeah. Hang, 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 hanging mode. Yeah. Head, 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 hanging mode. Rip! Freeze. You have dog tags. Yeah. Are you going to shoot oh. me? So some guys, some guys are not afraid. Some guys are trying to be heroes. So we gotta, we gotta show them that they need to be afraid. Yep. We need to incentivize them. Yes. I'll take your hand. <laughs> no. Now he's scared and will now give us his dog tag. Kim says, me and Tina calling Smiter edgy in every stream is the thing now. But now I'm just calling him edgy. Tina, where are you at? <laughs> I know, Tina not calling Smiter edgy. I guess not. I guess I wasn't the real edge lord. I guess. This guy got himself out of the locker. And then went back on patrol. Only to get stopped back in the locker. Dragon by the legs. <laughs> Forever banished to the locker. Admittedly, bro, we get pizza more than we get Chinese food. Yeah, I know. Because it's better. Wow. Everybody <laughs> vote in the comments. Which is better, <laughs> pizza or Chinese food? Honestly, I'm not even that hungry right now. Mm. What about you? Are you super hungry? I'm not super hungry. But we always wait until I'm, like, on death's oh, door me before too. we get Yeah, food. we're terrible about that. That's why I thought we could order now and then just yeah. have it. Plus, when it comes to getting pizza, we can have it delivered to us. But mm -hmm. when it comes to Chinese food, I have to take both of our cards. Yeah. I have to split it on the place. We have place. to split it. Always feels like a bit more of a hassle. Sorry, I know I should be using the sensor, but I already know where all the bombs are at. Yeah. Kim says he woke up like, what? What am I doing here? I should be on patrol. Casually walks out and goes back on patrol. Yep, exactly. Uh, Tina says, uh, made a meme for you, Smiter. Let me see. Is it in Have a Laugh? Yeah. <laughs> wow, you did a good job. Yeah, Tina pieces together the MGS2 lore. That's awesome. Good job. I'm proud of you. <laughs> yeah. You want to talk about stress? You want to talk about stress? I'm going to I'm going to have a I'm I think one of our first emotes needs to be a Nuggies emote. Yeah. I'm going to make Nuggies and then for subscribers I'm going to have golden Nuggies. Oh, okay. I want something Metal Gear related. Oh, what well, if if we are able to unlock like more emotes? Yeah. Metal Gear related uh stuff. Will, sure. Will be coming. Absolutely. This is Raiden. The C4 found in strut A has been frozen and disposed of. It's like Tina of. trying to put the snap floor together. The yeah, the exactly. On the, first yeah. Floor. the difference this is, is, is that the fans write the snap floor. Is <laughs> That's true. <laughs> and then all Scott the comes in and is all like, I'll just so take this and put it in the game. The right yeah. Of locations. And the quantity of explosives mm -hmm. isn't sufficient either. Even Fat Man can make mistakes, right? No. There's something else going on here. Get a move on with the disposal it. right now. I've got a bad feeling about this. You think it's a trap? I don't but know. Yeah, it, it is. Oh, gonna tell technically, we can have it delivered. Too. Just hurry. The Chinese food. I just think that uh, 
We'd have to pay in cash. Well, can't do that. Yeah, and that's another thing. We can pay online for pizza. Yeah. And not worry now, about the, that. The convenience, it's, there's no question there. Yeah. Because the Chinese food place is a, is a local, small, tiny Chinese food place. Mm -hmm. And so they don't have, like, sweet website stuff like that. Yeah. Tell, tell, you, what, if they tell you what. Just for convenience sake, mm -hmm. because we're not going to... You want that. <laughs> oh, I know. <laughs> I know I want that. <laughs> I'm coming this way for that. Mm. Uh, all right, watch. Uh, guys, this is going to be real-time bargaining with uh, Jingles and Smiter. Yes. I would like to I would like to make a proposal to the council. Tina says food is food because she's non-committal like that. <laughs> yeah. I would like to make a proposal to the council, brother. Yes. Uh, I would like to propose that today pizza... Oh, Kim, that's silly. Pizza is required. Pizza is acquired. And uh, tomorrow lunch, we have Chinese. Because of the convenience of being on stream, and uh, we'd be able to have it easily delivered to us and take care of all the payments and everything from here. Mm -hmm. And then tomorrow, we get Chinese because we will not be recording in the morning. Yeah. That is my proposal to the council. If that appeals to you, great. Uh, otherwise, I will see your counterpoint. I just want Chinese food. I know you do. <laughs> but I'm saying, like, like, I'm willing for you to make a point. And I'm saying pizza is more convenient and we should go for it just for today and then tomorrow we can have Chinese. Mm -hmm. I got it. Hold on. I got it. Got it. One shot. <laughs> one shot. One kill. <laughs> First try. Yeah, we can we can have pizza. Just make it different. Okay. Yeah. Let's mix it up. If we get like a big box, we could have like just a regular cheese, and then the other one could be whatever. Gross it's interesting. I I wasn't expecting you to be craving regular cheese like this. I like regular cheese. Yeah. I, I don't like the pizza places around here very much. They make me sad. That's hard. I think it's... I think part of it has to do... Guys, one of our favorite pizza places shut down. It's true. Mm -hmm. Nope. There. Nobody. Nope. He's gonna come around. Yep. But his radio is out. Yep. Check it out. Oh! I can't use my radio! So no alert, please. Go to sleep. Oh yeah, pizza for lunch and Chinese food for dinner? That would be so filling. Yeah, there's no way we could do that in one day. Yeah. We'd have so many leftovers. <laughs> Kimmy says, make Chinese pizza. <laughs> uh, but yeah, we could go for a big box. Yeah, okay. I say... Well, uh, Pure cheese and a flat garlic sauce on one, and then whatever you feel like getting creative with on the other one. There was that one that you did with meatball that was really good. Yeah, the one I did with meatball. You want that? Yeah. I put I just put beef and meatball on there. I'm cool with that. What's going on? There's a ooh, ooh, ooh. They're gonna come in from behind you. No, no, no. It's fine. I'm good. They'll never find you. Never. Never ever. And then they leave. I'm just gonna poke my head around. <laughs> That's my blood on the wall. Yep. Gotcha. Smiter, also known as the master of hide and seek. Yeah, he's okay. I was, I was okay at hide and seek as a kid. Nope. Nope. 
help? Do you need to have the card active in order to do it? No, actually. Oh, okay. But that I do was, need to uh, get down there, because that's where the nerd is at. It's an inconvenience I don't like. Well, I mean, it's they removed it from 1 to 2. Yeah. Ah, I see. The fart cloud tells me it's in this direction. I'm gonna place the order now so that it can get here. Yeah, probably a good time. idea. Okay. And you're gonna pay for it? Yes. Yes. I balanced out the numbers in my head. Okay, there we go, no I'm radio. Order. Ooh, mine detector. I would like a can of big box, please. Big box. Big box. Big box! <laughs> Big box! The uh, leader of the. Uh, I was gonna say Outer Heaven, but I, I feel like there's another food pun we could work in there. What do you think about a big box with pasta instead of wings? Pasta? I don't even know what that would be. I mean, I'm open to new stuff. Let's go to try. Okay, let's give it a try. Big box! Oh, they're all one topping pizzas. So. Uh, gotcha. So the other one, Pep? Yep. Okay. Probably gonna actually open up the blinds here soon. Probably because like it the just the daylight has shifted and all of it, and plus I like keeping an eye out for when the delivery comes in. Right. Now the glare, I have a suppressor. The glare still hits me, but we're ah, the one playing, ah. so You found a suppressor. I did. Nice. Now I can't suppress the opposition. <laughs> I'm glad you liked it, Kim. Yups. Yups. Pepperoni. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Do do do. Dagnabbit. You want meaty marinara pasta or chicken Alfredo pasta? Mm. Meaty marinara. Okay. Cheese sticks or breadsticks? Cheese, man. Yeah. Okay. I'm not a Philistine. We're ready to check out. Let's see. I'm gonna call Pliskin right quick. Yeah, maybe he knows. Oh wait, I, I thought I, I thought I had it. I thought I had his frequency. You did. I don't have it. Huh. That's weird. Right, Stillman is a top Can't believe I forgot explosives his technician. Explosive. Follow his orders and disarm the explosives. Okay, but exactly who is Peter Stillman? Gotcha. I'll look him up. Hold on a moment. I better save. Uh, transforming room. There we go. Talk to me, Rose. Talk to me, talk to me, talk to me, baby. Jack, it must be so nerve wracking to defuse a bomb. Yeah, I'd say so. Okay, that was a stupid thing to say. Sorry. That's all right. It's just that I've never been trained in this stuff. You okay? Are you feeling well? I almost threw up a few times. Oh, Jack. But I'm okay. It's not like I'm okay. in this alone. Order placed. Oh, yeah, that's true. 
What do you think about when you're diffusing those Sounds things? Sounds like a tiny chicken. I don't think so much <laughs> as remember. And I know that I need to resist that and keep Can my mind water, blank. Please? I can't let myself be overwhelmed Thank by the you. fear. So, am I a part of what you're just trying in not case. to remember? Okay. I was just kidding. But I guess this isn't a good time for that. No, it is. And I do think about you. I'm trying to remember what's so special about April 30th. Any success? No, not yet. You need to stay alive so you can. Okay, that's a deal. This is right. I just finished disposing of the C4 in strut F. Found explosives on B1. You're taking too much time. You should work a little faster. There's no time, Ryden. I've got my hands full here, so it doesn't look like I can help you. It's in your hands. Well done. It looks like there are no more bombs in that strut. Now, head for the other struts. Just gonna punch in this frequency right quick. Okay. And then I'm uh, gonna go bio break. Oh, you need a bio break. Yeah. Let's we'll see if this works. Everything's going yep. smoothly over here. I just finished defusing another C4. For some reason, there was one planted on an enemy soldier's bed. Hmm. That's weird. Smiters away, I will take control for now. I really want to get that magazine. Uh oh, that guy woke up. worked up. It's safer to take out the enemy first, then look for the bomb. Don't even think about searching for the bomb while looking over your shoulder for the enemy. Knock them unconscious or take them out altogether first. Trying to find more. Tell me a little more about Dead Cell. Dead Cell was a shadow unit within the SEALs organization. Right. They handled surprise raids on vital government facilities, didn't they? Yes. They were originally put together to check the nation's military security system. The unit was the brainchild of ex-president George Sears. Dead Cell was a secret unit positioned at the opposite end of anti-terrorist outfits such as Delta Force and SEALs. Were they always a group of madmen? Yeah. No. They got weird when Colonel Jackson, Fortune's husband, was sent to jail. Sent to jail? For what? Corruption. He misappropriated Fortune's government husband? funds. <gasps> Sounds like he deserved it. That's what everybody else thought, except for the members of Dead Cell. They felt the colonel was falsely Fortune accused. Was married. Fact is, they married. took the case to the powers that be, but they never managed to reopen the case. Was there any truth to their claim? Who knows? Whatever the situation is, Dead Cell's name was tainted. And Colonel Jackson? He was being held in Leavenworth. Was? Meaning he's been released? Well, in a manner of speaking. The colonel's dead. Oh. Apparently, he lost the will to live and died in prison. The members of he Dead died Cell snapped with the loss of their leader. They I underwent can see that. a radical change and became uncontrollable. And that's why they undertook this terrorist operation. Seems as good a reason as any. Back to it. We took her to a police skin. Uh-oh. Folks are waking up. <laughs> Time to go. Uh, apparently, we're now qualified for the program. The program? Onboarding. Oh, 
we're out of here. So you mean for the uh, for the affiliate program? Right. Neat. I just got a message. Cool. Died in prison? Yes. Oh. This guy up there. Way up there. Okay. He's got binoculars, so there's a good chance he'll see me. Watch this shot. Got him. Boom. Oh, I'm getting a call. Be careful. There are Claymore mines out what? there. Who is this? Stealth equipped Claymore mines. Invisible to the naked eye. Do Deep throw? Identify yourself. Just call me Deep, Deep Throat. Throat. Deep Throat? You mean from Shadow Moses? Mr. X. Oh. Mr. X. Now, you, he backs out yeah. <laughs> That was so fast. I call you Deep Throat. Never mind about that. Why did you contact me? Let's just say I'm one of your fans. One of your fans. Deep Throat is a lie. Huh? Someone calling himself Mr. X just contacted me. Do you know anything about it? No. And whoever it was, it wasn't a burst transmission. The transmission was sent from within the big shell. He called himself Deep Throat at first. Do you think... I caught that part too. But the possibility of it being true is none. Gray Fox was the one who used that alias in Shadow Moses, and he's dead. Is it an enemy trap? Could be. Exercise extreme caution. I'm gonna call Pliskin. Oh, oh baby. I'm gonna call Pliskin about that. Pliskin? 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 That's a tranquilizer gun with a sound suppressor. Hit an enemy with that, and it's good night, sleep tight. The time in which the tranquilizer takes effect depends on where you hit your target. If you want to knock somebody out with a single shot, aim carefully for vital spots like the head or heart. I think I've seen this modified gun before. Yeah, it looks like the same gun used by Solid Snake two years ago. Following that terrorist incident, similar models were made and sold among the fans of his exploits. I think that's, that's an interesting one of them. guess, though. That's an American military M9 modified for tranquilizer bullets. When the tranquilizer bullets hit a target, the round uses the force of the impact to mix the drug, also producing a gas in the process. The pressure of the gas drives a built in piston that injects the target with a powerful anesthetic. It's like firing a small hypodermic syringe. This M9 is a tranquilizer gun that knocks out the enemy. It doesn't kill them. Okay, so Bliskin wasn't gonna answer about that. Okay, so invisible claymore mines. I have a mine detector. And there they are. Detector. Invisible to the naked eye. Use the mine detector. This is Mr. X. Totally original character. Yeah, but I mean, does that mean Deep Throat is back? Hmm. Do you remember the day we met? I'm kind of <laughs> right now, Lois. She called me right. up. Sorry. I do remember. It was right after I transferred to New York. There were all these tourists around you in front of the Federal Hall. A group of middle-aged Japanese ladies came up and asked me which this is a good time it was this. that King Kong was climbing in this the This is a good time for this. I said it was probably the Chrysler building. This is, this is a good time And then you this. showed up and started mouthing off. You were like, no, it's the Empire State. I said the Chrysler building was in Godzilla. <laughs> we started arguing, and I forgot all about the tourists. I was insisting that I was right, and you were doing the same. The next thing we knew, the Japanese women had gone away, and we ended up going to the Skyscraper Museum to see who had the better recall. We argued all the way to Battery Park. And for nothing. Since the museum was closed, we went our separate ways from the museum. 
and then I found you again by coincidence out in the base corridor. An amazing coincidence that we were actually working at the same place. That night we went up to the top of the Empire State. It was so beautiful. I could look down on the Chrysler building from 120 stories above ground. I felt overwhelmed. I didn't care anymore who was right. And that was our first date. We watched King Kong in your apartment a bunch of times that night. Didn't sleep till morning. Mm -hmm. If it weren't for that coincidence, we wouldn't be together. I know. I'm sorry, Jack. I'm taking up your time again. What? Take care. Oh, um. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, Jack. I'm taking up your time. What? Okay, bye. Okay, bye. Goodbye. I love you, baby. <laughs> Hey, fans! Kisses! What are you looking at, dude? Oh, I'm filling out the affiliate form. Affiliate, yeah! So that we can become affiliated. So does that just mean that we can do bits? If we will be able to do bits. How do bits work again? Like you pay money for the bits. Yeah. And then, and you, then you just give the bits. You give the bits to whoever you want. And what do bits and then do? They, they're, uh, one bit is essentially one cent. Uh, so a hundred bits is a dollar. And so on. Neat. And uh, I was you, wondering what you, the conversion rate was on that. It's about that much. Okay. For the U.S. dollar. Okay. Neato. No, they took you. That's one theory proven right. <laughs> which uh, which theory? <laughs> which one, Tina? That they were a couple. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, that wasn't me. No, that was me. Sorry, guys. I'm receiving a message from the other side. Yes. Oh, cutscene time. I've taken care of that annoying fly. What's the situation over there? Puzzling. I saw a man dressed like a ninja just now. Huh. Ninja? Ninja. It's the only way to describe it. A kind of cyborg ninja complete with a sword. Where? What? Are you hiding something from me? Olga, are you sure it wasn't an Arsenal Tengu? Don't be a fool. Think I wouldn't know the difference? I've never seen field gear like that ever. All right, we'll intensify patrols. Anything else? Actually, one more thing. You'll find it hard to believe, though. I saw a man hiding under a cardboard box. Where? On the connecting bridge to Shell 2. So you believe me this time? I've seen someone use that box trick before. We'll lay a trap on the Shell 2 connecting bridge. Over and out, then. Freeze! You must be one of Dead Cell. Of course not. What a thing to <laughs> say. <laughs> She's like, oh! Drop your gun! Me? Not a chance. Oh, goodbye. Oh, okay. <laughs> Female soldier, Russian. Must be Olga Gerlukovich. How do you know? Unlike you, I've been briefed. Damn. She's not a dead cell. Mm. No, she commands a Russian private army. They must be the ones patrolling the big shell. That's right. She's led the group ever since her old man, Colonel Gerlukovich, died. Watch yourself with her. She's a tough one. That backflip. We need that. Yeah, it's Olga again. Yeah, wow. What? She's okay. Looking at them side by side, they could possibly be related. Hmm. hmm. Olga and Raiden? Watch out for that guy. Huh. I don't have to worry about this guy. He has to worry about me. <laughs> what a sneaky sneakerson. Freeze! <gasps> 
He's got something for you. <laughs> Gimme. Gib. Gimme your dog tag. Takashi. Hirokawa. Oh, Horikawa. Horikawa. I, I think that's how it was. Alright, I need my Raider. My CMC War. Whoa, you didn't see anything, Duder. Who's there? Freeze! Move! Shake, shake, shake! Well done, lad. So that's where you're going. Freeze! Huh? Don't kill me. Give me your dog tag. Oh. Kevin. here. The C4 reported on the roof of Strut E has been taken care of. Explosives were planted on the Harrier 2 stationed on the roof. Good work. Sorry, I'm not watching chat right now. Yeah, I'm trying. I'll this be with getting, you guys. I'm getting all this set up right now. I'm here. If you gotta sleep, Kim, go to sleep. You need to hear this too. I'm listening. I checked out the bottom of Strut H for you, Pete. What's this about? I asked Pliska to look around. Knowing Fat Man, I can't shake the feeling that all the bombs so far were just wrong. So did you find anything? Yeah, a hell of a lot of C4s packed into the bottom of a strut. Pete called it right. I knew he had the real thing up his sleeve. So all the other ones were dummies? No, they're a threat, all right. But the detonation wouldn't be enough to destroy the entire shell. But the C4s Pliskin found would inflict serious structural damage. That's oh, not the bad news either. Oh, yeah. These are sensitive. He goes slap. What? New model. The ionization sensor can't detect them. The whole thing is sealed tight to prevent vapor leak, and there's no trace of that cologne signature. Pete, looks like he fooled you. Yes. But you managed to find the thing anyway. It was sheer gotcha, luck. Yeah. Bombs that are invisible to the sensor? Any ideas, Pete? Are there more out there? I will see for myself. You can't move fast enough. He's right. I can try the spray from a distance. Hold on. There's something not right about this one. I can feel it. Well, Pete, should I come back and get you? No, there's no need. Raiden, you have one left to go, correct? Right, except for those scentless ones. How about you, Pliskin? I have two left, not counting this one. Okay, it'll have to be me. I have the level four card that'll get me into shell two in any case. You'll never make it. With that bad leg of yours, they'll spot you for sure. That won't happen. I, I can walk just fine. What? I can even run. What do you mean? That bomb, five years ago, I messed up. Even with all my experience, I lost it. In a church of loss and explosion. All those kids playing nearby, too. These past five years, I've lived a lie. Lied? Yes, lied. I didn't lose my leg in the explosion. So many dead. All because of my mistake. All I could think about was hiding from the crime, shielding myself from the public outcry. I wanted people to be sorry for me, for my weakness. I faked being a victim myself because I couldn't bear to face the families of the real victims. This is no prosthetic. I can keep my footing on catwalks and hike over deserts. I live my life so well I haven't even answered to myself for my sins. It was supposed to be a shield has become a shroud instead. I've killed my soul by playing the victim. Instead of protecting me, it's made my life even more hellish. What good can that do the victims? I know. Sir. I'm a coward. Hey, Pete. God forgive me. I can walk with my own two feet, and I need them to stop Fat Man. His crimes are also mine. One of omission and arrogance. No one should teach the skills I taught him without a clear conscience. This is the only way I can defuse my own sins. 
I get you, Pete. That one's all yours. You got it, Ryden? I understand. Pete, I've taken care of guards in struts G and H of Shell 2. I wouldn't recommend you go into any of the other struts. I owe you one. I'll get back to freezing the baby bombs, then. You do that too, right? I'm on it. I'll have the radio with me if you need to get in touch. Just don't ask for Peg Neg Peter. He's gone for good. I'll still ask about Peg Leg Pete. Hey, Peg Leg Pete. Hey, you were the bomb disposal guy, right, Peg Leg Pete? Hey, Peg 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 Leg Beat. You should probably concentrate on that thing that you're doing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Pete's leg is okay. Yeah, so... He's a big fat phony. He's a big fat phony! You should concentrate on that thing you're doing. You were saying things! <laughs> so you gotta parrot it back? Yes! Okay. Oh, oh, thank you. It does make me feel validated when you do that. <laughs> <laughs> like, maybe you're listening? Except for when you do that. <laughs> I'm gonna leave you be. You go ahead and handle that. I'm gonna be talking with everybody. Speaking of which, let me look at the chat. Okay. I don't know if you would need to prove it, Tina. I mean, he had a cane. That seemed like clear evidence to me. It's the fact that he didn't show you this horrible, uh, this horrible scar on his body that set you off. Your curiosity is something else, kid. I mean, when was the last time you saw somebody walking around with a cane and then demanded to see if their leg was fake? I mean, regardless if you were right, because you were right about this, about Pete. There you go. Take a sleep. Oh, I thought he might have fallen on his stomach. I could have shot the radio. Hmm. Oh well. Yes, Kim, you're right. Did call Tina a kid. Yes, but not all the people disabled. Well, sure. But what if you saw a random person? What if you saw a random person walking around with their cane and you're like, they must not be disabled because they won't show me their leg. Get a ration. The way I roll. Oh, there's the nerd. You got the nerd? I found the nerd. I think this is set up now. Is it? Cool. Maybe. Is this Bitcoin? What? No. <laughs> no, it's just bits. It's just bits. <laughs> and they happen to represent coins. Yeah. Not Bitcoin. Of course not. What a thing to say. <laughs> Let me get my sensor going. Oh, he's on it. <laughs> Just scoot, please. Uh-oh. Oh no, they're gonna send a patrol in and I gotta get out of here. <laughs> Just killed that I guy. Gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta go. I gotta go. I have the last C4 frozen. There's nothing showing up on the sensor now. 
Good work, Ragnar. You're way ahead of me, kid. I still have one to go. How's your bomb, Peter? It's a bomb, all right. Sealed C4 and in huge quantities. You think there's another one in Shell 1? For sure. Somewhere at the bottom of Strut A. Why are you so Yeah, certain? see? If Kim figured it out, Tina. Strut is demolished. Shell 2 will be well It's not a bad ruse. You mean that Shell 2 will actually sink? Not immediately. There'll still be five struts left. But if Shell 1 loses a strut at the same time, it'll be a very different story. The big shell's structural integrity depends on a very exact balance. If both shells lose a strut each, the whole structure will tear itself apart under its own weight. What do we do? I have a sensor that can locate even those simplest C4s. Mm -hmm. It yes. makes combined use of neutron simulator yeah. and nice. hydrogen bomb detector. You brought that stuff with you? Of course. I made the calibrations while I was in the pantry. Does it work? I just tested it, and it definitely responds. But the best I can do is a sound. So it is the, the YouTube sound stream that's the going on right now. Is that going to go away right now? The closer the target. I figured I this can be our last YouTube There's another one in that right. pantry, I would say. You can go back and get it. It's all Church yours, boom, right? And you got Owie like, it's so hard to understand from that. <laughs> yeah, no matter how, how it, it exploded, it can't explode. Yes. Okay. We were talking about stand by until the validity of Peter's end. story. And I was saying, it's, it seems like entirely viable that somebody could... Like, that, that seems like a believable story. Where are these guys coming from? Oh, they're coming from that way. I'm out of here. Goodbye. Goodbye. I must return to the pantry. Will this be your uh, workout room? Yeah. When I come back to it later. Churches don't randomly explode. <laughs> mm. Yes, they do. If someone has bombs there, that's true. Oh, good. He landed on his radio. Or he landed on his stomach. Well, he was, he's a bomb disposal guy. It's implied that there were bombs there that he had to go and dispose of, and he messed up. And people died. Oh, it wasn't implied. It's what he said happened. Yeah. Oh. New bomb sensor. I don't know why. I just like how big and chunky these boxes are for yeah. such a small item. You gotta make them big, though. Mm -hmm. So that people There's can see they're them. They're kind of low poly, but the textures is what makes them look kind of... Yeah. Low. Peter, I have sensor B. Good. Head to the bottom of strut A. How's your invisible bomb? I'm looking at it, but I'm keeping my distance. How's Pliskin doing? A few more minutes. I just got to the last strut, but there are a few enemy sentries I have to take care of. Does it look bad, Peter? Maybe. It's an odd one. The detonator hasn't been activated. What? But the sensors are live, which means... This is Pliskin. Tina, he did mention that. <laughs> is that it? I'm about to freeze it. Then... Wait! Pliskin! Hey, PJ time. Cute. Damn! That was it! What's going on? The detonator just woke up. It's counting uh -oh. down! Uh-oh. What happened? The big ones were rigged to be activated when all the baby C4s went offline. Right. The one in Shell 1 should be counting down, too. Hurry! What's the remaining time? 400 seconds. 400 seconds? Oh, big Obama. Right. Move. Get to the bottom of strut A now. Move, brother. I must move, brother. Big Obama. Now King Babam is ready. King Babam. I'm gonna get over there and it's just gonna be the bomb and it's gonna be all like bit 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 <laughs> I'm thinking the same thing. Yo Mario 64! Yo Mario 64 though. No Louis really excited about it. I'm excited. <laughs> she says, stop wasting time, go, go, go! I'm going, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going! I got it. Here you go. Thank you. Do your thing. Oh, 
don't know if I can do my thing. Spider went to go get the stuff. Ran his eyeball. I don't feel good about that, but I need to get across this bridge. Okay, here I go. Call time. Right. Listen. Listen carefully. What is it? I fell for it. Fell for what? That man has my number. A proximity trigger. Microwave. My microwave? With a seven foot range. It's not a technique I taught him. Neither was that multi bomb booby trap. Looks like he's far surpassed me as far as explosives technique goes. As for the rest, Pete, get the hell out of there. There's less than 30 seconds left. It's too late. No! Pliskin, get away from Strut Edge as fast as you can. Pete! Right! Keep your distance. Use the spray from as far away as possible. Me? You can do it. I know that. I'm not so sure. But I am. Do it. I know you can. Dang. I can't believe Peter Stillman's dead. I can't believe it. Oh, I can run ads now. Oh, cool. You know what's not cool? Mm. Peter Stillman dying. Yeah, that's... that's okay, so let's see. This one will show up. Oh, okay, this one will not show up on our radar. It'll just beep if we're close. Welcome back, Kimmy. Yeah. It just beeps. Where could it be? Where could it be? We only have a, 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 a minute, like quite a lot of time still. <laughs> we only still have a lot of time. Hold on. Let me. Okay, I'm getting a chirping. It's close. It's very close. What do you think, gang? Where do you think it is? <laughs> what do you think it is, guys? seconds. I was gone for a minute and I hear that Peter is dying. What the WTH? Yes. I mean, we know where it is. Yeah, I might have, well, yeah. We're just having fun at this point. Yeah. So we have a million years. Yeah. Tina says, I feel like it's in the inside wall of the vat of water. Definitely close. I mean, you're like right up on it. Yeah. Could be around here somewhere. Else. What? What could it be? Somewhere around here. Somewhere around this. I'm trying to find like where to get it before I kill you, Smatter. Okay. It's under the sub. Now, 
mind you, on harder difficulties, bomb placement is rearranged. Yes. Which I love. It's pretty cool. Bro, why don't you go ahead and get some food? Okay. Colonel, I'll get some in a bit after you. The bomb. After you come Good on back. Work, okay. Right. It was a I great loss for everyone. Beaks up. Yes, it was. Colonel, any damage report on the explosion? Seems that the ducts for diverting the contaminated seawater was destroyed. And the central section of Shell 2 is flooding. The explosions ignited the oil slick on the surface. What about the toxins? The chemicals stayed in containment. There's no immediate danger. Is the big shell stable? Shell 1 was unaffected. The price was high. But the threat of the bomb is over for now. What's the next objective? Rescue the president. Get back to the upper level. Roger that. <laughs> If you knew it was there, Kimmy, then why did you say it? I kept asking. But you didn't say. I guess you're too cool for this game. Kimmy do be too cool. I'm gonna do a few pull-ups before I go. You know, really get that nice jacked uh, forearms going. You basically just want to, you know, keep solid reps and breathe as you go, bro. I'm going to start calling him the Chad Raiden. Alright, let's go. Here's what I don't get. I'm trying not to think about it. But I see it every time he presses up against the bars. Run got big booty and it's over the rails. I don't like it. <laughs> Colonel, I'm dummy thick. I don't know if that's okay. It's okay. Right. The terrorists have retaliated for our bomb neutralization. What? A hostage has been killed. Shot in the head. They shot one of them on the roof just to make sure we caught it. One of our satellites caught it clear as day. Damn. They announced they would kill one every hour from now on. What are my orders? What should I do? Stay with your mission objective. Rescue the president. What about the other hostages? President Johnson is your first priority. Priority my butt. They're all in danger. Jack, be reasonable. I know what you're feeling, but you can't save them all. No, not by myself. Are you expecting that Pliskin to come through? Well. Looks like he's turned his radio off, too. I can't complete this mission by myself. That man was not included in the simulation. Hey, Will. He is not Will saying, uh, mission. just stopping by what real quick, say that, I can't Colonel, wait for the Kung Pao talk later tonight. To which I say, Will! The seals. No second attempt. Why didn't you just message us even gotten to in the Discord that. chat? All we can do is I appreciate wait. you hanging on by. In the meantime, you, though. You're our only hope. Oh, I know. Right Go and rescue the but he only showed up just to say, to hey, we're doing this thing later. Work? Leave him alone. I'm kidding. I said Gosh, I'm grateful darn. to see him. You're leave the Will only alone. one upset about this. Everybody, yeah. tell Snyder to leave Will alone. I know. It would say, stop it now. Oh, cutscene. Thank you, Tina. I can't tell you how happy I am that you were alive after all. I knew this moment would come. Show yourself and finish me. Like you finished off my father. Otherwise, you'll be the one to die. <laughs> oh. go, let Spider do what he wants. Eagle's <laughs> just being angry. Wow. <laughs> okay. But he's so mean to Will all the time. Because I like Will. You're re you're really mean to people you like too. Yeah, but but I, you can't but? you can't just show proof of that. <laughs> I can I can point onto the podcast and be like, look at how mean he is to Will. Oh, he's just spilling. I know. Maybe you can give me death. 
So just because I don't have physical evidence, it's okay. I can deny it. <laughs> okay, cool. I'm not denying it. He's a bad shit where it's traveling. Oh gosh. Oh, I'm on fire. I'm on fire. I like this song. It's a good song. It's called Yell, Dead Cell. Fortune. Now we fight. Now you must fight fortune. I got a clear shot. You missed. Okay, well, I, I think that's a little unfair. What are you doing? What do I do, guys? What do I do? I wonder if I can over the top here. Nothing happened. Whoa! Thought for sure I was uh, out of the far enough out of the way. Wow, she is really taking this place apart. <laughs> you go boom boom murder. Boom boom bomb murder. Let's just hang back for a sec. Fortune, let's just talk this out. Let's talk this out, Fortune. Oh great, now who's showing up? Fortune, would you be less upset if I called you Queen? Cause you Queen. Sorry. Well, there's got to be a way to beat her. Let me get down low. Yeah. Maybe she'll run out of rounds. <laughs> I think she'll get tired and leave me alone. And her rail gun. Her bleeding rail gun. Man. Right. Fat Man just contacted us directly. Fat Man called us? Yes. Looks like he placed a bomb on the heliport. He specifically asked for you, right? What? He's killed off Peter. Now he's after you. Why me? How should I know? Look, this is really not a good time for this. The countdown's already begun, right? Great. How much time do I have left? I'll show you the count. 400 seconds remaining. So he's planning on taking this place out. It looks like he has a different agenda from that of Dead Cell. What about backup? None. There's no time. Which type of explosives is it? He didn't say. Oh, dang. That is a good question, though, Kimmy. Bombs? I'll take over, Queen. What is it? It seems our friend Fat Man is out of control. Uh -oh. He'll actually try to destroy this place? Yes, this could unravel everything we've planned. But why would he do such a thing? Who knows? But he's nothing more than a stereotypical mad bomb. He's completely lost sight of our ideas, and with it, his loyalty to Commander Jackson. All right, I'll take care of the wayward soul. It wasn't him. Unfortunate. I expected more of this one, real. But he couldn't give me really? what saved. Completely useless. Then he's all mine. Later, then. Now! Oh, I can start putting in emotes now. <laughs> Neat. Not yet. Gotcha. I'm still setting up. No. No. 
That death was meant for me. Why am I the only one who can't die? Alone again? Cheated out of death again? <laughs> How long will you force me to live? Wow, he dead. How much longer, Dad? I'm gonna go ahead and close the you blinds again. Me enough. Okay. Tina, don't you know that there's no such thing as vampires? I thought you could give me peace. But you couldn't kill me either. Do you think maybe he was just a weirdo with knives? <laughs> no, a wizard with knives. Oh, you're right. He's Romanian and a wizard with knives. You're right, did you describe him as that? Oh, poor fortune. Her best friend. Her only living friend. You shot him and now he's dead. <laughs> There's no need for sorrow, Queen. I died once already. Remember that? No, I just I was about to send that. Oh, I didn't do that. I can't. I'm surprised. <laughs> I'm gonna turn up the brightness on there because you're killing your eyes looking at this thing. Mm hmm. Anyway, surprise! Surprise! He survived somehow. Let's go. <laughs> Vamp was just kidding. He was just joking, guys. I wasn't really dead. It was just a joke. Do -do -do. <laughs> I'm okay! I'm, I'm surprised that first one didn't hurt you. <laughs> Must have just been facing the wrong way. Yeah. I seriously doubt there are any more here. I'm pretty sure I got them all. Yeah, you got them both. Yeah. You got me good, video game. Got him. It seems that someone set us up the bomb. Gotcha. Got him. Shake him down a little bit. Nothing. Yeah, nothing. Then you are useless to me! Hey, Cyrus. Welcome. Welcome. Oh, never mind. I was just kidding. It was just a joke shot. I didn't mean it. And do I have level two? Pretty sure. No. Still got level one. Yes. Check up on your buddy. Surprise! Yes! Oh, I need that level two. What's Will going on about? What is Will going on about? I don't know. I saw it. Uh, because I was text. ordering lunch. Clash of, Clash of Champions is super. Er, is coming, Smiter, and your snake style won't work against my brawler beatdown style. Dude. Lol. Cool. I don't play that game, Will. So you're probably right. Hey, play Smash Bros, Will, and then we'll talk. 
I'm not even gonna <laughs> say anything. Will, if you got Smash Bros, that would be great. Well, I apologize for my brother. <laughs> Will, I'm grateful that you're good enough to be able to take a joke. Oh wait, Nothing no, I'm supposed here. to go up on top of this one. I'm up, no, but I'm mad. Okay. Sub, 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 sub. Tina, when can I fill my ears with your podcast? <laughs> That's right. I'll be I coming out already... hopefully sometime today. I was about to say. I finished it's... recording this morning. Yeah. No, this should, was, this should be episode three, right, Tina? Yes. Hope you can find the bomb, bro. I'm sure it's super well hidden. I know. How will we find the bomb? I better use the sensor. Where is the bomb? Where's the bomb? Oh. 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 Where could it be? Where's the bomb at? It's not over there. Where's the bomb? It's not over there. You put an intro sometime later. Maybe I'll edit it now and upload it. Yay! I was very lazy today. That's okay. Wait. You hear that? What is that? What is that? What was that noise? So you're the one. You're right on time, I see. I like a punctual man. Is he dead sound? I am Batman. I am the greatest that humanity has to offer. And the greatest and the lowest. Hear this rhythm? It's the rhythm of time. And life. Don't you tell me I used to hang around department store clock counters. Oh my gosh, he's a roller angel. I like my toast like I like my full sweet tea cups. Keep them coming. Yeah. Bombs tell the time with every moment of their existence, and nothing else announces its own end with such a fanfare. Glad you could make it. The party's about to start. Look at his beautifully manicured fingernails. Yum. Good year. Let's drink the Stillman, shall we? If you destroy the big shell, you'll never collect your ransom. Ransom? What are you talking about? I'm talking about thirty billion dollars in cash. <laughs> <laughs> so that's what's going on. What the hell are you talking about? <laughs> boy, 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 boy. Oh, no soon enough. And I could care less what they planned. My ambitions are much more simple. To be the most famous bomber of them all. You're nuts! No one's gonna give a damn about you! Oh yes, they will. I'll go down in history. As the man who beat Peter Stillman. That's the only reason I assisted them. Like hell you beat Stillman. He had your number. What did you say? You have what? nothing of his courage. <laughs> or... <laughs> what are you laughing at? Laugh and grow fat. That croc died a dishonorable death six months ago. Six months ago. The liquidation of Dead Cell. Call it what you want. Only the right stuff survived that hell. Set me free, you know. Open the way to a new dimension. So that I can become the emperor among detonation devotees. You're nothing but a common criminal, and that's the only way people will ever remember you. I'm an officer. Wow. That is why I dislike boorish military types. It's time to start the party. This is how it works. I plant a bomb, and it'll explode soon after that. If you prefer to stay in one piece, you'll have to disable my bombs. Laugh and grow fat. Let's move. You guys ready to see a fat man fly? This guy is fast.
Find the bombs. Like spray the bomb. Here we go. Did we decide what we wanted uh, hmm? the channel points to be called? Uh, the lazy man in me says bison dollars. <laughs> bison dollars? Uh, but I feel like something more unique to us should be there, right? What sucks is that all my ideas involve days in cold air. But then again, I mean, it wouldn't be the first time we put the we put the horse before the cart. That's true. Do you have any idea? I have ideas, but again, it would be it would be in reference to Days of Colbert. Mm. Oh, I was thinking like Roscoe Dollar Reviews or something. It's really I like dollar reviews, but I don't know about Roscoe dollar reviews. We just go with dollar reviews. Oh no. I actually wanted to do something like Schmeckles, but <laughs> Schmeckles is. Like, it should be unique to us, right? Do -do -do. Left. Well, says, thank you, Tina. Maybe one day we can have the honor of being interviewed by you guys. Uh, we'd love to have you on whenever we can. It's like the Joker and the Penguin merge together during the fusion dance. I don't want to imagine the Joker, the, the Joker and Penguin doing a fusion dance. I wouldn't. I don't want to see Penguin moving as at all. If I can get away with it. <laughs> this guy is fast. Man, he's fast. If you're clever enough, you can catch him while he's playing some bombs. We should have channel points available now, guys. So if you reload the stream, maybe uh, you can see them. For now, yeah, just, let's just call them channel points. Mm. We'll come up with a better name later. I'll have more, like, things that can be, be done at some point. Hey bro, why haven't we started Days in Cold Air? Because we're working on Derby. I mean, like, Days in Cold Air is a side project within Derby. It's just us. It doesn't need to be a massive thing. It's just four comas. I mean, if you think you can, you can spread your attention around. I don't think I've been doing it over the years. Where's the bomb? Someone set us up. Is it under? Oh, there you are. It is under. Give me a run for my money, fat man. I have to go through these rewards and stuff at a later time. Because I'm not paying attention to chat. I reloaded the stream. Yep, final points. Thank you for the congratulations. Let me get some pasta. And Dunzo, sleep. Sleep now. <gasps> Yay, channel points. My sword. over for you that's what you think what do you mean what did you
did you just do? What is this? I have beautiful hands. These delicate hands can craft works of art. Answer me, what the hell is this? It's the switch for the biggest bomb of the entire place. Huh? No use. Once it's activated, there's no stopping the count. Where did you plant it? Where is it? Somewhere in this area. Don't worry, it's very close by. Where is it? Go ahead, shoot me. I'm already dead. Damn! Think you can find it? When it goes off, it'll take the big shell with it. Tell me where I can find the bomb! That's your problem. This is the highlight of the party. Bring it on, I say. They'll be happy, too. I die here and start my legend. Too bad you won't be around to see the movies. Laugh and grow fat. We gotta find the bomb. Find the bomb. So what's really neat is that if you do do what I did and you reduce his stamina instead of his health, he'll have the little knocked out stars right there. Otherwise, he'll just be dead. But anyway, we must find the bomb! And Kim, I'm sorry to say that he is not the bomb. He's not the bomb, but he is hiding the bomb. Oh! Peter Stillman. Why did he have Stillman's dog tags? Because he went, I guess he actually physically went down. Went down there and got him. <laughs> He's like, I beat him. I hey. beat Peter. Hey, Gimian. Gimian has been lurking. He is the bomb. Yes. Laugh and grow fat. Laugh and grow fat. Good work, right? Looks no, like I said all it too early. Neutralized. One I've of ruined the main it. leverages is now gone. That leaves. Colonel, Fat Man didn't seem to know about the ransom demands. Intentionally kept in the dark, I'd say. He seemed to be coming from a very different place from the other terrorists. Mm. Right. A lot of hostages, our president included, are still in danger. Keep your mind focused on protecting them. Why does it seem like the colonel's them. being secretive again? What are my orders? Rescue the president. We have no idea where he is. You haven't been in the central core yet. I suggest you start there. Wait, I have another call. Want me to take it? No, I'll go offline. Best to keep our presence unknown. How you doing, kid? Pliskin, is everything all right? Could be better. Looks like I was out cold for yes. a while. How did you manage to stay alive? Had a little because help I from wanted a friend. to be funny. Friend? <laughs> what about the bomb? You silly. Diffused. And Fat Man, too. That's good news. How Shell, too? It's a mess. The bomb crippled H Strut. And what about the toxins? The what? If the big shell blows up, the explosion is expected to produce massive amounts of toxins. You never heard anything about that. Huh? Well, looks like there's not much danger of that in any case. But the central core is starting to flood. It won't last much longer. Well, what about the president and the other hostages? They weren't in Shell 2. They must be in Shell 1. We need to get the hostages out of here now. It's too far from Manhattan for a swim. What about the lifeboats? There doesn't seem to be any. It doesn't make sense. So a chopper is our only extraction? Right. And it comes with a passenger limit. Intel has it that there are about 30 hostages. And take more than a single trip. We'll have to come back. Can you pilot a chopper? No. But I brought a gearhead with me. Hey. He's a good guy. I'll introduce you later. Pliskin, I'm on the heliport right now, but I don't see their the gearhead, Harrier. you say? It's out somewhere. We better move now, then. Our chances with a Harrier after us are close to nothing. Do you know where the President is? No. That one's all yours. The President is at the top of our rescue list. These are our orders, Lieutenant JG. Your orders, not mine. What? See you later. Okay, bye. 
I like sometimes when they still have questions. It's like, okay, bye. Okay, bye. <laughs> Wait, oh, uh, okay. Okay. It feels weird. Like, I'm looking at bits and stuff that I can give. Mm -hmm. It feels weird giving you bits. Yeah, you shouldn't give me bits. But I, I want to be the number one in the chat. <laughs> can you give me bits? <laughs> why would I give you bits? Yeah, why on earth would I do that? What the? Identify Ray Fox? I'm like you. I have no name. Are you Mr. X? Hmm. Wait. But come. Let's get it's out of here somehow. Follow me. Are you with Foxhound too? Neither enemy nor friend. Just a messenger from the Lali Lule Lo. Lali Lule Lo? What does that mean? The other guy was talking about the Lali Lule Lo before. This is safer, I think. Safe from what? Eavesdropping, of course. Alright. Why did you contact me? I've been ordered to give you backup, including a relaying of necessary intel. Ordered by whom? Why won't you identify yourself? There is no need for you to know. I'll decide whether I need to know. You are not yet trusted to make such decisions. I'll tell you something you do need to know instead. The current location of the president. What? Or rather, the person who knows the current location of the president. Who is it? A secret service agent named Ames, currently being held with other hostages. Secret service, huh? Mm. The head of the president's security detail, Ames has been fitted with the same type of VIP nano-machine system as the president. If you are within range, you should be able to communicate. Why are you telling me this? Do I need to repeat myself? There's no reason for me to believe any of this. You understand that? Of course, but you also have no choice but to believe. Do you have any other leads? Where are those hostages? <laughs> the hostages are being held in B1 conference hall. In the Shell 1 core, you'll find Ames there. What does he look like? We don't know if it is indeed a he. I've never met this person anywhere. How am I supposed to look for someone without even a description? Use your ears. What's that supposed to mean? Ames has a pacemaker. You'll be able to hear the machine sound in a heartbeat. You expect me to walk up to these hostages and listen to every one of their heartbeats? The sound is too minute to detect an amplifier. You'd be captured immediately. So what am I supposed to do? Use the directional microphone. There's one somewhere in the core. Take this. The security guard will unlock all level 2 security doors, including the one into the core. It's called a PAM card. It works together with your body's own electronic field. And watch yourself. The core is more heavily guarded than any other section of the big shell. You'll get nowhere just like that. Try this instead. One of the terrorists? <laughs> the surveillance camera won't let you on the elevator without the right uniform. You want me to disguise myself? Men assigned to the core and those on perimeter duty are given different colors to wear. Your new outfit will work in some areas, not others. The uniform alone won't fool them either. You're talking about weapons. Right, you need an AK. But I saw them carrying an AN-94. All men assigned to the core section carry AKs. So without an AK-74U, someone will see through me really quick. You could take care of the weapon issue yourself. One other thing. There's more? You'll also have to pass a retinal scan to get into the conference hall. Biometrics. Crap. Nothing but the real thing will suffice. 
This section is not an option here. We have to take someone's eyes. I suggest you hurry. They have a nuke on their side. The nuke? They have a nuclear weapon with them? You didn't find their continuing presence here unusual? Even with the president as hostage, this is an island, and they have no visible means of escape. Even if they do have a nuke, the warhead is no good without an access code. The security lockout can't be bypassed. They don't need to. They have the code. You saw it too, I believe. The Navy man would have a handcuff. The other half of it is on the football, or the black case if you like. The nuclear button. And now they have it. Nukes. They got nukes. Why did they have to bring the football along? To a decontamination plant of all places. But they did have to. Because, after all, the big shell is the farthest thing from a cleanup plant there is. What? Dead said it didn't have to bring the nuke along with them. It was right here to begin with. Nothing in this affair is what it seems. A cover-up? But why? For what? For the Metal Gear that is housed here. Metal Gear? Metal Gear? Everybody in the chat write Metal Gear. Metal Gear! Metal Gear! This place is the R&D Center for its newest incarnation. What the hell is going on? <laughs> Better ask games the rest. <laughs> What's this for? You might be glad you have it. Keep the controller's vibration function on. What do I need a cell phone for? Gone freaking ninjas, man. Wood. Colonel, who is that man just now? He's not one of ours. No, we have no one like that in our unit. He said that the big shell was housing a new model of Metal Gear. First I've heard of it. Colonel, what are you not telling me? I've been completely open with you, Raiden. I've told you everything. Is that everything you know, or everything I need to know? Snap out of it, Raiden. I'll have the Metal Gear rumor Dina, looked into. Give us a little Metal Gear to make in the contact chat. with this Ames. You know, you gotta say Do Metal you believe Gear. that ninja? Since we have no leads on the president's current location, we have no other alternatives. Right now, collect as much data as you can, including anything on Metal Gear. Are those my orders? Yes, they are. Disguise yourself as an enemy soldier and infiltrate the Shell One core. Understood. Should be easy, right? Yeah. We yeah. got half the disguise already. We got disguise kit. We got, or you can cast disguise self. I right, now we're gonna go with disguise. How high is your charisma? Right, right in is a rogue and not an arcane caster. Right. Uh, I was uh, so just mentioning the chat. Kit. Well, well, you're the DM, so you tell me. Well, hold on, let me look at my character sheet. We're looking at a plus uh, plus ten. Plus ten to disguise? Yeah. Or for deception checks? Yeah. Well, disguise check. Mm. Oh, sorry. Are we playing Pathfinder or Fifth Edition? Uh, mm. Or do they do they do they bundle disguise into deception? I can't remember. Because uh, disguise is separate from deception. There, there is no disguise skill. No, uh, no. Okay, so it would just be deception. Mm -hmm. All right, let me get the other papers. <laughs> <laughs> He's somebody there. And you'd probably be proficient in deception. I would definitely be proficient in deception. Uh, we don't actually have to take anybody's clothes. The no. clothes were already given to us, as yeah. you can see. From Mr. X. I am very curious about Mr. Cla careful, there are Claymore mines about. Good thing I picked them up. Mm, don't they reset sometimes? Nope. Seems fishy to me. I don't trust it. <laughs> I hope you don't get blown up. I hope I don't get blown up either, and as soon as it happens, I will be all like Jingles was right. Go. Freeze! Huh? Nothing here. Yeah, 
he's got a goodie for you. Don't kill me. Shake, shake, shake. That's me. Audience. That's me. <laughs> we gotta beat somebody, beat somebody up and take their eyeballs. Yes, of course. Take me off the C4. Play more mines. Play more mines. I guess that would make you a mine reader. Jingles and I found this out yesterday when I was doing a practice run. Yes. Yes? Yes. What did we find out? No, not. <laughs> we found McFarland toys. They're good. Mm -hmm. They're very good. They've, they've made a lot of uh, Metal Gear Solid uh, toys. And I need them. Man, they are I amazing. Need, I need them. Okay. That's a trap. It's okay. I have the thermal goggles. Because I don't smoke. That's right. I got it! Yo, it's all good, bro. Got the M4. It's a handy gun. Actually, I could just shut this thing off right now. Mm -hmm. Yep, no lasers. Can kind of call us whatever he wants, uh, Kim. But you should tell Louie that he needs to be in on this stream. Yeah, where is Louie? Where is Louie? Dang. I'm gonna hop on down. Somebody there. What's that? Nothing. Don't worry about it. Nothing. Nothing. Gosh. Bamboo boy. Looks like you've got an AK. I just thought it was funny because you wear it like almost six feet out, or whatever. You carry an AK. I I you can run. pass yes. for one of them. That is correct. Listen up, kid, and don't forget this. Only the guards in Shell 1's core are armed with AK rifles. The others That's are armed with the AN-94, the official rifle of the Russian army. If you hope to disguise yourself as the enemy, you don't want to be carrying an AK outside of Shell 1's core. Should have load up before we go. Yep, this is an armory after all. Ouch! Ouch! Very scary and tall. Yes, very scary. They scare everyone away. Maybe later today I'll work on um, affiliate stuff. That sounds like a good idea. Mm. After Stram. I small, Tina smaller. We scared. Haha. <laughs> yes. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> man, I'm the man. I am awesome. Definitely something, all right. Got 
got it. See? No respawn. I'll grab these ones too for posterity's sake. Okay. Up, 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 up. <laughs> you gotta run fast. Yep. Gotta be careful. You won't get me this time, falling floor. We've died from that before. Yeah. A number of times. Was uh, not pleasant. All right, here we go. Sky time. I'm gonna munch. Okay. You want me to just Jingles. Go right for it? Jingles has got the controller now. Got a minute, Jack? Oh, well, come on, Rose. I found some information on where Solid Snake is interred. Oh, that's great. great. Shoot. I've located the grave site. And the body? Exhumed for DNA testing. Well, do you have the results? The right arm was missing, but there was no doubt that it was him. That body belongs to Solid huh. Snake. Okay. Mm. Definitely is Solid Snake. Must right be an imposter. Right. You sound disappointed. I guess. I guess I was kind of hoping to meet the legend in the flesh. I get you. But it looks like he's not behind this incident. Raiden, the president needs you, I think. Disguise yourself as enemy personnel and I'm infiltrate super already the core disguised. section. Your priority is to contact Agent Ames. Whoever that is. Uh, yes, hello, fellow soldier. <laughs> Gotta find the nerd. Perfect. Oh, some shaft grenades. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Oh, lady. Excuse me. M9 bullets, wonderful. Yes, hello, it is me, as the soldier guy. Soldier boy up in the... Oh! And I say nay. Can I 
here we go. Oh, soldier boy. <laughs> Yeah, it's pretty funny. Russian. Although I think we've been doing all right without rations. That worked out. You are cleared to enter. <laughs> Got it. You. <laughs> That's right. One of those hostages in there is Ames. The only thing we know is that Ames wears a pacemaker. His heartbeat should sound different from other people's, so use the directional microphone to locate him. You don't have a directional microphone, however. Find one first. The microphone is the only hope of identifying Ames among all the other hostages. The directional microphone should be somewhere in the core of Shell 1. Have you searched B2 of the core? No, I went straight here first. Hoping no problem. Police nuts. Another game by the day of Kojima. Still going there. Hey, there's a burp. <laughs> Maybe he was born with it. Maybe it's Maybelline.
Yeah, it's moving fast. So combo. Guys on the warpath. Baboom. Got it. I don't remember where it was. You have the directional microphone. According to our information, Ames has a pacemaker. This should make his cardiac pattern fairly distinct. Use the directional microphone to locate it. Is that it? Baboom! Baboom! Yes, yeah, baboom! Yeah, okay. <laughs> that almost happened. <laughs> that scared me. Hey, welcome back, Chris A. All right. Let's see if we can't do this again. I am standing guard. There we go. Got him that time. Retinol pattern recognized. You are cleared to enter. It's so weird because you can't push forward. You have to pull him backwards and then turn him around. Right. One of those hostages in there is Ames. The only thing we know is that Ames wears a pacemaker. His heartbeat should sound different from other people's. So use the directional microphone to locate him. Once you recognize Ames by his heartbeat, keep the microphone pointed toward him. Then push the action button and call out to him. If it really is Ames, he should respond in some way. What if it's the wrong person? The guards may get suspicious and come running instead. Security could get tighter, too. 
Try to be sure before you take the risk. Don't call out to a hostage with the action button until you're fairly sure that it's aims. If you do make a mistake, switch the microphone for an AK and get out of there before a guard gets suspicious. If you're discovered inside, they'll cut off your retreat and call in the reinforcements. You won't make it out of the room. The mission will be over if you're discovered. Don your disguise and look for aims while deflecting the enemy's suspicion. <laughs> Got it. Reporting no problems in the hall on B1 in the Shell 1 core. <laughs> Can you hear that beeping? Dum, 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 dum. Your aims, aren't you? I just remembered where he was. <laughs> brother, I returned. Hey, welcome back. My brother, I'm here. <laughs> I'm Richard Ames. Richard Ames. Hey, guys. Secret Service? I'm back. I'm done eating. No, I was uh, so Tina's saying, really yep, I can hear it as clear as day on my end. Oh, hey, Lestuk. You Lestuk. made it. Hey. You're here to find out where the president Lestuk, is. Lestuk, if you start watching over on uh, <laughs> Twitch, you can start earning we time, so channel points. points. We're, we're, we're affiliated now. We're, we, we got all affiliated. It. Yeah. So come on over right, and start so earning channel points. I have safety. no idea how to do that. I think it's just you just talk. No, you can just sit and watch. And you really? Earn channel points, yeah. Oh, wow. Just get it, keep it running. And then you can highlight your stuff? Yeah. Let me highlight my stuff. I want to try that out real quick. Are you on? Right here. Do you really know where the president is? Almost certainly. He was moved to the first floor of Shell 2's core section. The first floor? The core of Shell 2? Is he still there? I don't know. I can't get a response. You don't think he's been like the other hostages? Oh, wow, there it is. Hmm? A hostage was killed in retaliation after the SEAL-10 disaster, remember? What are you I'll talking about? I'll set up about? rewards soon. Mm. Regardless of what they do to other hostages, they won't touch the president. What makes you so sure? The case. You mean the nuclear button they took? Right. And the case won't do a thing by itself. That case may be the single most advanced example of a weapons failsafe system. The password is nothing less than the physiological data of the U.S. president. Physiological data? The mm. president's own vital signs, heartbeat, brainwave pattern, blood pressure, and so on, are constantly monitored and relayed by his internal nanomachines. This information, along with the DNA pattern, serve as a biometric password, unbreakable even by the latest parallel processor supercomputers. The password entry itself cannot be performed unless brainwave patterns and heartbeats fall within normal parameters, rendering chemical and other forms of coercion impractical. In other words, the login must be made of the president's own free will. As a failsafe, the input must also be reconfirmed hourly even after the initial login. If a valid confirmation is not forthcoming, the system will automatically cancel the login. And that's why they can't harm the president. At least until the bird flies. Is there really a new model of Metal Gear here? Absolutely. The black case serves as the launch key to Metal Gear as well. Why would they hide Metal Gear in an offshore plant? Haven't they told you anything? The entire thing was planned. The oil spill, the tanker accident that caused it, everything. Mm. The big shell was built specifically for the development of a new Metal Gear model. The inspection tour was to check its progress. What's going on around here? Wait.
Here comes Snake. Ah, uh, Snake. That's him? Use the microphone to listen in. Hey, Kimmy, if you want, share the, the music in the Discord. King. Fat she said that she did. did. Oh, okay. It doesn't matter. Saved us the trouble of getting rid of him ourselves. Why did he betray us? That's a lot of music. Who knows? To They're later. a band of lunatics to begin with. Nothing they do should come as a surprise. I'll have his background rechecked, just in case. You think he was working for them? We can't discount the possibility. Especially with that intruder still at large. Yeah. So the one on the right is the solid snake. You mm -hmm. know more about those suits than I do. But Foxhound was disbanded four years ago. So it must be the Patriots. What about the damage to Shell 2? The circulation system for the contaminated water has been damaged. The water being drawn in is overflowing. And the lower block of the central section is flooded. Seal the connecting pathway between shells 1 and 2. The Simtex and IR sensors are already in place. Any effect on it? No. What about the president? <laughs> Password entry is already made to the black case. In one hour, we'll need a confirmation from him. Mm. His work is done after that. Make sure you keep him alive until then. Yes, I know. What about the unit's activation? Almost complete. The code has already been entered. All we need now is for the girl to start the system. The usual method, I assume? No. The drugs took care of everything. Mm. Only a few more steps to outer heaven. Outer heaven? Somebody stepped in. that cyborg ninja, Shalashaska? I cannot even guess. What about you? I'm having the matter looked into. Olga, don't cast suspicion where it isn't due. Where it isn't due? When you watched my father die and did nothing. It's been two years ago, Olga. Let it go. I read the case file for Shadow Moses, by the I way. Olga, how could you suspect me? I know that the ninja is not one of my men. How meaningful you make that sound. If Sergei were still alive... If the old man were still alive, I wouldn't need to take orders from you. Olga, Sergei was my best friend. If you sell us out, I'll kill you myself. Listen, daughter of Sergei. Don't ever let me see your gun pointed at me again. I'll put a bullet in your back instead. Stop this infighting. I took you both in when no one else would. You think any government would have you as irregulars in this political climate? The worst kind of wet works, maybe. But even that's doubtful. I recommend against switching camps. You've nowhere left to go. do you think we spent on that arm in Lyon? The best transplant surgery team in the world. I never trust a Frenchman. Never French trust man. a Frenchman. There's something going on. The incidents are becoming more frequent. Maybe that man's presence. Ocelot, I leave this place in your hands. I have the intruder to take care of. Yes, King. You think so, Kimmy? Is that really Solid Snake? That's what he claims. I thought Snake was dead. Solid Snake did die. But he's also here in the shell. Either he survived or there are two of them. Two of them? And that's him. What did 
you manage to catch? They said password hmm. input was complete. I thought so. You said the password yes. entry into the black case had to be uh, made when we get the chance. President uh, if you could just That's sort right. of catch Chrissy so up where uh, is cooperating. Because Chrissy is back. It would have yeah. To be, yeah. Yes. Well, I saw Why? that, but I don't know where Probably Chrissy left off. Being a puppet, but it wasn't a if you can remember Chrissy, us. let us know and we'll try to catch you We're up. Running out of time. They will fire a nuke. You know what you need to do before then. Fire the nuke, but it's nowhere close to the ransom deadline. Ransom. Thirty billion dollars in cash. What are you babbling about? The nuclear strike is not a threat. It's been the objective all along. They plan to slaughter millions of people. No, a high altitude detonation. You've heard of the Compton effect? Total disruption of, of electronic of equipment effect? caused by EMMA pulse. Textbook answer. Okay, when an like... average nuclear warhead goes off within the atmosphere, can't do anything about that. The result is an electromagnetic pulse of up to 50 billion megawatts. We'll raid him EMMA later. The EMMA field can reach tens of thousands of volts per meter, and most electronic equipment will be toast in an instant. If one of the key movers of world economy stops functioning, it could mean the beginning of a global depression. I'll open him up. But that isn't their aim. Time. What they plan to do is liberate Manhattan. You can't stream on a streamer while you're streaming your own stream. Sons sure, of I liberty, I suppose. You can't sons stop me. Liberty. Damn, Ocelot is coming. I'm going Here we online. Go. Search my pocket. Hurry. It's a security card. You'll be able to unlock yeah, level three. The level three security. Finally, use it to get to shell two. Take care of the president before they launch the nuke. Ocelot. Oh, He's, He's coming here. Pick up your AK. Oh no. Oh, I hope I have enough He's time. He's coming here. I did it. <laughs> I literally don't know anybody that's messed up that part. Mm -hmm. I give you a million years to do it. I asked him to remove these. I'm ill, you see. I always knew that the DIA turned out second-rate liars. What are you talking about? No need for denials. We know what you are, Colonel Ames. <gasps> they knew that the president was planning to betray them. So they sent you in to keep tabs on him. Am I right? You. Sorry, Colonel. You failed to carry out your duties. You'll never escape the Lali Lule Lo. Is that so? I'll be honest with you, I have no idea where they came up with that. You. You. You tricked me. I understand now. Ocelot. You. Looks mm -hmm. like Ames had a heart you, attack. Which team are you with? Show me your I face. I thought you were gonna make a pun. <laughs> you know who he is. Bro, no, I never make fun of a dying man. Of mine. Except for those times Identify that I have. Yourself. Identify your smell. <laughs> we meet at last. My hair is out. Whoa. Not this time. Hold your fire. We need the hostages alive. Hurry, get away. You, but you died. Bjorg. Crazy. All right, Smiter Osco at the helm again. Oh, 
Oh, your tablet died. Ames is dead. Well, welcome back. Heart attack. Mm. Ames That's died of a heart attack. However, we do at least know where the president is. So there really is a new type of Metal Gear in this place? Apparently. Given the lighter. We're still looking into it. I've oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Told that the nuclear strike um, was so we met up with the Iroquois Plutarch from the start. He gave us some not the thirty and billion Whoa. dollars. I heard a beep. Whoa, right. what's going on? It was a cover up all along. Colonel, what are you keeping from me? Lester is now following. Back hey, hey. Lester, follow I'm closely, Lester. Uh, right in. Uh, uh, in uh, was given the orders to go and track down all the bombs by Peter Stillman. We tracked down all the bombs and neutralized them. But then all the bombs were a trigger for another bigger bomb, and then we took out that bomb. I like follow people. I will follow you. Thank you, Lester. Thank you, Lester. I appreciate it. But it's also true that they're about um, to get rid of the president. There's something and, else uh, going yeah. on here. Uh, the president may the be bombs able to tell you were set up. Uh, uh, were, were a trap to set up another uh, bigger bomb. We neutralized that bomb. Then uh, Peter Stillman got exploded because he got tricked. And then we went to go fight Fat Man. Jack, we defeated Fat Man. The and then we were like, go find the president. president. We're like, now. we don't know where the president oh, is. So we're like, go find Ames first. We're like, okay, let's go find Ames. And then we just got here. Found Ames, he died of a heart attack. That's where we're at now. All I gotta do is stay on my toes. Ah, oh, I didn't do a good job. Oh no, I'm dead, I'm dead, how will I survive, I'll carve my oil on my way to victory, <laughs> and it says yeah yeah, heart attack, <laughs> it's fox die I tell ya, <laughs> it's that dangle fox die, that dingo dangle fox die, does that mean that Raiden has fox die? <gasps> That was close. That, that thing was after you, man. Hey, burbs. Hey, burbs. Oh, wait, what am I doing? Silly me. Oh, yeah, I kind of Okay, let's run. Potentially, yes. It does seem similar to Fox Die. How weird. How woo. What does it mean, brother? What does it mean? Does it mean? Oh! Yeah. Uh, I got it. <laughs> Okay, we're okay, we're okay. We're okay. never given the list of who was enlisted in the Fox Die and who wasn't. That's true. That's too bad. Enemy sighted. <laughs> Hold you. <laughs> Getting the old switcheroo. No, don't die. It's okay. It's okay. We haven't died yet as Raiden. Yeah, actually. We're doing okay so far as Raiden. Uh, did we die a snake? Did you die a snake? I don't think so. Oh, they're right there. Ah! <laughs> Gotta find a I do. And I know one. And I think it'll work. You should 
do it. Yeah, they'll never find you now. Now, if I just chill out I, for a I minute. can literally see nothing on the screen right now. Oh, really? Yeah. That, that is dark. It's, it's the it's the glare, man. All right. There you go. Let's catch our breath for a second. I just wanted my extra supplies. Look at all those people down there. <laughs> no, they're all swarmed up. What the heck? They're all stanced up. Hand <laughs> grenades. Now oh, you need the PSG 1T. Sure use that. They're too dumb to check inside the doors. <laughs> I thought the lasers were still active. Nah, I took care of them. Okay. RGB6? Yep. Grenade launcher. Nice. Yeah, come on, you woozers. Man, the AI in this game is so much better than the AI in the in the first game. <laughs> it really it's is. ridiculous. Yeah. I like all these murder weapons that you're never gonna use. I know. And as such, you should never use them. There you go. Just... Oh, good. I already got a... They're open and ready for you. We'll just stuff this guy in here. No. <laughs> Caution's almost done. We'll be getting out soon. Man, yeah, man. Cool McFarlane toys. Yep. This is a hidey hole, too. This is a nice little hidey They'll hole. They'll never find you in there. <laughs> you losers. <laughs> what a bunch of losers. Who's this broad? Uh, bless the Soliton radar. Makes this game playable. And there's the PSG-1. Underneath the Trank variation. This is better. Actually, the regular PSG-1, I think, comes in handy at a later point, right? It does, but uh, you're gonna want you're gonna want to switch between the two of them. Right. Hmm. I'm trying to remember if there were any other. I think those are all. Did you the check the ones third. downstairs already. Yeah, both of those are level two, and the other ones underneath are level one. Okay, and you already checked those. Yeah. Okay. Then I think we're good. All right. Yeah, let's mosey. Let's mosey. Let's mosey. Hurry, brother. You need to get to strut F. Hurry, Raiden. Actually, you were in F. <laughs> I, think, I think it's D? We gotta go to the connecting bridge. It's all gravy, baby. How's everybody enjoying this so far? I'm gonna see what the rest are up to. Secret box. What's in the box? That's funny. There's a thing going on in uh, Gary's stream. I was just checking in. This is super cool. Love it. Yes. I'm glad everybody's having a good time. This is a game we love very, very dearly.
keeping an eye on the assault on radar to determine mm -hmm. a good course of action. I guess going underneath would be the best thing. Yeah. Going. <laughs> Just gotta knock this dude out. Going underneath will protect you from the guy with the binox up on top. Freeze. <gasps> Welcome back to the sediment pool. Ew. What other games do you guys like? Well, uh, I really like Zelda. I really like Mario. Metal Gear Solid is definitely up there. There's a lot of games that we love and are really looking forward to getting played. <laughs> Look at him run! Look at him run! Yep, going around. Moving on. <laughs> Moving on. Nothing to nothing to report. Nothing to report. Also, Jingles, thank you for your questions for the podcast. We answered the questions after an hour, I think. I don't remember, but they were good questions. Thank you. I enjoyed uh, sending them. Uh oh. Oh. Oh, this doesn't look good. Raiden, can you hear me? Pliskin, where have you been? Checking around. I'm in Strut H right now. How's the situation over there? We have a lead on the president's location. Where is he? Shell 2 core, the first floor. I'm cut off from the core where I am. It's a mess here. All right, I'm on my way to Shell 2 right now. There are IR sensors in place on the connecting bridge between shells 1 and 2. If you break the beams, the Semtex will go off. Yeah, I heard them talking about that. Target the control units and destroy them. Make sure you don't shoot the Semtex. What do the control units look like? Take a look with your binoculars. That's the Semtex. And that must be the control unit. Yep. Oh, you're bleeding. Just let me lie down for a little bit. Okay. You'll feel better? It's like a band-aid. Hmm. PSG1. Oh, he's in there? Okay. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Got it. Got it. <laughs> Thank goodness. Kev said congrats on being affiliated. Oh! Wow! Uh, <laughs> wow! Pliskin, yes. Uh, we uh, want to do thank you. that more now. Just answering the questions more. If you have any questions, you can just send them to me, and they will be in the next episode. Sounds good, Kim. I'm gonna have to lean a little bit. Well, I gotta. Apparently, sniping is enough to uh, just tear open my guts. Yeah. Just impossible. Oh, look at this flag, you guys. Hey. Actually, Sons, Sons of, of Liberty. Liberty. Yeah, you gotta stand up. Bizarre. Think I can hit that with the pistol? Yeah. Watch this. Watch this. Doom. Oh. Nice. Oh, shot. look at that. <laughs> look at this guy. Yeah, look at Watch that. this shot. Around. Watch this shot. Snack flag, yes. Insert bell here. I'm gonna make one of the, the, the channel things be um, singing, choosing a song for us to sing. Nice. It's 
it's it's that strapped was down easy. with Semtex. <laughs> It's all still alive. Yep. Because uh, there's one more somewhere. Did you did you shoot the one on to the left side over here next to the door? That guy? I, I think so. I thought I already got him. It looks like you got yeah. him. Yeah. So there's seems to be something back in there. Oh, there it is. Let me just take my pills right quick. And has me and then Nope. Still one more somewhere. There seems to be one behind you. Oh, there it is. Don't hurt the burbs. I'm trying not to hurt the burbs. Nobody Don't tell Shellmons that I'm burbs. doing this. Don't you dare Nobody hurt the burbs. Nobody tell Shellmons I'm doing this. You. Ooh, no, no, no. They're fine. See? Hurry up and shoot before the... Before the good stuff wears off? No, before the birds come back. I, I just did. I didn't see if it... I thought the light was still on. Oh, it is, yeah. Great, now the birds are back. <laughs> it's fine. Oh, got it. Okay, still alive. Still alive. So, uh, check behind the flag of the Patriots. Or the, the Sons of Liberty. Uh huh. Okay. Saw it. And there we go. Oh, hey. Heinz oh, Ketchup, so, thank so, you for raiding. Oh, so that's where Louie was the whole Hello time. Hello there. Is that where Louie was? Yeah, he's still like, raid. And I'm like, oh, Shadow Legends. No, no, I don't, th I don't think he did that. No? I don't know. Louie, Louie, Louie's do saying raid. Well, well, he was letting us know that, we're, that we got raid. Hi, Heinz. Hi, Heinz. We're playing Metal Gear Solid 2, Sons of Yeah, Liberty. see, he's raiding with a party of two raiders. Yeah. And that's why Louis was like, raid. Louis points out when raids happen. Gotcha. I gotcha now. Where was I? Oh, yeah. Uh, just no big deal. I took down all those uh, uh, power cores. Yeah, it was no problem. Yeah, it's just going to go ahead and cross the bridge, no problem. Hang on, let me get a call. Yeah, he just got home. What are you talking about? I found us a ride. <laughs> I'm all ears. One of the enemy's Kasatkas. Is it in good shape? Full tank. I'm heading for Shell 1 now. What about that Harrier? It's not on the heliport here. Good. I'll set this one down there, then. Can you cover the hostages? They're being held on level B1 in the core. Pliskin, you didn't happen to find any other places where hostages were being held, did you? No, nothing like that. Okay. Talking about How many hostages are there? Things. There's a few short of 30. <laughs> one dead and several wounded. The Kasaka's cargo area will hold 13 max. What about the How many hours have we logged in? Uh, I sabotaged Three? it. They Almost came four. Us at the nice. A couple more minutes. Oh, yeah. We got four hours in. Good. We'll have to make That's two good. trips. Almost longer. You Can you fly a like Kasaka? Maybe I have a pilot who's flown the civilian model. The KA-62 VR. There's not a whole lot of difference I'm between down. the military KA-60 and I'm the civilian I'm sure Gebs will still be streaming by then. for takeoff. Right. Let me introduce you to my partner, Otacon. Otacon? Hey, Raiden. It stands nice for me. Are you an otaku, too? Damn. Raiden, I'll talk to you later. Colonel, I need some answers from you. Who exactly is Pliskin and his partner? I know what you're thinking. <laughs> it keeps coming back to Shadow Moses. And now this Otacon... A.K.A. Hal Emmerich, Ph.D., a Shadow Moses survivor. Rose? Snake and Otacon both became fugitives after Shadow Moses, wanted for acts of terrorism. An anti-Metal Gear organization. They sabotaged and destroyed countless Metal Gear units throughout the yeah. world. And were responsible for the incident two years ago that necessitated the construction of the Big Shell. Snake and his partner aren't terrorists. Jack, why are you defending them? Because they're cool. I look back on what I've done here so far. And things like training and sense of duty alone won't get you through a sneaking mission like mm. this. Jack, are you okay? You need something higher. I can't think of the right word, but it has to be pure will. Backed up by, by courage or ideals or, or something like that. I'd stake my life on it. 
the solid snake that saved Shadow Moses couldn't turn into a terrorist. Maybe that's true, but they went down with that tanker two years ago. We even recovered Snake's body. And the DNA test results on the body say it's him. Jack, I know what you're saying, but Snake is dead. He can't be here, not even as this Dr. Hal Emmerich. But that also means that he can't be the terrorist leader behind this thing. Seems to be doing better. I mean, not snack. I mean, Fliskin. Heck! <laughs> you ruined it! No, this is not a blind run, but we're doing uh, a bunch of uh, uh, for our fans that are not familiar with Metal Gear. Oh, here we go. Chrissy, I will answer that question soon. A messenger from the Patriots. Well, we got to check this out. So you're the boss around here. No, not just around here. I'm the boss to surpass Big Boss himself. Solid Snake. No, that is not Solid Snake. How would Pliskin know that? Yeah, Pliskin. What a pleasant surprise, brother. Save it. Don't say you've forgotten me, Snake. Snake? Right, take cover! Snake, we were trying to not do that. I mean, let's get Look, he can be buff. Solidus snake. Load up. <laughs> Stop impersonating me. I mean him. Heck. <laughs> heck, darn, darn, heck, and darn. darn. You seem like you, uh, you know this stuff too, Heinz. Are you a fan? Are you a fan of Metal Gear too? <laughs> I'm sure we got him, right? I like his he combat girdle. You back the hell off of that. <laughs> it's not a combat girdle, it's a tactical vest. Sure. I mean, look at this Harrier. It's the Harrier. There's no way a Kasatka can take on a Harrier. Given Liquid and Solid as Snake, I wonder when they're gonna have Gassy Snake. <laughs> Solidus wants to be Big Boss. I'll drown you fools for I mean, he, kind of, he looks a lot like him. Yeah, he does. He's like missing an eye He should just he should just be wearing one just for aesthetic. Yeah. <laughs> it's like no, I, my eye works yeah, fine. Yeah, yeah. Oh, here we go. Also kind of kind of middle here. Yay! Yay! Us too! Right. This is the Stinger Missile Launcher. Sweet. Oh, sweet. You got a favorite Heinz? You have to shoot the Harrier down. Snake! Snake. Oh, which one? Uh, favorite uh, game? Yeah. Just play favorite Metal Gear game. Uh, what's your favorite Metal Gear game? Not a diehard fan, but I played MGS 1 and 2. Uh, actually hoping to play 3 for the first time tonight. 
Ooh. Ooh. Three is our favorite. Three is so strong. It's really good. Alrighty. So, uh, Chrissy was wondering, what is a Metal Gear? A Metal Gear is... Uh, it, it's it's referred to as something that would surpass both uh, that would arts, have, yeah. that, that would uh, blend the lines between uh, infantry and artillery. A metal gear between the two. There you are. You blow up the cassette it's possible to accidentally shoot it. He's fast! He's so fast. The carriers are so cool. There he is. Oh, he didn't like that. Not bad. Yes. I see Jingles has rewards now. Yes, I I'm working on custom ones. I don't have anything to offer yet, but after the stream is done, I'm going to work on them. A metal gear is a gear of metal. Metal gear is a WMD. You depend on who you ask, do you? Where is it? Oh, it's coming in. This can get out of the way. There you are. Oh, God, I got him. Uh, I'm okay. I'm okay. I thought for sure that was going to land. Me too. Man, spin me out. Is it, is it the power of spin? Is that the best thing do? Oh. Thanks, Snake. Thanks, Snake. I mean, Pliskin. <laughs> you see what messed me up? <laughs> some people try to. <laughs> some crazy people always trying to cartwheel upstairs. Yep. There we go. Two decent hits. I can nice. live with that. Good job. But if you want more uh, sort of practical and relatable terms, a Metal Gear is. With. You know, without the context of this universe. It's kind of just a giant robot. Yeah, they're usually just kind of giant uh, bipedal robots. Most of which are nuclear capable. Able to launch nukes and whatnot. Thanks, Snake. Actually, you know what? Pliskin, help! Thinking of a later scenario where you can just call in the real thing and shot for you. Yep. Sounds <laughs> amazing. Don't make fun of Solidus. He's trying very hard right now. I will always make fun of Solidus. <laughs> nice! You can't outrun a missile, Solidus. Oh. Oh no, oh. he's plunging flares. Oh no, those aren't flares. Those are not flares. I survived somehow. That was very scary. <laughs> I'll let you go out in style. What the? What the? <laughs> Solidus is great. Uh-oh. Ha-ha! He 
wasn't prepared for my just stay under it jutsu. You're doing pretty good. Yeah, you're doing alright. Don't shoot the Kasatka. I'm not gonna shoot the Kasatka. As long as it just stays out of the way. Right. Hide. Come back. Back to the reality. Oh, 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 there goes gravity. <laughs> Bye. Death cry is crazy. Bye. We got 11 viewers right now. Nice. Welcome Thanks everybody. Much. I hope everyone's still having a good time. Dodge. YouTube, we still have two viewers. Nice. Oh, there he is. Oh. Oh, he's so mad. He's so mad. He can survive that, right? Yeah, it just hits the water and he's fine, right? What the? There's something, there's something coming up. No. All right, that's pretty cool. Ray. Metal Gear Ray. That's Metal Gear. It's already active. Oh yeah, everybody in the chat write Metal Gear. Yeah, everybody, Metal Gear, write Metal Gear. Yes, that is a Metal Gear, yep. Specifically, its name is Metal Gear Ray. What if I was having an awful time? What if I, I was having a horrible time? <laughs> then I would be sad. I would be very sad. I would be sad because everybody thought we were boring. Nobody likes us. You know who nobody likes? Solidus. They got my eye. You guys want to see some weird stuff? Yes. <laughs> Hey, it's Yobi. Welcome. Fam, go! Named after Ray Charles. Ha! Fam, go! That would be pretty funny if it was named after Ray Charles. Mm -hmm. There he goes. Look, right on the water. Right on the water. Uh, Never you mind. Uh, hey, what's that? It's running on water. <laughs> I'm a vampire. Totally normal vampire stuff right here. Mm -hmm. And then he, and then he drowned. He died because of sudden pressurization. <laughs> <laughs> right. Was Jesus a vampire? Right. Yeah. Hmm. How about you guys? Barely managed, but we're all right. <clears throat> the chopper? We need some time for repairs. Oh. The president's all yours. Okay. Can I ask you something? What? Are you the snake? <sighs> they said you were dead. No, not me. There are still too many things I need to do. Snake? You're a legend, and that's why I need to ask you this. Legend? A legend is nothing but fiction. Someone tells it, someone else remembers. Everybody passes it on. I'm here because I was assigned to this mission, not because I want to. If I could, I'd be out of here in a second. How could you come back to all this? Why keep fighting? There's something my best friend said to me once. What? We're not tools of the government, or anyone else. Fighting was the only thing I was good at, but at least I always fought for what I believed in. Hey. What about what about the DNA that results line. from that body? That's a good line. That was Liquid's body. He and Snake are identical on the genetic level. Liquid? A deception for our own protection. We stole his frozen body from some organization. Kind of a hassle. Dang. 
That's all there is to it. Are you two really an NGO? Insofar as we're a non-profit organization of civilians advocating a cause, yes. The cause happens to be the eradication of Metal Gear. We work on our own, but it's a cause worth fighting for. Why would you stick your neck out for something this risky? That's the way I used to look at it, four years ago. I was holed up in the middle of nowhere in Alaska, drinking too much. We have a responsibility to the coming generations, to the world. What responsibility? To keep track of the mistakes we've made as a species. We need to remember, to spread the word, to fight for change. And that's what keeps me alive. You think you can change the future? Nah, I'm not as arrogant as that. What you do isn't grassroots activism. It's more like terrorism. I admit that. Sure. But our group, Philanthropy, received some information. A new Metal Gear prototype was being developed here, and terrorists were planning to raid the facility. The information came from a very reliable source. So you're here to... We're here to stop all that. But I also have a personal motive. Looks like the terrorists have his sister in the big shell. We're here on our own, not under anyone's orders. We have our own battles. Otacon's here for someone. I'm not. This is a military mission. <laughs> You're the ninja. Jack, are you all right? Just barely. You almost gave me a heart attack. Sorry, it wasn't intentional. I know that, and I know I need to stay stronger. Say a prayer for me, Rose, so I can come back. You will make it back. I'm with you all the way, remember? That means a lot to me, you know. I'm going to save the data, okay, Jack? Okay. Uh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Big shocker to no one. It was Snake the whole time. What? I saw a video of those top ten uh, worst disguises in video games. Yeah. Snake, Pil er, uh, Iroquois Pliskin was like pretty high up on that. <laughs> it was like, oh, it was disguises that fooled no one. <laughs> Ooh, I got a bleep bloop. You got a bleep bloop? Metal Gear Who is it? Who's active? what? It's Who's doing it? Heinz, ketchup is now following. Thank you for the follow, Heinz. Thank you, Heinz. Follow closely, please. Don't get lost. From taking place. Get to the president. He's in the core section of Shell 2. I'm checking the satellite images. Snake. Looks like you can get to the core <laughs> from the other side of Strut L. The core hasn't gone under yet from what we can tell. Follow the railings oh, down. Then you, jump Heinz. onto the pipes. The only viable strut yes, in the outer you. perimeter Appreciate is the L. It. That attack just now doesn't make um, any can sense. We call you, can we call you Heinz no or, or just uh, Ketchup? Colonel, <laughs> you were monitoring the codec calls. Um, that man uh, I just became affiliate today, so I don't have any rewards Maybe. yet. Maybe. Uh, but we're going to work on them after the stream today. I think that sounds kind of adorable. It's because they like, were never uh, a part oh, of the well, we just started today, so we, we can't give you factor. any you rewards, but pat on the back. Yes. We're out here. Hey, yo, where Tina at? Did she say she was leaving? Calm down. I suggest that you do write him. You're missing out. That has no bearing on your mission. You and Snake used to be on the same side. I don't understand. I read about you and Snake in In the Darkness of Shadow Moses. Who wrote that? I don't give a damn what that piece Nastasha. of trash said. Do you get me? Oh, 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 wow. Wow, that was really aggressive, Colonel. That's really aggressive, Colonel. Tell me whatever you enjoy. Ketchup, Heinz, butthole, the world is yours. <laughs> Congrats on the affiliate. Yes, thank you. We will have reward for you soon. Man, I'm happy this thing never runs out. Watch, this thing's gonna catch fire again. Okay, good. I mean, we can't go that way anyway. We can go this way. Whoa! Phone call uh, I guess the phone call is actually coming in handy now. Cell phone, neat. Use the coolant spray to put up. Fire. Okay, thank you. Oh wow, thanks. That was one time, one time ever. Hey, look, man, I like this game. It's not batting it. I mean, it's not a perfect game. No. That comes later. Yes. This one's perfect, and the other's the best. Oh no! I thought I had it! Wasn't fast enough. You gotta book it you and then right? go back up. I think you're expected right. to drop from the top and then run up the stairs. 
You think so? Because if you go down and then go up, it takes too much time. Okay. No, there's no place to drop. You can't hang over that? No. Hmm. Oh, God. Yeah. I'll just go. <laughs> <laughs> it's fine. We're good, man. Don't scare We're me. We're not like that. dead. <laughs> <laughs> Man, but Give I was me going. a freaking heart attack over here. <laughs> Run. Run up and back. Woohoo! Made it. So this is safe way. This is good way. But that's PSG one ammo. And so is that over there. Right in! Right in! I don't think we've ever I, I think you skipped no, that's past the, first the, one. the game over screen. I don't think they've ever seen it. No? no. Oh, dang. I'm sorry, guys. Uh, what other games do you stream? You can check out on our main page. We stream We stream any game we feel like doing, but we're currently in a uh, Metal Gear... Uh, we're trying to go through all the Metal Gear games for our fans uh, because we love it. It's one of our favorite series of all time, and so yeah. we want to show our fans how much we love them. Not everybody that checks us out knows about it, so we're just sort of showing it off. Careful of the bird poop. Careful of the bird poop. Oh, right. Ah, oh, there's a neat thing over there. Mm. There's a way to get back over there anyway. No, there isn't. There isn't? No, you have to go in from over there. Yeah. I might as well drown myself. I mean, go ahead and show off the, the game over screen. Yeah. Here we go. <laughs> For the people! Jack, what's going on? Answer yep. me! Mission failed. Jack! Jack. Do, 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 do. Do, do, do. Do, do, do. Okay. Okay. Here we go. I try again. I'm gonna pick up the rations. Down. All the buttons are pressure sensitive in this one. Mm -hmm. Then again, they were kind of like that in the other entries as well. Now this one is tricky. Yep. Let's see how many times it takes him. How many times? Here comes attempt number one. Boy, I do not like this camera. Here we go. Here we here. Ah! Oh. <laughs> right. What's wrong? Blub, blub. Right. There right. goes another one. Can you believe that I've played this game before? Yeah. <laughs> Chips says, stop dying. <laughs> I'm sorry, I need the thing. Got the thing. Now I need the other thing. Not gonna think about it, just gonna go for it. <laughs> ah, I was too far off on my angle. Yeah, that was a little weird there. Right, what's going on? Alright, right. last time. Last right. time I'm gonna attempt this. Yeah. It's probably not even that important. It's a cool thing. I just You're don't cool thing. I just don't remember what it is. Fortunately, Wait, I not, she said, "I will personally murder you." Sorry, I'm trying. Here. Uh, Raiden can swim just fine, but falling from that height into water will kill you. It's like hitting concrete. Yeah. Water tension is so strong at that at yeah. that point, it's like hitting concrete. Right. Oh, baby! Did it. Ooh, just gotta make sure not to mess up now. You should be good. Man, it's always on the last attempt. Can I get some applause on that? Yeah, everybody. That's tricky. That's a that's a hard jump. Can I just get a little pat on my back for that? By the way, it's an AK suppressor. Thank you. Nice. Thank you, brother. Thank you. I wonder if I should even bother going for that other ration right now. I mean, it's just over there. Probably do it. Watch me fail at it. You won't. Here we go. Okay. 
we should be good. I'm just still gonna go carefully though. Tim says, "No, you dead. You did. You no. You died. You dead now. You dead now." <laughs> she didn't like you repeatedly killing Raiden like that. I know. She likes her pretty boy. She she wants she wants Raiden to get back to Rose. Right on. All right. Speaking of which, I'm gonna call. Yeah, I'm gonna use save my progress. Point. Yeah. <laughs> Holy cow. Oops, makes another sharp right. Jack, do you need to save? <laughs> right into the bird poop. Why is that? Why is there so much bird poop? Why? Kim, are you telling me you like Raiden over Snake? Jack, how's the mission going? Fine. Fine? Is that it? Look, I really don't feel like talking about the mission. At least with you. I want to talk about something else. Okay, then. Let's talk about you. Me? Yeah, your least favorite subject. That's not... Oh, yeah? Then go ahead and say something. Like what? Anything. Tell me something about yourself. I can't think of anything interesting to say. Why do you want to talk about me so badly? Because I'm curious. But why? Is it really that strange to want to know more about someone you love? No, it's not strange, but... You know, sometimes I... Oh, look, now we're talking about me, not you. Why won't you tell me anything about what you were like as a child? What kind of things you liked to do? What kind of people your parents were? I've never heard you talk about any of that. Why? I... Don't you think it's just a little bit unusual that I don't know anything about my own boyfriend's past? Rose, when I get back, I'll tell you everything. Is that... A promise? Yes, it's a promise. I love you. I love you too, baby. I love you so much, Jack. I love you too, Rose. And then they go, mwah, mwah, mwah. You gotta promise me you gotta run home, Jack. Run home, oh, Jack. Run home. Run home, Jack. No, why would Ryden talk about his feelings? Their feelings are scary. Let's talk about our feelings. I'll go first. I, I hate you. <laughs> Louis says, don't keep promises you can't keep, bro. <laughs> yeah, Louis goes, ew, love. <laughs> Heinz says, I know nothing about your history. Let's date. <laughs> Let's date. That's me. Mwah, 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 um, he <laughs> says, hi, I appreciate that vine. We all do. I figure I can take them both out. Free myself up a little bit. Just gotta be quick, you know? Be. He'll see his friend soon and be like, hey, wake up. Yeah. Nothing to report. There he is. What's wrong? Oh, oh no, come bird. on. It's okay, the bird's asleep. Dang it, bird. I thought I got him. You, you gotta, you gotta lead him a little bit. There we go. There we go. <laughs> Flipping finally. Don't hurt the birds. Kim says, "I hate you too." J.K. Lol. <laughs> Kim goes, "Yes." Oh, he says, oh, "Oh yeah, I appreciate that one." Yes. The birds won't rat you out. Whoop. Oh, is this the spot? It is an icky spot, yes. Is this the icky spot? Why is it Tina here? She needs to see this. I know, she's always leaving. Actually, I, I feel like... Um, hmm. Trying to decide if I should go for a quick break. Or you want to take a break? Well, for myself. Hmm. Trying to decide if I need to do that now or later. Hmm. 
Because, yeah, more stuff's going to be happening in the story. Yeah. Ken says, yes, hello, PETA. Someone here is shooting birds. Stop trying to cancel Pokemon and stop that guy. <laughs> ah, deck damn it. I just don't let go. I'm sorry? Come on, bring him on. Okay. Just gotta be careful. They're still after Pokemon? They'll always be after Pokemon. Oh, yeah. They'll never stop. Always. Can't stop, won't stop. <laughs> What's that? I'm just reloading the chat. Oh. Is this the strut where they fought Fortune? Nah. I have infinite channel points. You shoot? <laughs> yeah. Nice. Oh my own What's man. it like having all the power? It's weird. I know. Throw out a chat. You want to try uh, running a 60 second ad? We can decide when that happens? Yes. Wow. When we need to go use the restroom or something, we just hit the ad button and then we get revenue for the ad. Interesting. Schnifty, right? Very schnifty. <laughs> did you give those to me? Jiggles, I will murder you. <laughs> Why? What did I do? Shell 2, right? Or yeah, shell 2 core? I think so. Yeah, it's not Pliskin anymore. No, it's Snake. Oh, no, ads are evil. Bad enough. Doritos are so addicting. <laughs> Raiden, you cover the president. Make contact with him before the confirmation of the nuclear launch code. We are going to start repairs on the cam off. That should keep our hands full for a while. Mm. I did a round of Shell 2 during bomb dispersal. Let me know if you have any questions. But you want to support the bros, don't you? Yeah, all you gotta do is just sit and, and, and enjoy the, the show. It's it's literally a minute. <laughs> What's that? Not that play, cowboy. What? That play, cowboy. Yeah, we really gotta go down this way. Yep. Here we go! Here we Just showing off those sweet gains. <laughs> Chrissy says, Pliskin? We don't know him. Only Snake. <laughs> Ken says, I do, but ads are evil. One minute ads are the worst. I will murder if I have to go through that. Hold on. Uh, I'm going to type something in the chat. Okay. Well, Louis, I will let you know. See... We're playing as Raiden now. Um, we're, we're following the Colonel Campbell from the first game. He's telling us uh, to get in here and save the president. Um, and But we've also learned that this whole thing is being used to make another Metal Gear. So that's kind of what's going on right now. It's kind of weird. It's kind of scary. friendship with Pliskin over. Now Snake is my best friend. Yes, yeah, so and we've been being helped by a guy calling himself 
Iroquois Pliskin, but it's 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 just Solid Snake. It's a, a terrible disguise. It's obviously oh, Snake. Oh, snake. here we go. My father had some unfinished business with him. Olga, calm yourself. Then screw your plan. I've been waiting for this day for two years, and I will send him to the bottom of the ocean, right next to my old man. The launch comes first. Damn it. Where is Ocelot? He's not one of my own. He left my father to die, remember? Olga, we'll talk later. We need to get started on the final checks for the unit. All right. I'm headed back there. The upper connecting bridge to Shell 1 is down. What about the chopper? The cab off is out of action. We'll take the oil fence from Strut L. I'll tell my men to start pulling out. Not yet. Snake. Snake. What about the other man? Has luck on his side, certainly. He survived that explosion. Listen, Olga, the code confirmation is in one hour. Keep the president alive until then. I know. No one gets in here. Turn the currents on. Of course. <laughs> I thought that was a double of riding. High voltage currents on. The door stays shut unless the president manages to take out that circuit panel from inside the room. And it's no job for bare hands. All right. Come back immediately. One more thing. What? We leave for Russia when this business is done. I want half the money for that. Of course. That was part of the agreement. We start living for ourselves after oh, this. Oh, Heinz, it's time to if head out. It's been a pleasure. I'll catch here. you guys I next time. Thank you, Heinz. Thank you, Heinz. Thank you, Heinz. Everybody say goodbye to Heinz. It's time they went free. What happened to rebuilding Mother Russia? The old man is dead. The world is a different place now. It's your life. Just as it reminds me, I'm going to say this again one last time. Don't try anything on us. The feeling is mutual. Oh, you're killing COV? That's fun. I'm in front of the room where they're keeping the president. Everything all right? No sign of flooding, but I can't get close to the door. The floor is electrified. Don't test You'll it. Be bacon. You'll be baking. <laughs> Any suggestions? Remember the Shadow Moses oh, VR that's such a good line. Take out the circuit panel? Oh, right. you found somebody but else to no kill, into the room. Try ventilation ducts. Yeah, I think I see one. Look for a remote control missile launcher. You can guide it through the duct into the room. Then target the circuit panel. Got it. Right, but make sure you don't hit the president. The president is wired with nano machines. If we know the frequency, I can raise him. We've tried that repeatedly, but there's no response. It looks like the walls have a built-in radio shield. So that's why Ames lost contact with him. If you need to confirm his position, you can log into the node. Understood. You log into the node Locate anyway. a remote control <laughs> missile launcher first. Yes, COV is very nice. We all appreciate him. Don't test it. <laughs> I'm gonna test it. Yep. Yeah. And I'm certainly not baking yet. It may wind up being more than a minute, bro, but I think it'd be a good time for uh, ad break, I suppose. Okay. Go ahead and uh, go do what you need to do. Mm -hmm. I'll just let. We're gonna test it for once. Here we go.
Okay. How was that? Hope it was interesting. The spider is still in the restroom, though. I'm going to have a look around. break work I got an ad for the boys nice do a spin okay I'll do a spin let me find a more light lit up place I'll do it like last time there we go yay you spin me right round baby right round like a record baby right round 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 it doesn't do it quite as, as smoothly as uh mgs1 no see he, he won't he won't spin that's disappointing I have ad block. <laughs> no ads for me. Okay. I keep getting the boys ad. Nice. See, Kim, you don't even have to worry. You, you, there, you, you don't even get ads. So it's like, whatever. That's good enough for me right there. Japanese. I don't want ads in a stream. Well, Kim, that just means you don't want to support us as much as we thought you did. That's okay. Yeah. Yep, the filter is blocked out F word. <laughs> so I think it's kind of funny. Go to basement one. Is the press bad? <gasps> I don't know. Oh, 
this thing's flooded. one is completely flooded from what I can see. You'll have to swim through. I'm fine with swimming. Stroke the water and move forward by pushing the punch button. Push it in rapid succession to swim faster. Change your heading with the left stick. Up will take you up, down takes you lower. Left and right to face those directions. Yeah, it's pretty wet. The O2 gauge will appear under your life gauge while you're underwater. The gauge corresponds to the amount of air you can hold from a single deep breath. Once the O2 gauge falls to zero, the life gauge will start to drop. You need to be aware of that. Yes, swimmy swim. Got it. You have the remote controlled missile. Good job. Now head for the first floor of the Shell 2 core. Take out the power source and make contact with the president before the launch code can be reconfirmed. Hurry. This is all closed off.
gotten yourself a remote controlled missile referred to as Nikita. It's a wireless guided projectile. It's a surveillance missile based on micro air vehicle technology. You control it by watching the image transmitted from the CCD camera mounted on the missile. Although it's primarily designed for scouting missions, it carries a small explosive charge that allows a long distance attack. You can also trigger the charge by removing it from equip status following the missile's launch. You won't be able to move while controlling the missile. Also, you'll have to be careful that you don't run out of fuel while it's in flight. Unlike VR training, you won't have a bird's eye view to help you control the missile. Mm-hmm. I guess we should wait for Smiter, though. I don't want to use that yet. Take his time though. Oh, I was about to walk on that. Like a big idiot. Then I would have died. Let's talk to Rose. And that can fill in some dialogue. Is that you? Who else could it be, Rose? Rose. So, have you decided to talk yet? No. Nope. That's too bad. Why are you so interested in me all of a nope. sudden? Because I'm curious. More so than before. Does it really bother you that much? There must be some things you don't want to say. Like what? You know, those things you don't want to say. Let's see. Things you don't want to say. Like that you've been married before, that you're 80 years old, that you used to be a woman. Rose. What exactly is it you won't tell me? Do you think I'd hate you if I knew? Do you really have that little faith in me? No, it's nothing like that. Then what is it? It... It really bothers me. The fact that there's a side of you I don't know. Sometimes, I just can't help myself. You've got me right now. Isn't that enough? No, it's not. I'm sorry. I know I'm being greedy, but it's just not enough. Wow. Is this is the secret channel. Who do you think it is? Mm. Is there a there's no frequency that matches Merrill's. For funsies, let's just try it out, shall we? No response. She must not be available. Well, I can assign VIPs now. I should see about trying to do that. Access my followers list. Wow. Crazy. Spin. Shoot the way, Hattie. Sorry about the wait. That was terribly unproductive. We will reconvene at a later time for that. Now, 
What a mess. I got the Nikita. You did? Yep. It's waiting for you. I'm looking at the chat. Yep. I don't see anything. It's because nobody's saying anything right now. Fail claim. Claim failed. Okay. Let's see what else we can do. Let's see. So did you already So you already tried uh, shooting in? Nope. Alright, let's do it. Cross my fingers. Hope I don't kill him. Yep. Hope we don't kill him. There we go. Oh boy, here I go. Oh. Nope. Nope. Nothing. What was that just now? Doink, 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 did you check out the Sonic episode of the of the Mythos podcast where we talked to Mini Man about it? Hmm. We said yeah, as in yeah, uh, wanting to watch us play Sonic. Yeah. Because you know, you could pick his brain about it. President Johnson. Mm -hmm. huh? So you're finally here. You've been expecting me. Your equipment, that skull suit, isn't exactly standard military issue. Are you all right, sir? Is this some kind of sick joke? I thought you came to kill me. What? I'm prepared to face the consequences of my betrayal. What are you... Oh, you hmm. touched him. What? What? You're a man? Hmm. Well, who are you? That's how he wanted to know. Fox yep. out, sir. He touched him. Fox out? He just got in there. I see. Now things are starting to make a little sense. <laughs> Give him a little tap in his no-no zone. Switch over to nano communication so nobody can listen in. Yes, sir. Do you read me, sir? Uh, yes. Mr. President, it's my understanding that the terrorists have managed to input the code sequence necessary for launching a nuclear strike. Yes, we strike. did say Santa. That's correct. I punched the sequence in myself. You're working for them? If you asked me two hours ago, my answer would have been yes. Right now, they're keeping me alive until my vital signs are reconfirmed. They betrayed you? I wouldn't quite put it that way. I wanted power. They sought destruction. But why stoop to terrorism? I wanted absolute power. But you're the president. You have power. No, I'm just a figurehead. Huh? I don't have any control. The real power is in the Patriots' hands. The Patriots? Patriots. The truth behind this country. I'm not surprised you've never heard of them. Very few are aware of their existence, even among those with code word clearance. Huh? Politics, the military, the economy. They control it all. They even choose who becomes president. Putting it simply, the Patriots rule this country. No. <laughs> Hard to believe, isn't it? But it's the Mad truth. truth bombs. The space defense. Buckle up, kids. It's time production. for conspiracy and theories. National missile defense programs. Every policy that's been credited to me was actually done according to their instructions. Space defense was initiated by Congress. That's what the Patriots want the country to believe. It's all a show. Democracy is just a filler for textbooks. Think about it. Do you actually believe that public opinion influences the government? No. This country is shaped and controlled as the Patriots see fit. The people are shown what they want to believe. What you call government is actually a well-staged production aimed at satisfying the public. Huh? Don't look at me like that. I'm legally sane, you know. It's not your sanity that worries me. The Patriots. Even I don't know who the actual members are. Ooh. Are they financial, political, or military? Here we go. No one knows who the Patriots really are. 
Even my instructions come from a cutout. All I've been told is that every key decision is made by a group of 12 men, known as the Wise Men's Committee. Your office? The White House? Merely puppets. Pawns in a game. By pledging my loyalty, an insignificant son of a senator was right awarded now. the presidency. Hmm. Of course, that wasn't the only price I had to pay. What do you mean? Even if a pawn becomes a queen, it is still just a playing piece. I wanted to leave my own mark in history, but my ambitions were... You'll understand something. I wished to be a member of the Patriots. I wanted to wield the power of a king instead of being an expendable pawn. And that justifies acts of terrorism? Yes. Yes. I'd intended oh. to use the new Metal Gear as a bargaining chip. <laughs> bargaining chip? But I underestimated Solidus. He actually wants to challenge the Patriots, even if it means the destruction of the world. What are you saying? Whether you believe it or not, the balance of power rests in the hands of the Patriots. They regulate the country's various interests through controlled presentation, staging a drama that is palatable to the general masses. Can you imagine what would happen if they ceased to function? Picture a massive political vacuum, a space that every power monger will try to fill for their own greedy ends. I'm talking about an unregulated power struggle, panic, civil war, chaos. Like it or not, the Patriots is an organization that must continue to exist. So you changed your mind because you wanted to avoid global chaos. Exactly. When I told Solidus that I wished to prevent disaster, he replied that pawns can never become players. And who is this Solidus? Solidus. My predecessor, George Sears. President George Sears? That was the name the public came to know him by. I knew him by his code name, Solidus Snake. He was the third snake, preceded by Solid and Liquid, a survivor of the Les Enfants Terribles project. Neither Solid nor Liquid. He was a well-balanced masterpiece that the Patriots saw fit to entrust with the presidency. However, he fell out of grace with the organization four years ago. When acting on his own, he started an incident. Four years ago? Shadow Moses? That's right. At the time, the DARPA chief, Donald Anderson, together with certain influential parties, initiated the development of Metal Gear Rex and an advanced nuclear warhead. However, this did not fall in line with the Patriots' plans. What's more, Solidus decided on his own to send his most trusted man, Ocelot, to provoke Liquid Snake, bringing about the said incident. As a result, he succeeded in obtaining Rex and the data on the warhead. But in doing so, he ended up revealing the existence of both Rex and the Genome Army, a blunder that earned him the wrath of the Patriots. Yep. Shortly thereafter, Solidus was removed from the presidential office. I thought he resigned. That's the story given to the general public. Following his resignation, the Patriots selected me, their new pawn, for the presidency. But that would mean that the presidential race was... That was quite a show, wasn't it? It was a well-scripted drama staged by the Patriots for the benefit of the public. Even the Democrats and Republicans were dancing to the Patriots' tune. Everything went according to plan, but for one exception. Huh. Following his resignation, Solidus' health was scheduled to fail him bringing about his untimely death. Capped? Correct. But before the Patriots could execute their plot, Solidus went underground with the help of Ocelot. As he avoided pursuit, Solidus gained control of Dead Cell, winning over Colonel Golukovic's outfit. From there, he bided his time, knowing that his opportunity would soon arrive. What opportunity? The completion of the new Metal Gear project. An opportunity that would even his odds against the Patriots. By stealing the Patriots' most valued project, he would be able to place them in a very uncomfortable position. It's the only chance he has for survival. Once he has the new Metal Gear, he'll declare war against the Patriots. Needless to say, he must be stopped. 
Metal Gear is already operational. No, not yet. Hmm? What you saw was Metal Gear Ray, hijacked two years ago from the Marines by Ocelot. That was not the new Metal oh. Gear. Then where's the new Metal Gear? Right here. What? You're standing in it. To be more precise, this entire Big Shell facility is the new Metal Gear. Would you say? No, I'm quite serious. The upper structure that you've seen is camouflage, designed to represent an offshore cleanup facility. The main structure extends from the foundation all the way down to the ocean floor. The connecting elevator is located on the B2 floor of the Shell 1 core. Oh. Arsenal Gear. That's the code name for the new Metal Gear. Arsenal Gear. gear. Arsenal? What? That's right. Arsenal. We're talking about an impregnable fortress carrying a load of over a couple of thousand missiles, including nuclear warheads, all protected by a horde of mass-produced Metal Gear Ray units. Mass-produced? The Ray unit was originally designed for the Marines to be used as a countermeasure against the Metal Gear variations throughout the world. The Patriots had Ray redesigned to protect the new Arsenal Gear. So now anti-Metal Gears are guarding a Metal Gear. Hmm. Ironic, isn't it? That's not all. Arsenal Gear has full access to the military's tactical network, giving it the ability to exercise absolute control over our nation's armed forces, not to mention our nuclear armament. In short, Arsenal was created to be the core of our country. What kind of idiotic weapon? Weapon? No. You're not seeing the full picture. Huh? Arsenal Gear is more than just a military tool. It is a means to preserve the world as it is. It will establish a new form of control. The Patriots will use Absolute it to keep their control. place as the country's true rulers. Right now, they feel pressure. Complete threat. global what? saturation. They fear an overabundance of digital information. The world will drown in the coming flood of information, and they along with it. Hmm. The Arsenal plans include a system to digitally manage the flow of information, making it possible to shape the truth for their own purposes. In short, the Arsenal system is the key to their supremacy. The key? Yes. The GW system is the Patriots' trump card. Arsenal gear will be fully operational when GW is successfully integrated. Once operational, it will be a completely new form of power for the Patriots to wield. I had hoped to seize the project from them so that I would be in a strong bargaining position. Bargain for what? I'd hoped to trade my way into their ranks. The Solidus preferred rebellion. Outer Heaven, his plan to unleash a nuclear blast over the skies of Wall Street to break the Patriots' control over the business community, is also a key factor in his offensive effort. Outer Heaven? Listen, there isn't much time. The football served as the key for activating Arsenal gear. I've already input the necessary code sequence. It won't be long before GW begins to establish connections with other external systems and Arsenal gear becomes fully operational. Stop them before that happens. That is your role. Role? You've got to find Emma <laughs> Emmerich. She's the only one who can stop that thing once it's been Emma activated. Emma Emmerich? Emma Emmerich? She's the system programmer for Arsenal gear. <laughs> yeah, exactly, she's somewhere Chrissy. somewhere on level B1 in the core of this building. I thought the levels below us were flooded. I'm sure they won't let her die just yet, as she's the only remaining programmer for this project. According to Ocelot, she was being held in a locker room located in the northwest part of level B1. Cut transmission and get moving. This is card four. It'll give you access all the way to Emma's location. Give this to her when you find her. What is it? A program for disrupting the control functions between GW and Arsenal Gear. Take Emma to the computer room on level B2, Shell 1 core. She'll know how to load the program into the main system. A virus? That's right, modeled after Foxdie. A biological weapon designed to selectively eliminate personnel with a specific genetic code. But why do you have it? The Patriots had it engineered as a failsafe. And Ocelot forgot to search me. You've got to hurry. That disc is the only way you're going to stop Arsenal. Well, I've told you everything you need to know. 
There's only one thing that remains to be done. Time to argue. The final check for my vital ID will start any second. If you kill me now, you'll at least prevent the nuclear strike. Cut it out! Uh, do it! That's your role! That's your role! No! Oh! That's abusing your right to free speech, Mr. President. Or is it? Ex-president. The president! Why did you... Alas, my finger must have slipped. Oops. Oh my. I'll see you around, Oops. carrier boy. Okay, bye. Forget him. He did us a favor. Without free will, there is no difference between submission and rebellion. My only real choice is to put an end to this charade. Let me at least have the freedom to end it myself. What are you? Find Emma. Stop Arsenal. This is my last order. As your commander in chief, I'm counting on you. <sighs> Done. And that was the president. The president. He's dead. He looks like some sort of heart attack. I mean, like somebody physically attacked his heart. Yeah. This uh, Somebody actually just attacked his heart. Oh, goodness. How will we remember this man? Oh, Mr. President. Let's check his pockets. Dang. Nothing. Maybe one Shake more time. Shake his legs. Maybe one more time. Okay. No. No, it's okay. We'll take him with us. We, we must honor his memory. <laughs> we could still save him. Oh, okay. Okay, the game doesn't want me to take him with us. Colonel, the president is dead. I see. I'm sorry to hear that. Where do we go from here? Your mission was to rescue the president and eliminate the terrorist threat. However, given the recent turn of events, we will honor the president's last directive. You must put a stop to Arsenal gear once and for all. Do you actually think there's any truth to his story about this big shell facility being a front for Arsenal gear? I don't have the security clearance necessary to verify the facts. However, he was the president. I'm sure he knew what he was talking about. Aren't you forgetting that he was part of the terrorist plot? All the more reason why I believe his information is reliable. Huh? We're talking about a man who chose to die rather than risk a nuclear holocaust. Thanks to his sacrifice, the Nuclear Launch Authority has shifted to the Vice President, effectively eliminating the terrorist threat. Colonel, when you put it like that, it almost sounds like I should have assassinated the President to eliminate the threat. That was not my intention. I was trying to point out that there is certainly some credibility to the words of a man who chose death to protect the innocent. The Colonel has a point, Jack. What about the information he gave me on the Patriots? <laughs> That's was it because of me. the grab? I'll see no, what I can so find out. Right. Oh, you're a man? Running out of time. Probably because of the winky Emma. pinch. She's supposed to be located wait, wait. on level B1 <laughs> in the core of that building you're in. Whoa! Right? Hey, Mr. President, let's, that's, that's, uh, that's, that's good, that's good. I think we're all right. None Hurry, of that. Jack. Oh. Whoa, it's up whoa, to you whoa, to whoa, make whoa. sure that the President didn't sacrifice his life in vain. Understood. Riding out. What's your status? Uh, Snake, everything's gone the wrong. He's been assassinated. <laughs> what? There's nothing I could do. What about the nuclear strike code sequence? He died before his vital ID could be reconfirmed. Then the enemies lost their nuclear strike capability. But that ocelot guy obviously killed the president on purpose. No, Why? he said oops. It doesn't make any sense. Yeah, he was like, they oh, had to know that they couldn't oops. launch the new life. They killed the president. Slipped. Maybe there's a way. Why to would he lie to us? Reconfirming the vital ID. Or maybe they found a more effective weapon within Arsenal gear. You knew about Arsenal gear? Yeah. Yeah. Dude. Why you tell me about it? You never you, asked. You didn't ask. Am I correct in assuming you also know that the Big Shell's a front for the project? Yeah. You mean, did I know that the Big Shell 
A fully functional environmental cleanup facility was designed to camouflage Arsenal gear? Yeah. I did. I did. <laughs> it's exactly what the president and Ames described. A massive cover story. The good news is that it hasn't really done much yeah. in terms of cleaning we, uh, up the environment. Everybody so knew. Every, every, everybody knew. Everybody, knew. everybody to except you, town. Raiden. Right. And when did you find out about all of this? It took a while, but we uncovered the info around the time you took out that mad bomber. There's no doubt that Arsenal gear is being built here. And it was all set up two years ago. On that day. All of it. Two years ago? What really happened here? Because he said, I mean, everyone knows about Arsenal, you don't? <laughs> I know these pictures. They were on the news on several websites. If I remember right, the reporters blamed you for sinking the tanker. That's right. Otacon, me, we were used. We'd hoped that by going public with photos of the new Metal Gear, we could persuade the government. At least that was the plan at the time. I've gone through VR training of the tanker mission before. Yeah? Well, I doubt it accurately simulates the events of that mission. I'd infiltrated the dummy tanker to obtain proof that a Metal Gear was under development. Shortly after I made it aboard, an armed group led by Colonel Gerlukovich raided the ship and gained control. Olga and Ocelot were among the raiding party. Yeah, and him. Who are you talking about? A man that was supposed to be dead. Their target was also Metal Gear Ray. But Ocelot eliminated Colonel Gerlukovich and Marine Commander Scott Dolph, and he hijacked Ray. Bye, Scott. Bye, so Scott. Bye, Gerlukovich. I don't know what Bye, Sergei. Going down. He killed All two daddies in a couple of bullets. Time. Something like, I'm taking it back. To the Patriots. Ocelot then sank the tanker, along with the soldiers of the Marine Corps. Hey, remember? Yeah, I remember. It's fantastic. How did you manage to get out? Otacon managed to have a small boat ready for me. That was the easy part. The tough part was not getting dragged down with a sinking tanker. A small miracle when you think about it. It turned out that the whole thing was a setup to lure us. Let's flash back again. Hey. Photos of Snake, taken by the Cypher, were released to the public. In turn, we became the world's most wanted environmental terrorists. It was definitely a move aimed at putting a stop to our anti-Metal Gear activities. But why did they choose Snake? Since the Shadow Moses incident, Snake became sort of a hero. I think the Patriots weren't too happy about that. You knew about the Patriots? Well, yes, to a certain degree. It seems like everyone knows about them except me. They didn't choose Snake to be a hero. So they decided to do a smear campaign. I think the Patriots wanted to make an example of him, so everybody would think twice before opposing them. That's it! They set all this up just to nail you guys! No, there's more to it than that. The Marines Metal Gear Ray project, headed by Commander Dolph, was carried out in opposition to the Navy's Arsenal Gear project. Hmm. Mm. To be more precise, the Patriots considered Metal Gear Ray to be a thorn in their side. Hence, they attacked the dummy tanker and stole Ray. They followed this up with a perfect plan. They immediately sent a fully loaded tanker to the same location and sank it. Then set up the facility to camouflage the development of Arsenal gear. And we fell for it. Two more puppets in their show. Colonel Gerlukovich? And his daughter, Olga? Both fell victim to Ocelot's plot. Was Solidus behind all this? He used Ocelot to get hold of Ray, huh? No, he was underground, keeping a low profile at the time. Then it must be the Patriots. If that's the case, what's Ocelot doing alongside Solidus? Hmm. You know, the Patriots. Everybody knows about Everybody the Patriots. Everybody knows about the Patriots. You trying to tell me you don't? Forget it. We're wasting time. We can he's... figure this out oh, later. He's... The nuclear strike's been <laughs> well, prevented, he's... but Arsenal still has a massive payload of missiles to deal with. Right. If the opposition gets control of those missiles... Right. You've got to find Emma. Wait a second. Isn't Emma Emrick My sister. What's she doing here? You got me. She's a computer whiz who specializes in neural AI and ultra-variable volume data analysis using complex logic. How she got involved in weapons I don't development know. is Maybe uh, after we 
get an Whatever her call reasons, it. we okay. need her in order to stop Arsenal. Raiden, find her. Yeah, I I'm think that's good. Way. It's been almost five and a half hours. Alrighty. What do you guys think? Just a little bit longer and we'll call it for, for this week? Maybe pick it up again next week? We'll see. We're not we sure yet. We'll see. At the very least, since uh, my uh, vacation has been extended, I will be probably streaming uh, here and there uh, over the week. Would be nice. Yes. Uh, I think that's ammo. Nikita around. Yeah, Louis says stream is fun. Thank you, Louis. Thank you, Louis. I'm glad uh, everybody seems to be enjoying this bonkers as heck game. Yup. It hasn't even gotten to the craziest parts yet. It's true. This party hasn't even gotten crazy yet. <laughs> That's true. This party is merely getting crazy. Fair enough. <laughs> I just need to know. Yeah, we're just looking around now. I just need to know. Where does it go? Where does it go? Dang it. One more time. Sometimes you just gotta tap a little bit and just to keep it going. It's good. From, from, from boosting. Yep. Just Stinger. wiggle, wiggle. Alright, and then it leads back to the other room. Yep. Alright. Let's continue. Let's. I think I'll work on uh, emotes and stuff over stream this week. That'd be rad. Do we go? Where are we going? I'm thinking about like uh, tier one uh, emote. Yeah. Nuggy. Oh. And people will be able to unlock that one by using channel points. Yeah. So it, they don't have to Easy. subscribe to get that. Right. Uh, to get Nuggy, and then that way, when we say Nuggies in the chat, it's yeah. Like, People, everybody should be able to get nuggies pretty easily. Yeah. Um, and then for the highest tier, I wanted to to give golden nuggies. Yeah. For for the people that are really like yeah. supportive. Time to swim. I would have to ask uh, our very special mutual friend if she would help me color them. I imagine would be she'll nice. Be to. Yeah. It might be nice. nice. It might, might be, be nice. Raiden, are you reading? Mm -hmm. This is Arcon. 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 What's your situation? Wet and miserable. I'm just painting. This you place guys is play flooded. However long you the seawater that's been okay, pumped Chrissy, up is pouring sure into the building. I see. Should we Listen, extend an invite to Chrissy to the server? To is Chrissy already there? Don't worry about it. I don't her. think Chrissy's I'll in our server. Would you like an invite to our server, Chrissy? Yeah. When she was six years old, it's she not almost just drowned video games. my father in our yeah. swimming pool. She can't swim? Well, yes and no. We used to swim a lot together when we were kids. In fact, she swam like a fish until that day when she almost drowned. When the accident happened, I was in my room. I learned later that E.E. E. was calling me for help. She didn't doubt for a minute that I'd be there. You could see the pool from my room, but I didn't realize at the time that she needed my help. What were you doing? I, I was. I will get you a, uh, so Emma an invite. The ordeal. Yeah, but my father didn't. So you blamed yourself and left your family. No, E.E. E. seems to believe that was the case. The fact is, 
I betrayed her. And you think she can't swim because of the traumatic experience? I haven't seen her since that day, but yes, I think so. I got a letter from Julie, her mother, after they moved back to England. Julie? In her letter, she mentioned that, was, that, so that was her name. Is that her name? That she refused to even wear a bathing suit. Damn. If she still can't swim, we're in trouble. Level B1 in the core is pretty much flooded. Look, maybe you can help her overcome the trauma. You want me to help her get over it? Well, it's still gonna take some time to repair the cam off. Sorry, kid. Emma's rescue is up to you. Thanks. An underwater mission. Well, this is a first. Look, I'll see what I can do. I suggest that you drum the map of the building into your head, because you won't have time to look at it when you try to bring Emma out. I'm counting on you, Ryden. I covered most of the core when I had to take out the C4s. If there's anything you need to ask me, call me on the Kodak. I'll do that. All right, back to swim. Can't even remember if there are any actual goodies around here. Mm. I'm saying I don't remember. Uh, I, I pretty much found everything that wasn't in the main area. Also, should we should get people a warning for the, the thing coming up. I'll let you decide how to word that. I'm just going to say there's a jump scare coming up. Oh, just, that, yeah. I just wanted yeah, to yeah. Like, give people a heads up before we got to that what? part. All right. What? Alright. Well, mean, I mean, what? it's already out, so... I would, I I know, would I'm feel just teasing. awful I'm just teasing. if... if they didn't get a heads up because I didn't get a heads up and it scarred me for a very long time as a kid really yeah I mean it got me oh, as, just as a just as a jump scare but I didn't wasn't really scarred by the experience no you were you that's because you you had only darkness in your heart no fear <laughs> yeah the darkness of night uh was around my soul and the hunter within was trying to lose control gotta let it out gotta let it out gotta let it out gotta let it out uh i gave chrissy the artist role so that uh she can oh nice go. we'd love to see your artist since you're done chrissy if that's all right with you yes feel free okay is there is it coming up Soon. Okay. I'm just doubling back to make sure I didn't forget anything. Cool beans. And there's a ration there. Yeah, it's coming up. I'm gonna go catch some air right quick and then go for it. Mm -hmm. Uh, yes, little lamb chop. That particular jump scare. Also, welcome to the oh, stream. Welcome, little lamb chop. I'm Smider Roscoe. I'm Jingles Roscoe. We're so, the Rascal Brothers, and now I'm st it's stuck. That's not the way. That's not the way. Walk. Walk. Oh! That's fun. Okay, jump scare. Jump scare. Okay, guys, jump scare time. Here it comes. Just a heads up. Buckle up. It's just like, like now, now that I'm like all grown up and looking at it, I'm like, eh. But he certainly at the time, it, it got us because it's all like, why would that be there? Yeah, exactly. I don't know. You guys let me know if you, uh, if you think that that was just fine or if like, well, even were, with, even with, uh, you were warned about a warning. It. That was still hey, kind of scary. Hey, there's the PSG-1T. Yep. That thing's going to be handy. Best gun in the game. Pretty dang close. I get why you were scared as a kid. Now it's just like, eh. See? Chrissy said, that's a body! It sure is. <sighs> Whatever, guys. I know I'm a baby. I'm still a baby. Had I not known that that was there, even today, I'd have been like, hey, hey, yeah. Ah. Why? Why? Oh, speaking of spookiness. Hey. 
Hey, Duder. What are you doing? <laughs> hey, Vampire. What's up? Still ticking, huh? Unfortunately, have have no vacancies. What is he doing? Channeling Hamon? Probably. The only moments I have to do is get involved in the game is the tunnel. So ride and turn off the game now. It was late at night and I actually turned my PS2 off at the time. That's funny. Uh, please don't put any spoilers in the chat for a lot of the viewers are new. This is going to be kind of goofy, but... Uh, huh, it's the end of the broadcast I was watching. Nope, we're good. They speak out clearly. <laughs> just, don't you dare dab, vamp. Don't you dare dab. <laughs> If that's the case, then he's kind of the progenitor of the... Oh, gosh. The dab. The dab. You knew I was coming? You become a nuisance. I can't let you No, it's fine, Lamb Chubb. You didn't know. Yeah, yeah. We're just letting you know. Yeah. The point is that uh, we are showing this off to Jeez. our fans for yeah. the first time. Yeah. But and we know this game really well. Yeah. The and there's a lot of people catch. that... Despite Crazy how old it is, have not true. seen it. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to tell you about how all this works now. Emma's alive? She was some time ago. But the flooding has become quite serious. I wouldn't be surprised if she's a mermaid now. What? Did you really think killing the president would prevent a nuclear strike? Think again. I didn't do that. I didn't. Do that. <laughs> <laughs> Arsenal is still armed with a purified hydrogen bomb. Purified hydrogen bomb? Here we go. I'm this going to no tell you some stuff weapon. now. This weapon is capable of heavy hydrogen nuclear fusion using lasers so, and magnetics. So, game takes place. 2007. 2007. 2009. Sorry, 2009. Current president. Vamp dads. Has no mm -hmm. So that means he's the first to dab. He was the progenitor the of dabbing. Yeah. Bomb is at an experimental stage and is handled differently. Yeah, but he did it for purpose. He didn't yeah. do it because it, it was popular. Capable when arsenal is activated. I, I want somebody to take Vamp's character model and have him just dab a whole bunch. Oh gosh. We lost everything. He's like an actor, I know. It looks we like I just don't know who Yeah, I'm not color. sure either. We were labeled as killers responsible you for the really want to be confused? Civilians, as well as uh, our allies. And the you should look who the who his actual voice actor is. Phil Lamar? Yeah. Look up what Phil Lamar looks country. like. His voice our actor. Our only goal is to wipe them from the face of the earth and destroy this world of deceit they have created along with them. You're insane. Insane? We might be the only ones telling the truth. Hmm. Final check for activating Arsenal has been completed. All Arsenal personnel report to your stations. He's so smug about it. Well, yeah. it sounds like Arsenal's ready to go into operation. Damn it! You're still hoping that the girl can install that virus you're carrying around, aren't you? You know? <sighs> it's a shame you're not going to be around long enough to hand her the program. That isn't seawater, you know. It's a byproduct of the microbes contained in the pool. Buoyancy is practically non-existent thanks to the high oxygen content. Once you walk in, you don't come up. Take a good look at your grave. I saw a... Uh, Show me what you've got. I saw a post on Reddit that was talking about... Somebody saw an actual uh, warning sign. Mm -hmm. that, was saying, that was describing that. It was all like, the water here has no buoyancy. Mm -hmm. Uh, so if you fall in, there is no coming back up. Yeah. You will just sink. Yeah. And the person that did the post was all like, I don't know what it is, but the idea of water that won't let you float is absolutely terrifying. Yeah, that's, that's the scariest. Oh, jeez. Uh, Little Lamb says, uh, I first knew Phil Lamar from Matt TV. That's where we first hey, knew him. Hey, neat. Us too, yeah. And, and also, then, I guess as Marv from that one movie people like. Uh, also, we knew him from Static Shock. Static Shock. And Samurai Jack. Samurai Jack. Um, 
Justice League. Look at this guy, cartoon. I'm swimming around. Uh, Chrissy says, Vamp is giving me uh, Girahim vibes. Yeah, kind of. Kind of, kind of same basic idea. I don't know if that's it. Ah! <laughs> right, man. Right, right. <laughs> All right, now I'm mad. Now I'm mad. At least I can jam out to yell dead cell again. I shoot you in the face. If you come out of the water, I shoot, shoot you in the face. That was BS. Can't believe I can't believe I didn't have enough control over myself. I messed up. Catch me riding. Get back in the water. Get in the water. 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 Ow. Gotcha. Yeah. Ow. Ah, we're fine. You can, by the way, shoot his knives out of the air. It's just really hard to do. It's easier to do with a cell phone. How come he doesn't sink? Probably ah. for the same reason that he can run on water. It's weird. It's weird. He's a vampire, I guess. He's a vampire. Of course, moving water is supposed to be like their like worst thing ever. Yeah, they're not allowed to run over it. That and they can only enter a house once invited. I don't know what happened. I feel like you should have hit him there. Come back here and fight me, you coward! Coward. You need to fight yeah, me. Yeah, there was like one. Man. Yeah. How are you? Yeah. Vamp tech is weird tech. Yeah, it is. Where are you? I got you. I'm sorry? I think, I think oh might. yeah, he hit my shadow. Can you move? Oh, I guess he missed. Oh, yeah, yeah. At least didn't get a good part of your shadow. I guess so. No. Oh, you're yeah. sorry? <laughs> well, not with that. Yeah. Aiming is tough in this game. Yeah. He just snapped me over the side like I got hit by sniper bullet. Oh, there it is! Yeah! He pins your shadow so you can't move. It's pretty cool.
Whoa! I tried to pin my shadow again. I've seen that. Louis says, just die already! He is a vampire. He could not be killed. It'd be really bad at this game. It's pretty tough. Huh. I guess I ran out. You did. Had no idea. Mm. What the hell happened? Wow. Right. I swear I've you played ready to this try already. that again from the very beginning. So we have no other options. There's people stopped shot. people stopped using uh, uh, game sharks a long time ago. You remember Game Sharks? Of course. I don't even know what the kill count is at. What the death count is at. I think it's like a four. I think so? Uh, something like that. says Metal Gear Death go ah because he went no Chat. 
Olé. Olé. Oh, oh, olé. Oh, oh, oh. Olé, oh, oh, Rio. What's in the middle? Quiet stuff. This one was a sweet one. The second one was a blast. He ran out of, out of oxygen. <laughs> sure did. Amazing. I've never seen him do that. Yeah, man. That's what this grenade does. It knocks down his oxygen levels. Oh! <laughs> I was uh, I was feeling I was feeling very cool there for a second. <laughs> If you're already swinging by the time you come back. Let's give it a try. Would you recommend any music from this song, Spider? This song, Yell Dead Cell, is really good. Uh, you're not Spider, so don't answer. But Jingles gave a really good suggestion. Let's see. I'll post it in the music chat. Yes. Uh, I can't remember if the Smash Bros. version is just... I think the it original might, version, I think or it if is, it's a remix. I think it might be just the original version. Yeah, I doubt it's a remix. <laughs> Sounds right. Yeah, the composition is copyright Konami. Yeah. So I think. Uh, pretty sure it's just the original. It is the original. So I'll post that in the music chat. Yes, Yell Dead Cell is a very good song. Uh, but I would also recommend just the main team as well. Yes, the Metal Gear Solid 2 main team. Yeah. So I just like uh, old drawings I did of you two. I just like, I used to draw so ugly. Take this. So ugly. My body. My body. <laughs> I got one on you, dude. I hit him a little bit. I hit him a little bit. Yeah. Oh, that's it. Oh, dang it. I'm 
I'm gonna die again. Jingles on the helm. I'm not gonna be much better, but uh, fresh pair of eyes may be what we need. Wow, this is holding us up way longer than I anticipated. I'm sorry, guys. I think the troublesome part is that we're going for non lethal. Yeah. Oh, that's always the troublesome part. It's always that fact that you have to reload every shot. <laughs> You're being a little too fancy. Ah, uh, thanks, Chris. But yeah, I'm not. I'm not on the controller right now. Jingles is very disappointing. So. And now I'm gonna have myself lie down. Shot him in his wound. I think so. Because that, that did a lot of damage. It did. I thought I wasn't quite sure what he was doing, but he gave you a little bow. But anyway, you're just one shot away. You got plenty of rash, yeah. so you're good. Oh. Yeah. This is the first time he's done that. Yeah, it's just, yeah, it sort of rushed him through his, his phases. Yeah, I did. That one shot to his pre-existing run was a really good move. My I was just lucky. Yeah. Take this. What? You're free. Get out. More ammo. Oh, M9 is good. Yeah. 
My body. Yeah. My body. sort of juju this dude's pumping out where you're turning all red <laughs> i do not appreciate it i do not enjoy it and uh i don't think he was raised right yeah i don't think his parents loved him and uh, i'm pretty That's sure he's adopted could say, hey, last time, and then I don't know. Mm -hmm. We gotta get him. That is, that is him approaching. <clears throat> Say no ho ho, you're approaching me. You gotta prompt him to jump. Get away, man! 
Have you guys seen any good movies lately? Yeah. <laughs> you guys watching any, any anything fun? Yeah. <laughs> you guys see? You guys see that Onward? No, Onward's a pretty good movie. Got that? Shot. <laughs> What's the last movie you guys have seen? Yeah. What, what was, was the last, last movie? What was you the last guys one seen? we've seen? Kim said the last movie I've seen, the MLP movie. Yeah, that's a door. I actually kind of wanted to watch the MLP movie. I figure it's relatively high on to do this considering how hard you follow the show. Yeah, but I mean, it takes place after one of the seasons. One of the seasons. Oh, which, which yeah. one? One. I don't want to tell you no. Okay. Yeah, fair enough. Christy says, I don't watch movies much, but I think the last one was Bambi. Classic. Ooh. Bambi. <laughs> Bambi. <laughs> okay. I wasn't expecting that. Already uh, catching a mid combo and deciding you don't want to do any of that. Mm -hmm. Oh man. I think you called it early on with the lights, dude. Mm -hmm. Maybe we should have been taking care of those. I feel right foolish now. It becomes near impossible to fight it with the lights on. Yeah. Which was my first time seeing it. Nice. Hey, did you like it? Did you like Did it? you like the Bambi? The Bambo. The great Bambani. Oh, got to turn around. Oh. Yep, I think, oh, I think yeah, the, whole, yeah. the whole thing is yeah, all about the lights. the lights. Because he's not even doing like the, the same thing you move. throw a million knives at you, like yeah. attacks that he was doing before. Literally the secret. That was the secret to his jutsu. Kim said, oh my god, I found the Halloween drawing I did of Luigi's Mansion, Smiter's Mansion. I wish I could remember that. I think it'd be fun to do like Luigi's Mansion uh, for the channel. Yeah. Yeah. Nope. Almost. There we go. Shot his knee. High five. <laughs> High five. If we had Nuggies, I'd say Nuggies in the chat for yeah, Smiter. Yeah, because Jingles no figured it out. <laughs> and well, uh, our hidden boss came by and confirmed my suspicions. Yeah. Well, it would mean it was your idea at first. Well, I started. Yeah. But, well, but we got to give the credit to our hidden boss. For sure. For just looking it up. <laughs> yeah. There. Now he's finally dead. I'm embarrassed. No, oh, it's okay. It's been a long time since we played this game, and we don't even like it as much as the others. Colonel, they've apparently completed the final check procedure for Arsenal gear. It's been Find too long. On it's the been double. six hours. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> the virus Never mind what I said before. You. When you Probably going to have to call it here. It to the computer mm -hmm. room on level B2 in the core of Shell it's been a good one. stream. Yeah, actually. It's almost I mean, five o'clock for us. Aside. Yeah, yeah, it's been pretty good. Big snake, did you catch all that? I didn't make it on time. Arsenal's going active. Yeah, I heard. The hostage rescue's gonna have to wait. I'm going after Emma. We'll secure the computer room. Looks like we can't install the virus program without Emma. Can't your partner do it? I would if I could, but the security for this system is no joke. I need more time. That's why we need her. Understood. But you said that you I'll never sure found a system that you couldn't break reunion. into, Otacon. That's right. Zero out of ten. Yeah. So you're a liar, too. 
Then you should see her, right? I don't have the right to see her. We can talk about this later. Raiden, I think you'd better get moving. Emma's in the locker room to the north, right? I'm okay, on we're it. gonna get her out of the water. Here we go. There we go. Oh, a ration. Thank goodness. Oh, hey, okay, cool. Thank you. We got plenty of those now. Yeah, we do. Blub, blub. Blub, 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 blub. Blub, 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 blub. The old ugly redesign of Smidal's. My old tastes were so bad. You're so mean to yourself, Kimmy. Why did she say my old tastes and like this old art when it's like a year ago? That's how old it is. Listen, Kimmy's a baby. She is. So, like, a year is like a million years to us. <laughs> she said, the, because my art is, like, a lot better now. Your art is getting better. I'm you only saying, keep getting better. I'm not saying that it's not better. I'm just saying that, like, you're using the context of a year to say it's so long ago <laughs> kids are throwing around the words nostalgia without actually like being old enough to have nostalgia mm. That's let's mean. get let's get her first and then and then save uh, and then save and then probably call it Emma, Emma, I read your vital signs, Emma. Emma, is that you? You in there? We need to blow down the door, Emma. I don't hear anything. She I don't must even be dead. hear her breathing. Yeah. Chrissy says, "You guys are like elves, just oh, you baby children." <laughs> And everybody, and then Kim and Tina are all like, "Oh, Smyer just calls everybody kid," and I'm like, "Because you're all younger than me." Yeah, Kimmy says, uh, "For me, it feels like long because it's like very, it's bad, very bad. And I have improved like a lot. Yeah, you keep getting better and better. You're yeah, amazing." She does. She started doing this thing with eyes now that I think are really cool. Oh. Yeah, you really are your brother, your sister. Are yep. you all right? She done and piddled herself, oh, just like Otacon. Jennifer Hale. I excuse me, right. excuse me. Jennifer me Hale out. does like all these like luscious, beautiful women time? voices. Yeah, all these older women. Help. And she's got this little babu doing. Jennifer doing... Hale is Naomi Hunter. Yeah. Here. Hey. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Do you have nanos? What? Well. Do you? I do. Everybody on this project has them. Okay, good. Let's try. Yeah, that thing you've been doing lately, where you've been adding uh, sharper can angles to the lashes, but still maintaining a right. long, a wide round profile too. for the eyes and themselves. You're not one of them. mm -hmm. That's what I've been trying to tell you. And you came to rescue me? Actually, I need your help to stop Arsenal. I understand you're the only one who might be able to do it. And who told you that? The president. Really? I need you to come with me to Shell I can't Mark. hear it. I can't your hear Jim. For you there. Yeah. My brother? She has a lot of voices really well. Come on. We have to get moving. This place will be flooded soon. Kimmy loves her. Hold hand. Wow. They only How just met. lewd. How lewd. Sorry, guys. I didn't know the stream was going to be so lewd. I think we need uh, uh, a, a, a thing that just says lewd real big. Yeah. Uh, get a, a oh, oh, like an emote. An emote for that. Nice. They can't swim. I, get, I can't swim. Now for a cutscene to explain why she can't swim. Right over. Over. Happy birthday, Raven! Right right you can't swim. swim. You can't you swim. Used to love it. How do you know? Your brother told me. He's really Actually, good. I'm only rescuing right. because He's I need to, to use your you. brain. So you. if only you, you could place your brain in my hands. <laughs> Chrissy you said, "Whoa, NSFW warning, please." We're gonna. We just became affiliated, and we're gonna get kicked off of 
uh, Twitch. I have a Twitch for inappropriate Emma, content. We can go yeah. over all that later, but first we have to get out of If here. only one of us no, was an attractive young Mark. woman. It's hopeless. Yeah. Then they then they'd be fine. Then we'd be banned for like a day, yeah. and then we'd be back swim. on. Yeah. You can do it. No, wait, I don't I even can't. know if we get banned. We Come just on. get like a Deep strong reprimand. You yeah. know you can swim. I can't keep my eyes open in the water. Endless blue. The water it, it wants me. It won't let me go. <laughs> oh my goodness, then Emma. Close your eyes. I'll guide you. I, I was injected with something. My legs. I love floating in water. I love swimming. Them. Listen, Emma. Just hold your breath. Wait. I'll do the rest. Hold your breath. First, we'll head to filter chamber two. Then we'll take a break. And all I have to do is hold my breath. That's right. That's right. How long? Just a little while. Are you sure? Of course I'm sure. That's how I got here. <laughs> I don't think I can do it. I'm not good at holding my breath. Look, Emma. I have an idea. Here's my idea. Here's my idea. Help you get over your fear. Oh, deep Kim found a picture sea. of Magical Girl Snyder. And listen to my heart. That's right. Your heart. He's all like, I'm so pretty. Don't think about anything oh, else. Prettiest girl of the ball. 100. Open your eyes. By that time, you'll be on the other side. Give me a signal if you think you're running out of breath. What will you do then? I'll swim fast. <laughs> <laughs> Are you ready for the best escort mission in all of video games? Oh lord, she's tiny! Hang on tight. She a bad. She got that one little plume on her head. Mm. Okay, let's Hang go. on, Pee Wee. I'm closing my eyes. Take some deep breaths. One. Two. Three. Dagnabbit. What is it? Uh, let me take off my glasses. You know, you should wear contacts. There's nothing wrong with my eyes. Hmm? I wear them for show. Uh, Trying to be different from the other girls? No, it's not like that. I like glasses. <laughs> Kimmy went, load! <laughs> Chrissy went, whoa! No, somebody more important. Anyway, they bring me luck. I see. Okay, let's go. Whoa. There we go. Okay, here, here we, we go. go now. I'm gonna swim now. Hopefully she doesn't freak out and try to kill me. See? So far so good. One. <laughs> One. All right, first part done. Kim said that would be my reasoning for wearing glasses. Yep. <laughs> Chrissy says, moving a little fast, aren't we? <laughs> <laughs> I apologize in advance for this. Wow, bro. I know. I'm somebody, sorry. somebody, put a sensor bar over the screen, please, <laughs> for this lewd hand holding. I don't know if you can tell, but I just got done with a really annoying boss fight. It was really annoying. Alright, let's relax it's and take streaming. a seat. Gebs is still streaming. We'll go and raid him in a bit. How's that sound, guys? You did good. I concentrated on your heartbeat. It reminded me of when I was a kid. Just one ten. <laughs> Each one ten. Kimmy needs glasses, though. I remember my brother giving me Look, a it's Kim. back ride. Oh. I was sleeping Early hair and everything. His back. I could hear his heartbeat. Sounds like yeah, you were close. Like, yes, right, right, right. Back then, we were stepchildren in our parents' See, Kim. second marriages. Wherever my brother went, I used to tag along. My brother didn't have any close friends, so he used to take care of me. <laughs> she said, what, what do you we both mean? <laughs> to be loved so much. So much that we used to pretend. She's got the blonde hair. Yeah, Early. She's just adorable. She's a bad 
Betsy and see a bad boo. It was always just make believe. We were only kids. You know what I mean. I never had a family, but I think I know what you mean. <laughs> she went, oh. <laughs> Jiggle Spider, go! <laughs> We've secured Emma. Bryden, what's your status? Colonel? <laughs> yes. I got Emma Emmer here. We managed to we avoid managed to drowning. drowning. <laughs> good job. That's Get her such over a good line. As soon as you can. I love it's it. It's going to be hard with the connecting bridge on the upper level destroyed. Didn't Olga say something about taking the oil fence? I want that as a donation L. quote. Yeah. I remember we managed that. to you avoid drowning. Oh man, maybe I can talk to um, Shaman and uh, She's commission her to something. make she more can't walk without any uh, help. sprites. Take more sprites her with you. Oh, please. Free your hands of any equipment and hold down the yeah, action button I will to give her the a hand. Of you. To release your grip on her, take your finger off the action button. Emma can sit and wait until you help her back up. And be careful. You won't be able to use any weapons while you're leading her. Now head for Strut L. We're on our way. Alright, I'm gonna get her through this next uh, yeah. part, like the next water part, and I think we're gonna right. call it. We've infiltrated mm -hmm. the computer room. What's your situation? Emma's safe. We're heading your way. Ah, <sighs> good job. Shell One's deserted. Looks like everybody's aboard Arsenal. I had a look at the system, but there's nothing I can do. EE's e. our only hope. Right. I'll put her on then. My auto huh? huh? EE? E. How? I'll use my codec as a relay. I know you just uh, said that you and your sister haven't is. gotten along in years. So here you go. Oh. Uh, e, e, is that you? How? E, e. Um, why are you involved with Metal Gear? Huh? You knew our family's dark history and still got involved? What's wrong with you? I should have known. Answer me. Why are you repeating the same mistake? I, I wanted to hurt you. I wanted to see you suffer. E -E? You abandoned me. No, that's not what happened. All right, that's enough. <laughs> okay, get, good. I'm can gonna, we get some pod champs in the in the <laughs> chat, please? <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna do one for for enough for what just happened. Right big right. revelation. That's not what this is. We haven't got time for this, Ryden. Right. Get some pod champs in right now. I, I. Gotcha, Snake. I'll head over there with Emma. Most of the enemies aboard oh. Arsenal, but I suggest you be careful. Make sure Emma gets here in one piece. Raiden, take care of my sister. Don't worry, I'll get her there. All right, time to swim again. Come on, Pee-wee. Time to go. This is my maximum speed, by the way, guys. Yeah. <laughs> Phone call. Oh, I know. Answer the phone while you're um, laying on the ground. Just accepting it all. <laughs> Smite Roscoe. Yeah. Be careful. Play more mines. mines. Yep. Indivisible Claymore mines. Who took the time to plant these here? <laughs> In the time that. The, it's probably Vamp. Oh, you can't even pick them up? No. Oh, I think I just gotta go around the other side. Oh yeah, they just go around the other one. That oh. is so rude. How rude. Sorry, Emma, let's go this way. All right, Emma, for, come on. I apologize for getting this all blowed up. Louis says, I like how I say Junior is my best boy, uh, but yet I don't mend him. Let me fix that. <laughs> You can try, uh, BJ is kind of weird in, uh, Smash Ultimate. He's considered not a very high-tier character. But, uh, he's Emma, fun. But yeah, Snake don't let that stop you. Shell One's computer room. I mean, Snake was, uh, I've got considered this that the pretty gave. low in, uh, this in other circuits. A virus that can but, I mean, <laughs> people just, <laughs> people just, like, we need try their to. best and they get better with this them. Is, but, well, Snake is, is considered, like, really high now. What? Yeah, he is. Why did the president give it to you? Did something happen to the president? You remember? President. He's dead. What? Remember that thing that happened five minutes ago? You actually wrote this virus? 
Louis it's says, what really you mean? I think I play Terry it's well, like a well just not as good it's as my banjo. A I, did, I didn't say Thomas anything about that. It's designed to invade GW Cerebrum and render its nerve connections useless. You know what I'm saying? Is? BJ's kind of, of a weird character. Not a lot of people it. use him. Huh? You look surprised. Uh, well. Cat got your tongue? I'm sorry. I... How about the Patriots? Ever heard of them? Yes, but I only know what I've been told. Can you tell me what you know? Um, oh, there's sure. going to be a huge data dump. Words. This is a dump right here. Right. Ugh, never mind. We're probably going to have to call it after this. Kim says, Smarter Chew, Smarter Chew, Smarter Chew, but from a few months ago. The president said that arsenal gear was the Patriots' key to supremacy. That's as good a description as any. What exactly is it? It's a massive data processing system capable of controlling information on a global scale. A data processing oh, system? Yeah, she posted it in That's the right. The start. system's a social device for maintaining the Patriots' control. It's cute. You lost me. Well, in this day and age, information emerges from every direction and is freely distributed. A variety of information gathered by servers employing the latest in high-speed communication networks and P2P technology is rapidly circulated to individuals. In fact, the speed of this circulation process is accelerating on an almost daily basis. The Patriots seem to be afraid of this development. Apparently, they believe that their role will shift from dominant to dominated. But let me give you an example. You're aware of Solid Snake's anti-Metal Gear activities, aren't you? Yeah, I know a little about it. Well, that's just a small sample of uncontrolled information. I can guarantee you the Patriots did not want Solid Snake's name publicized. Now, look at it like this. Political scandal, corporate corruption, up until now, the Patriots have managed to keep a lid on these and other self-serving events. But with their existing data processing system, they're no longer able to effectively control the flow of information generated at the individual level. With the newly created system, they can fully regulate digital information. High-level information can be categorized in stages, given clearance levels, and deleted as necessary, never to be seen by the public. By deleting such information, the Patriots can shape the course of history as they see fit. Somebody's bound to catch on. No, oh, the memory capacity, not to mention the lifespan of the average individual, is extremely limited. On the other hand, digital information lasts virtually forever. It doesn't deteriorate. So? The alphabet. 26 letters, right? It could have been 30 letters. What if the four deleted letters were controlled by a program? Impossible. It's not. In fact, something similar is already underway. Do you know how many genes exist in an individual? About 30 to 40,000? Right. That's what was announced at the turn of the century. But there's actually 100,000 according to the original theory advanced by the scientific community. Information regarding the remaining 60,000 was suppressed by the Patriots. No. Why? How would you know? Do you know what a gene looks like? Did you count them yourself? There are research organizations. Of course. And their reports have already been subtly altered. They're even beginning to believe the doctored reports. GW is a system that allows the Patriots to decide what will be recorded in tomorrow's history. So what we're talking about is one huge censorship system for deleting information which might be inconvenient to the Patriots. Exactly. The actual physical core for handling the task, GW, is installed in Arsenal. It's the only system in the world with an optic neural AI that has a parallel processing capacity of 980 trillion hammocks. I suppose that being a specialist in neural AI and complex logic played a significant role in your association with the Metal Gear project. That's not the only reason. That's right. What do you mean? <sighs> I guess there are plenty of other reasons. Yes, there are. I understand. Do you? So Arsenal Gear was actually designed to protect the GW system, wasn't it? Um, yes. It's armed with everything, including nuclear weapons, and is fully equipped with cyber-terrorist countermeasures. Physically and logically, it's the ultimate fortress for housing GW. But is the AI actually capable of controlling everything? No. GW is only the system's core. It's only for deciding what data is stored or deleted. The actual subsystem for executing the task exists within our social structure. What? Do you remember the panic that gripped the computer industry prior to the end of the century? You mean the Y2K problem? Yeah, problems? Y2K. You guys remember right. that? If this game call, came out a year after that. <laughs> ...with a countermeasure program, using the internet at full capacity. 
The program was distributed to every governmental organization, every key facility throughout the world. In addition, the same program was included in an OS application for distribution among the public. Let me guess. The Y2K countermeasure contained a program designed by the Patriots. Yes, and everything supplied from that day onward contains the same program. Impossible. Do you know how a computer operates? Do you really know the basic principles on how data is exchanged? <laughs> uh, do you no know how programming works? There's a subsystem in place, and it's about to be activated. Is that why Solidus wants to burn out every electrical circuit in Manhattan with a nuclear blast? Probably. But the overall system isn't actually complete. What? It still lacks the necessary factors for judging situations. I heard they were planning a major experiment in the next few days to provide complex data for GW to study. And suddenly all this happens. Emma, it's not your fault. If it wasn't for the terrorists... Yeah, you're right. Well, I think that's about all I know. Right. Uh, thanks. I think we'd better head for the computer room. Sorry, I My fell asleep. What happened? Room. Is he safe? Mm, BJ isn't that hard. His that side be, be the, a crazy one. Excuse me, I he's be a careful parrot. before I esteem he's myself. My yes, friend. please. My only friend. Well, the bird's okay. Good. Oh, yes, the bird. Did you know that in the old days, miners used to take a canary into the mine shafts to detect toxic gas? That's what he's for? No. I really needed someone to talk to. Right. I think we'd better get moving. We've got a little longer to cover than the last time. I'll give it my best. Whatever you do, don't open your eyes. Why not? A dead body, not a pretty sight. Oh. Poor guy. Once we get past it, it'll be too dark to see anything. <laughs> Kim goes, bird, 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 bird. What are those sticks in your head? These? They're lacquered chopsticks. They hold your hair in place. Did you know that they're pretty popular in Europe and South America? Can't say that I do. You're not only cute, but smart too. Oh, oh I'm much more than cute. Okay, let's go. Hey, that had nothing to do with anything. No, it established everything. <laughs> That's it. That's the secret to the Patriots. That's right. Alrighty. I'm gonna save. I need a break. I need a nap. Yeah, right. What can I do for you, Jack? It's past five o'clock. I don't know. We're calling it. <laughs> Kim says, hey, right, and you have a freaking GF. <laughs> yeah. And Chris is like, damn, right. <laughs> Oh, remember how flirty Snake was? I've always been alone. Oh. Huh? I'm so lonely. Oh. Oh. Rose. Oh, always. man. Not always. What do you oh. mean? You've never slept beside me. What are you talking about? I... After we've been together in my room, you stay awake all night, or you head for the door. Is this really the time <laughs> to bring this up? <laughs> Why, Jack? Why? Listen, Rose, I'm right in the middle of a mission. This is one of the biggest reasons why, why people aren't why as in on this game me? as the others. Look, the mission, I... Why don't you open up to me? Rose, I, I just can't. I feel bad for this voice actress. I hope she didn't get any stuff for this. I don't think so. I just wanted to find you by my side when I woke up. Is that asking too much? It's the night. I'm scared of the night. It's got nothing to do with you. Scared of the night? What's that supposed to mean? I can't relax when I'm with someone. Jack, you wouldn't even let me in your room. I need privacy. I just can't be bothered. Bothered? Wrong word. What I wanted to say was that there are certain things that I have to keep to myself. Do you remember that time I forced my way into your room? We'd known each other for almost a year, and you blew up. It was the first time you ever raised your hand against me. I was so worried about you. Look, I'm sorry. It wasn't your violent nature that scared me. It was your room, your heart. Stop it. Stop it. There wasn't anything in your room. Only a bed and a small desk. It looked like a prison cell. Rose? 
No television set. No family pictures. Not even a poster. That face when uh, a I only use that room for really sleeping. Bad a lifeless and room. You're trying to do is have dinner. Almost like your empty heart. That's why I tried to keep you out. I thought I was beginning to understand you. Mm. Until I saw that room. Would you have been happier if I had a picture of you hanging on the wall? That's not what I was trying to say. Enough, Rose. We'll talk about this later. After the mission. Right. After the mission. I understand. I bet you guys didn't know we were going to also be watching a marriage story. Sheesh. <laughs> With Adam Driver and Scarlett Johansson's marriage falling apart. Ugh. That's a good note to leave it on. Is it? <laughs> Are we ready? Yeah, we gotta shut it down, dude. Okay. I thought you were gonna go through the last bit of water. Yeah, and then I ran. Well, yeah, we can. Yeah, do it no, next. we can. You wanna do it? No? Let's just get it over with. Let's just let's just get this last bit of water. Kim says, with. "I don't like this." Rose, get your head together. Let the man be. She wasn't kidding, she could not hold her breath. Hey Pete. Hey Pete. Sorry, Pete. Oh, not dead, nabbit. Makes me wish I could swear. Just, just remember the Gorilla Munch Gorilla. There is no need to be upset. We're not gonna make it. We made it. We made it. It's gone on chat. Tim said, I wish I could swear, too. You guys should cool it with all the swearing. Gosh. Both of you. You swear all the time whenever we're not on air. Yeah. Why is it so hard to not swear? It's not that I'm saying... If it was hard for me to not swear, I'd be swearing. But I'm not. Right now, you're not. Yeah. And it should show you how much self-control I have. Mm, you've had less in the past. So that just doesn't mean anything. No, I'm just I'm just using past examples here. Get out of here, man. Let's. Jeff, is that you? I got your giant lighter than as dark as I need it to be. Oh. Mm -hmm. Let's ro let's see. Uh, Rose and Jack have their spat. Um, Jack, about trying to break into your room. Rose, just forget about it. No, I'm gonna move it to over to stream I ending. I said I did it okay. because I was worried about you, but well, you're it gonna wasn't see just this. that. I was suspicious. I thought there might be someone else. 
someone else. Oh, Another woman. Rose. I really <sighs> thought so, because sometimes you're so horribly cold. You know I wouldn't. I'm serious. Sometimes I feel like you're pushing me away. So I... Did you get in? Yeah. Are you satisfied now? There wasn't anyone there, was there? No. No, there was no one there. There was absolutely no one in your room. Not another woman. Not me. Not even you. Rose. I'm sorry. I just wanted to wow. apologize, that's all. Talk to you later. These guys... I'll tell you what. Rude people. But that's where we're going to go ahead and call the stream for today. We got six and a half hours like you were trying to get. Mm -hmm. We didn't mean to take long in certain Boo. parts. But, but Boo, Indy. Boo. Boo, Indy. But All right. we made it through. We don't, Hopefully it'll be next weekend that we keep this up. Yeah, we'll see. We'll see. Because uh, I don't know if we have any other plans. Yeah. In the meantime, I'll work on uh, getting some like emotes and other goodies Those going. That'll be fun. That'll be fun. So uh, yeah, we will check you guys later. Yes, we'll go ahead. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, do uh, rating Streaming or rating or. I'm gonna I'm gonna get Gebs's channel ready. Okay. Okay. Here we go. All right. See you guys later. Bye, everyone. Bye bye.